Good Saturday morning, everybody. I'm Kevin from Palmetto Cats, and this morning we have day one of the Iron Cat Lady Angler Challenge. Welcome to everybody in chat. Uh, I know everybody's probably still on that commercial, but uh, when you come in, welcome. And uh, we have a great show for you tonight. We have a bunch of prizes today. We have a bunch of, uh, we have eight ladies that are registered for today. And I have an awesome co-host who I'm going to bring up now. And that's Miss Becca Muttrip0715. Good morning. Good morning. How y'all doing? Good. How's the weather out there in Texas? Hot. <laughs> Hot. H-A-W-T. <laughs> <laughs> I mean, it's well, over the hundred, so... Man, well, we're lucky this morning. It's it's a nice, cool 60 degrees here this morning. I'm not sure how long that'll last, but we'll see. All right, well, let's let's get started. I'm uh, So as soon as that trailer started playing, I told the ladies they could throw in because that was officially 8 o'clock. And we've already got Lori Ann. You see her down there casting her line in. She says she's been excited because the fish have been jumping. We got Iron Cat champion, Miss Bex. Down there, she's getting uh, thrown in. Looks like she may have Vani with her. It looks like it. Can't tell. It's still a little dark over there. Miss Sharina's keeping it real. Is out there keeping it real. <laughs> Good morning. Hey. <laughs> yeah, Miss Amy from Three Plus One Outdoors, and there's her Joey back there sitting there not doing a thing, and he better not. <laughs> But support, I, support, obviously. It, it's hard to sit here. Yeah. I'm going to have to lift him up today. <laughs> <laughs> we got Miss Pontoon Jody. Uh, she's dealing with the fog there on the Tennessee River this morning. She's here. And then we have Miss Alicia. she got her camera off right now, but she's here. I already saw Missy this morning. She's getting set up. And uh, the only other person I haven't seen is Miss Chrissy Brown. So hopefully she'll be able to join us here soon. But it's time to fish. The four hours begins now, ladies. You have four hours to catch a catfish 16 inches or over. And there's Miss Missy right there. Good morning. So they have, uh, just to tell everybody in chat, just to remind everybody, just like the other iron cats, the ladies have the first four hours to catch their first fish, 16 inches or over, catfish. If they don't catch one in the first four hours, then they are out. And uh, and then the second two hours will be they have to catch another fish. And then after that two hours, they have to catch one every hour. Last lady standing is the winner for Saturday. And good Wait. luck to all of y'all. Yes, good Kevin, luck. Thank you, Miss Becca. Casting out, Rock. Oh, yeah, go ahead. Do us a favor, Missy. Come back and turn your camera so we can see what you're doing. Um, I can hear Becca, but I can't hear you very well, Kevin. That's interesting. Are you trying to say I'm loud? No, <laughs> my camera or my can you see me now? really here. <laughs> I can see you there, but when whenever you walk off, I can't see you. All I see is mountains and trees. I'm, bait, I'm baiting up. I'll, I'll be right as soon as I get it baited up. Okay. <laughs> All right. We got a bunch of awesome people in chat already this morning. Thank you all for joining us. Is it even 7 o'clock? Yeah, go ahead, and, go ahead and cast out, Sharina. I guess you'll have to talk to Sharina, Becca. <laughs> Hi, Miss Sharina. Hey there, girl. What? I said, hey there. Hey. You ready? I'm going to get my stuff ready. What? I, are you ready? I think. Well, it's you better be. <laughs> yeah, it's time to it's time to fish. Get Is your, it? get your, yeah. So I'm guessing it's seven o'clock, right? It's, it's past seven. Yeah, go ahead. Oh, it's no, five minutes. I better get some bait in the water. <laughs> <laughs> well, Miss Becca, do you want to say some hey to people in chat? I sure do. We got Aaron, Catfish Regulators. We got Miss Darlene Perry, John Boy's Catfishing, Mr. Sean with Snake River, Martin over in the UK, Fishing with Rob, Smack, 
Whisker Pig Fishing. We got Mr. Gene Tillman, Stonefly 71, Kara Ellinger. We got Mr. Chris, Hooks and Hammocks. Of course, Mr. Cody with 3 Plus 1 Outdoors. We also have, let's see, Mr. Eric Burnside, Phyllis Jones. We got Mr. Larry Oliver, Mr. Dan, Green Machine Outdoors, Mr. Derek Stein. We also got Mr. John, Real Time Catfishing. Let me see if I can find out, figure out who that is. Yeah, it was Sharina. Mr. Dan is in here with Dan's Creations and Adventures. Miss Rebecca and Mr. Jamie are in here. Let's see who else is in here. Mr. Mike Chavez, welcome, welcome. Oh, did, is that, is Mr. William Pork Chop. I love that name, by the way. Yeah, pork I don't know if it's just because I like pork, you know, <laughs> or, or what. But I like William Warner. I like that pork chop. Uh, the Bandit. Uh oh, it all went up on me. Uh, you got Mr. Lyle, Catfish Weekly. We got Mr. Ricks, TX Tiger, Silver Fox Fishing, Sandy. Let's see, Flat Rock Flatheads. Oh, there's a lot of people in here. Carolina Real Screamers, Laughing Catfishing, Mr. Mike Irvin, Mr. Dale Hayslip. How you doing? Do you see anybody you missed? Nope. I think you did a great job getting everybody. Sharina, I muted you because we we're getting feedback. Fish! Where? Uh-oh, we already got our first fish on. And I did miss. I missed Mr. James Kirkpatrick. He's in here, too. Oh, wow! Oh, and just so you know, the bandit frockster, that is a girl. Yeah. Yep. <laughs> I learned that last weekend. <laughs> All right. Looks like Beck's got her first fish on. No real surprise there from no real loss. We knew she was going to hit it hard there on the banks of the Potomac, so we'll see if it's 16 inches. Looks like it might be. Looks like she's got Steven in there uh, on the channel, rooting her on. There's Fishing Local 336 as well. There's the first one, y'all. First fish of the tournament. You measure it. Um, Bonnie, do you want to grab that blue measure? All right. And if you put it down on the ground and turn the camera to show them. Oh. And we're just doing this uh, just to show y'all. I mean, that's obviously a 16 inch fish or, or over, but we want to measure it so you can see what a 16 inch fish kind of looks like. Not what I meant. Whoops. Come on, it's little a Slippery, slimy one. <laughs> slippery, slimy one. Whoops, I can't. That, there we go. So this is night. Why are you moving your tail, bud? Because it's a fish. It wants to swim away. 20 inches. Yep. So um, any fish bigger than that, Bex, you definitely don't have to measure. Um, right. There's one on the board there. Bex has got a 20 inch or so far, and I'll put a little dash there, and I'm sure Miss Mud Tramp. Miss Becca is going to keep track of those two. Awesome Good job. Morning. Congratulations. All right. And then she, I think maybe uh, we hit the button on accident. <laughs> There's Miss Pontoon Jody getting all them rods in the water. No real losses. First on the board. We got 72 people joining us today already. This early in the morning. Thanks for everybody coming in. Really appreciate it. And to show my thanks, we're going to go ahead and do our first giveaway for all our early risers. We got Mr. Austin in here with Kentucky Redneck Outdoors. There's Miss Chrissy popping in. 
Mr. Wayne is now in the house. No, Missy's got her a goldfish. Check that out, y'all. That's a cool bait. Oh, she walked away. Dang, I missed it. Does that kind yeah. of look, is that a little orangey looking? Oh, oh, hold on. I'm coming back. She's coming back. Goldfish, y'all. Check that out. Oh, wow. Oh. Awesome. Just a reminder, uh, ladies, if y'all have anybody else with you, make sure that if they have the stream up on their phone that that's muted, that they have the sound turned down. How you doing, Miss Chrissy? We're getting set up. We got a little delay. We didn't realize it was a rocky area at the bank. <laughs> no problem. Be safe. Take it easy. Uh, turn your phone. Turn your phone sideways for me. Yeah. Uh, you got your screen lock on. Boom! We got our first super sticker from uh, mm -hmm. Snake River Catfish Lair. Ninety-nine cents. Thank you, sir. We appreciate that. That'll help with all the shipping, definitely. Miss Lacey with Fish and Chick has now come in. Wow. Awesome. Mr. Well, Tully. I'm not sure if Mike Turner's in here, but Mike Turner sent me some stickers, and we're going to give away a set right now. I can't here's what they look turn. like. We got a oop, his uh, logo sticker I can't get my friend to right here, and he's also got... A reaper stick. It turns, but this time it's not. Those are pretty cool. So we're going to give away a set of those Mike Turner stickers. Boom! Super sticker. Wayne Huska. Thank you very much, sir. Appreciate that. Appreciate that. Appreciate that. Okay. Yep. You're good now, Chrissy. Welcome, JoJo. Awesome. We so got we're going to give away. On. Fish on. Man, Bex is killing it already. Hey, I'm going to have go. to mute it while I use my um, my motor for a minute. Go for it. Okay. Or can you mute me, or do I need to do it? Or... You can, I do, can it. do it. You can do I it. just can't see my screen. Gotcha. Yeah, I can't see you either. Yeah. Well, right, we got there, Flowers. Second fish on. I'll mute you. Go ahead. Look at Vonnie down there. That's a trooper. Vonnie is down there on her rear end and net that fish. Isn't that awesome, y'all? <laughs> Bex is tearing it up already. Jay Fox Hunter's in the house. So is Wild Turkey. There's Mr. Mark with Catfish and Crappie. Morning, Mark. We got real time catfishing with another super chat. $4.99. Thank you so much, John. Appreciate that. Hey, Bex, I told you no chicken. <laughs> <laughs> Good luck. Good luck getting her not to use chicken. I hear you. That's a, that's a bigger fish right there. Can you see the rock there? Uh, well, I got Bex on solo layout right now. She caught a fish, so give me one second. Nice. Nice one. Yeah, bigger. Look at those do, eyes. Don't. Do you want to? Yeah, I know. That's crazy. I know. Have y'all ever noticed that, that catfish kind of have dreamy eyes? They sure do. <laughs> I'm going to go ahead and get this lovely little lady back in the water. Do you want to weigh it for biggest fish? Do I want to yeah. weigh it for biggest fish? Sure. Go ahead and weigh it. I'll, I'll uh, just take your time. All right, so Bex definitely is moving on to round two already. Boom, Texas Tiger with a $5 super chat. Thank you so much, Texas Tiger. We appreciate it. All right, y'all, we're going to give away a set of stickers from Mike Turner Fishing. And I'm going to put that up on the chat right now. For all you early risers who came in here, already this morning and that is hashtag Mike T hashtag Mike T and remember you need to enter it just as it appears on the screen or it will not count your entry we got Miss Rachel Ambry saying go team Alicia did I hear I heard something what was it Bex hold on my thing is uh Hating my life. Oh, I hear a bell. 
Uh oh. This one is. Come on. This is where the creek comes in. It's saying, like, it's not locking for me. I can't read it. I'll trust so it. you guys even see my polls. <laughs> it's seven, and then I wasn't able to. That's the first best vote. It's seven, and my uh, gripper is point three. Okay. Fish on. Man. <laughs> Bex is killing it. She's on fish number three. Fish on. So I saw it. 6.9. Yeah. I would say 6.7, though. I don't yeah. know. Six point seven. Yeah, she said her. Yeah, she said her grippers are point three. Oh, oh, I'm sorry. Six point seven. Gotcha. It was a snag. Okay. All right. So right now, total fish. We got two by Bex and and uh, Vonnie over there. No real loss. And the big fish so far is six point seven. Both blue cats. But we're just getting started, y'all. There's gonna be lots more fish caught. Right now, we're doing a giveaway. A, a pair of Mike T stickers, a pack, if you will. Hey, it Mike, is a fish. It is a fish. <laughs> Becca, is is best keeping us on our toes today, or what? I'm telling you. I mean, what's it's only it's only been like 15 minutes. Hey, Lori. <laughs> I enlarged the rock. Like, oh, hey. hey. <laughs> <laughs> We just wanted to see your smiling face. <laughs> Boom, Mike Turner with a $10 super chat. He said, good luck, everybody, or everyone. Thanks, I mean, Mike that's, T. That's averaging like one fish every five minutes. Yeah. <laughs> Fishing with squirrel is in the house. Bonnie is being an excellent net person. This fish is uh, bigger than 16 inches, but smaller than the last one. Okay. But I'll show you. Yeah, we definitely want to see it. Uh, so Snake River is asking to toss one of his stickers. We sure will, buddy. Carton Down Under is here from Australia. Come, Mr. Jeremy. Yes, Bex is on fire. Silver Fox Fish and Sandy said Bex is on fire. Boom! The bandit frogster. She donated <laughs> some posting. <laughs> I'm rating if okay. Absolutely. <laughs> Make sure you get your hashtag in there, everybody. Hashtag Mike T, just as it appears on the screen, to win a set of Mike Turner stickers. There is the lovely Miss Anna. There it is. Yeah, she just left me. She's on the way to work. Fish number right. three. Nice fish. Nice. All right. Hit them, hit them. <laughs> All right. We are, for anybody who's new, we are, uh, this is a strictly CPR tournament. If you're not sure what CPR means, that's catch, picture, or photo, release. <laughs> All <laughs> the fish... What's that? I told Beck, she was, I told her that night, she was not allowed to eat chicken. <laughs> <laughs> I told her that she was not allowed to eat chicken. <laughs> uh, well, yeah, so uh, Missy Missy told Beck she couldn't use chicken. Missy, I don't think Beck's listened to Missy, but uh, she's on the board with three. But, yes, just to get back to CPR, if you're not sure what that means, if you're new to the to – the, family uh, on these tournaments even though you could legally keep these fish and eat them um, just for teaching purposes we're trying to teach everybody that you don't have to keep every fish you catch that it's okay to uh, to fish for fun so uh, that's what we're doing CPR we're releasing all these 
and uh, just to preserve the population, try to teach the younger generation and some of the older generation. That's okay. Uh, like my dad, <laughs> not to keep every fish. <laughs> were y'all were you raised like that, Becca? Were you? We you always, yeah, we always kept, kept everything. everything. Yeah, yeah, because if they were really tiny or whatever, we just cooked them whole. That's right, whole fryers. Yeah, we do have another team of Alicia fan that's silver fox fishing, Sandy. All right. Looks like Sharina's having some connectivity issues. Hopefully, she gets that figured out. She keeps popping in and out. We oh, got snap. fishing with Big Mike. <laughs> Picking on Papa Palmetto. <laughs> Nothing I wouldn't say to his face. All right, let's give away these stickers, why don't we? We got 41 people entered in to the sticker giveaway. And uh, like I said, that is for two stickers from Mike Turner. And those look like this. That's the Reaper sticker, which is pretty cool. And then uh, his logo, Mike Turner Catfishing. Mike Turner 712 Catfishing. All right, here we go. Let me get rid of my ugly mug here. Yeah, they don't make me big. <laughs> <laughs> All right, here we go. We're going to spin this and draw. Let's see who the lucky winner is. And we have another Team Alicia fan, Big Slim 91. Man. <laughs> Look at all that support. Flat Bonnie. Rock Flatheads, congratulations. You want a mic. Oh, you know what else I wanted to do? And I forgot to do it. And I'll do it now retroactively. Miss Becca, I'll be right back. You hold down the fort. Okay. Let's see. Uh, welcome, Mr. Michael Murillo. I didn't say hi to you. Uh, let's see who else. Where? Hey there, girl. Hey. You got you got a lot of fans out here. Oh yeah, I heard you a little bit. My motor was kind of loud, so I didn't quite hear it all. But yeah, uh, you got uh, a lot of fans going. You know, I mean, everybody's telling you know everybody kind of good luck, but we yeah. got some team Alicia's for sure. Well, that's awesome. <laughs> So I, I got a lot of hats. I've been lucky enough to either purchase some or people have sent them to me. And uh, so I wanted to wear a hat from every sticker person that I had. So there's Mike T representing. I'll wear it right now since I forgot. <laughs> so Mike T, uh, so that was uh, Flat Rock Flatheads. Josh, send me an email, palmettacats at gmail.com. And uh, I'll get those stickers out to you soon. All right. Cool. Country boy catfishing's in here. He's at work today. But he stopped in to, you know, give us a little sport. We appreciate that. Motor red. Yeah, I had to motor on to get this hat. <laughs> All right. Let's see if anybody's down in the basement here that's not up on screen. Nope. There's Sharina again popping in and out. Sharina, what's going on? Can she hear us? Doesn't sound like it. Hello. Hi. Hello. Can you guys hear and see me? No. We can, but you keep popping in and out. Miss right. Frogster. Miss Frogster oh. is another Team Alicia fan. Fish on. Fish on. Look at Bonnie. Woo! Get it, Bonnie. We got another super sticker. Wayne, who's got $2? Boom, 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 boom. <laughs> Mr. Tim Aline is in the house. I sing all the time, squirrel. All the time. Whether people like it or not. <laughs> You know, I do that too. I mean, I'm not very good at it, but I love to sing. Me neither. <laughs> Mike, Big Mike, man, Big Mike caught a 60. It looked like it was in the 60s the other night from the bank, which isn't too surprising. But he, he tore it up the other night. Congratulations, Big Mike. That was an awesome fish. Wait a minute. Let me make sure it's going to go sideways. There's another fish from No Real Loss. 
She said she's going to keep her um, Iron Cat title. She's going to win another one. <laughs> I win that. Well, she's definitely off to a good start. That's for sure. That's fish number four. Good job, Bonnie. I remember when they first started, Bonnie would just sit behind the camera. Now she's out there reeling in fish. <laughs> I think Bonnie might enjoy it more than Bex now. <laughs> yeah, all right. <laughs> Congratulations. That is a good one. What's that? Want us to measure him? If you think it's if you think it weighs more than the the six pounder, then yeah, but it doesn't look like it. I think it does, but I'm gonna weigh it for Bonnie. But you guys, okay. if I speak, I'll let you know. Cool, awesome. Well, there you go, y'all. That's number fish number four. Six pounds. Six <laughs> pounds. Six pounds. All right. Yeah. So, a little short. Hunting. All right, well, let's go around the horn. Let's see where everybody's fishing. Uh, well, the, let's see. Missy looks like she's uh, all set up, so let's go to Missy. Hey, Missy. So where are you fishing? We know you're in West Virginia, but where did you decide on the fish? I'm fishing on the new river called Say it one more time. I said, I'm fishing on, uh, on Brooks River. Okay. Uh, Brook, Brook Falls, just below, or yeah, just below the uh, Hinton, and it's just above Sandstone Falls. Nice. Okay. Awesome. Well, what bait are you fishing with today? Chicken? <laughs> no, I'm not. I mean, I'm not against people using chicken because I have used it, but. Uh, I'm using goldfish and bluegills and uh, wild chum. Awesome. We saw that goldfish. I've never actually seen somebody hook one on a hook, so that was awesome. They catch them pretty regular up down here with them. Awesome. Well, good luck. Well, I hope we got lots of free one go down anyway. Yeah, that's right. We would too. What's that, Miss Becca? We got fishing with Rob Smack that says, come on, Amy, let's go. She jumped up there. I thought maybe she was going to get one. Yeah, she, that, he, he didn't commit. He didn't commit. Uh, that's a problem with some of our males nowadays. <laughs> <laughs> well, I know that one. <laughs> Mr. Sorry, Tim, fellas. Mr. Tim Molina's go, Jody, go. Now, Jody, you were Go right. Ahead, I mean, well, I'm going to be your underdog today. I can already tell. I got to prove this wrong. <laughs> All right, we're ready. We're ready for you. Looks like Miss Chrissy's all set up. How's everything going, Chrissy? Hey. All right. Can you hear us? All right, well, let's go over to. We do have a question from Mr. Dan. He said, "So helper are helpers are allowed to bring in the fish?" Here, I don't know if they're about female. That. Okay, if they're female and they can only have one helper, uh, one female helper. Um, oh, we got another fish on. Fish on. <laughs> good question dan thanks for uh reminding me we did discuss that last weekend but you're absolutely right um they can have one female joey and they're allowed to net the fish bait do everything that the the um contestants allowed to do as long as they're female and uh and that you can have a, a male joey but they're not allowed to I mean, they can help with some things, but uh, not baiting the hook or catching the fish or throwing the rod out. So a guy can help net the fish, um, but they can't catch it or bait up or anything like that. Good question, Dan. I, I see yeah. another. 
you can net it. There's another fish. Man, Bex is going to be hard to beat. It's fish number five. Stevens out there in the kayak placing the fish on the hooks. <laughs> I don't think so. I don't think they need Stevens' help. Another fish on. There's another fish. <laughs> Mr. Wow. Mark, catfish and crappie is go, Christy, go. They're going to need a nap after the first four hours. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> Vonnie's out there reeling in fish number six. And six fish in 31 minutes. Oh, that's good. That might be that might be a record there. Okay. I need water. <laughs> Beck said I'm thirsty. <laughs> Mr. Timolina wants to know who's in the lead. And so far, as long as this one's uh as long as this one's good, she'll have uh Beck will be in the lead with five. Six. This is a really oh, six, crazy I mean, sorry, six. Fish. Are you ready? Hold on. Hold on. This, is, this, is a, this is a Potomac nuclear fish. Yeah. Whoa. Oh, Look at that. Wow. <laughs> that is why you do not eat the fish out of that river. <laughs> is, is he like a flathead wannabe? <laughs> Whoa. <laughs> this, other one, this other one that Bonnie's got, I'm going to measure because I'm not sure he's 16. Okay. <laughs> Holy cow. That was a... Big Slim wants to know if, if Bex is on the Virginia side, so there's unlimited rods. Uh, well, either way, they have a, a rod limit of three per person in D.C., and both of them, since you have two licensed anglers, they can have six rods. So either way. But we'll ask her once she's done measuring that fish. <laughs> Mr. Mike Chavez said it slammed into the bridge pile. <laughs> 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 Squirrel said that is messed up. You need to be wearing gloves just to touch that fish. <laughs> Uncle Lou said, What the fish snatcher looks like a pug blue cat. It sure did, didn't it? <laughs> All right, here's Bonnie's fish. Or no, that's the deformed one. Look at that thing. He's like the bulldog of catfish. He's got an underbite. Yeah, he's a bulldog. For all you Georgia folks. Goodness gracious. And this guy was 19 inches. Yeah. So. All right. Well, that's six fish. Congratulations, ladies. Y'all are tearing it up. It's a cartoon fish. Yeah. <laughs> awesome. Great job. Well, there's entertainment for you guys, man. We're The ladies are, are putting it on already this morning, putting on a show. Let's go over to Amy and ask about her fishing layout and where you guys are at. Oh, it looks like they're frozen. There you go. Where are you guys fishing? Y'all in Taylorsville? No, we're fishing our oh, home like oh, this. Oh, golly. Morning. Oh, there it's gone. Yeah, you guys are freezing up a little bit. Might have to move around a little bit. All right. Yeah, Sharina, you're popping in and out. Um, Got it. Got uh, it. I think I think Miss Sharina's coming back there. Wants to come. I think she's down in the basement. Yeah. No, she's got she's got two streams down in the basement. I've got her up on screen. She's oh, having okay. serious connectivity issues. Going on there. <laughs> oh, is that Missy with a fish? Go, Missy. She's reeling something, man. <laughs> Mr. Carton Down Under says, Is there a prize for ugliest fish? <laughs> <laughs> 
That just won it hands down. Oh, no, that was grass. Okay. <laughs> Mr. Mark, Catfish and Crappie says, hey, Coco resents that bulldog comment. <laughs> Hey there, Mr. Robbie. How are you doing? Welcome. Mr. Tom, Papa T, welcome, welcome. Has Bex got another fish on? Fish on. Wow. <laughs> Bonnie said that kind of like, uh, That's fish on. Yeah. <laughs> Probably look prettier, better. We first put it on. <laughs> Is that a 20 foot rod or is she that short? I think they use, they are using some longer rods from the bank. I don't even know why I was standing here waiting on. Did you have any bait left? Yeah. Yeah, she can't get baited up fast enough. That's right. She don't even need six rods. <laughs> There's Dark 30 Outdoors. Welcome, welcome. This will be fish number seven in the first 37 minutes. Well, so far the highest weight being 6.7. That's right. <laughs> Carper Down Under said at this point I'd forfeit. No. Heck no Things can still... turn around at any point. There's also other awards, you know, and, and listen, no. so the all they have to do is catch a fish. Yeah. So uh, let me clarify that for everybody in chat. This isn't about – there is an award for most fish, and there's an award for biggest fish, but it's not about – that's not how you win the tournament. You win the tournament by being the the last angler standing. So that's what the Iron Cats are about, being the last thing. Wow, that's definitely new biggest fish right there. Look at that. That's a good one right there. This guy's big, guys. <laughs> Bex is getting her workout. Bex and Bonnie are getting their workouts this morning. <laughs> Buck Williams said, get them, Bex. <laughs> Thank you. <laughs> All right, madam. Mike Turner said, Bex and Bonnie are going for the Potomac River Record forty six plus fish. And the the well, Potomac River is definitely live stream I've seen has been like jam packed full of fish. Welcome, cat drifters. Oh, somebody else said it earlier. I heard it. Yep. Who said? Oh, Pontoon Jody's got a fish on. Woohoo! We'll come back to Bex to get the weight on that fish and look at it. There it is. Good shot, too. Man, that's an awesome camera angle right there. Good job, Jody. Mr. Stonefly says he thinks it's 23.5 pounds. Eric says he thinks that the other one's 18 pounds. Carpin's saying that uh, it's 25 pounds. I love, you know, I, I love being able to guess the weights. <laughs> you do? I do. I, I mean, I love that part of it. You know, and I'm really good at guessing the channel caps, but I'm not really? so good. Yeah, I'm not so good at guessing the, I mean, when you get to the really big ones or something, but I can guess the mm -hmm. channel caps. Okay. That's interesting. What are you doing? Everybody's waiting to see this big fish from Bex, and then Jody just put one on the on the boat on the deck, so she's she's got one for sure. So Jody moves into the second round. She has caught her fish for the first round. Welcome, Mister Chris. Muddy River catfishing's in the house. Good morning, Christopher. <laughs> <laughs> We got Uncle Lou here. All right, here comes the big fish, y'all. Let me get the layout. Look at that monster. There it is. Awesome fish. 
Awesome, awesome fish. Awesome fish. Good, Good morning, morning Mr. Ricky. Ricky. Hope we said the same time. <laughs> You're going to tear the... Okay. Everybody's waiting with bated breath to see how much this fish weighs. <laughs> I just can't get it to lock. It's between 1975 and 2019. Well, we'll, we'll go with the... Just for tournament sake, we'll go with the uh, the lowest number you saw. Nineteen point five. You want to try it? Again? And then remove the point huh? three for the. So nineteen. So nineteen point two. All right. That is now the new biggest fish. Awesome job. <laughs> she's, she's spanking the fish. <laughs> That's a good one right there. It looks like an old mean male cat. It does. Those eyes ain't so dreamy. Ah, oh, that's a big one. Good job, ladies. All right. Pontoon Jody's got a fish he's going to show us. All right. Blue cat? Yeah. That's a pretty one. I didn't weigh him because he's nowhere near that size. <laughs> but you're on the board. You move on to the next round. Congratulations, Jody. All right, there you go. Welcome, Mr. Matt. That's Daddy Duck 365. He had an awesome beard contest the other day, and I was actually a contestant. You go ahead, Beck. I'll, I'll, um, I'll answer these messages from Sharina. Welcome, Sam. How you doing? Let's see, Snake River used to be against nuclear waste. We watched the fire catfish bite from the Potomac. He's rethinking that for his waters. <laughs> Van Taylor's in the house. Let's see if anybody else slipped in. Karsten Payne with three plus one. All right, so Sharina's going to um, try to get some better service, and she'll be back. She's not out. She's not out. She, um, she's got four hours to catch her fish. So she just needs to find a better place to uh, get some service. Let's go to Miss Chrissy here. Miss Chrissy, where are you fishing this morning? I'm in West Virginia, and I'm fishing the guy and Dock. Okay, so we got two West Virginia ladies in the house. Yeah. All right. What are you fishing with this morning? What's the bait of choice? Uh, we have cherry chicken. We have plain chicken. We got We got chicken liver. We got worms. We got... Uh, is that Skip Jack, Lisa? We got Skip Jack. Man, you have a whole, you have a cornucopia of uh, chartreuse. <laughs> we, we got the buffet today. That's awesome. Well, hopefully it'll bring in the cats. I think Martin S. from the UK for the 4.49 money. I don't know. Is that pounds or uh, I'm not sure? Yeah, what that yeah that's a pounds. That's a pound symbol. Thank you so much, Martin. Thank you for all the support you show all of our channels. We appreciate it. All right. I'm going to work up a giveaway. I'm going to turn it over to you, Miss Becca, while I work up this giveaway tool. Hey there, Mr. Mike. That's Mike Cutfrey with Way to Go Kennels. He came over. He actually does coon hunting. And he came awesome. over to support. Yeah, he came over to support us. Well, welcome, welcome, man. Appreciate you coming in. Let's see. Let's see who else has come in here. Uh, oh, there's Mr. Mark, the Fishing Magicians 2.0. How you doing, Fish Tom? on. Fish on. All right, I'm coming. You know, uh, oh, did it get off? No, it's on. If you noticed, I changed my hat. Because our next giveaway is going to be one of these awesome catfish and crappy hats donated by Mark from Catfish and Crappy. Or crappie. I was fixing to say. <laughs> it's crappie. So there's the, there's the hashtag right there. It's kind of long. 
but it's easy. It's long but easy. Reminder, you must enter it exactly as it appears on the screen. I can't. You have to. Oh, was that Missy saying fish on? Yep, Missy's got fish on too. Ooh, look at all this action. Lots of action. Boom. Thank you, Fishing with Rob Mack for $4.99. And welcome to the Boom Squad. I saw you join the Boom Squad uh, this week. So thank you very much. Way to go, Missy. That's awesome. Go, Missy. Go, Missy. <laughs> and she says she's the underdog. I mean, All come right. on. There's Bex and Bonnie with another fish. <laughs> Frozen <on> that face. <laughs> Got 111 people watching. Let's see if she... That's good. Terry Lane is in the house. Brian Smith. What'd you say, Missy? Huh? 19 inches. 19 inches. All right. So it counts. Nice. Woo Way to go. Boom. We got another Boom Squad member, Catfish Bill 19 or Catfish Bill 66. Awesome. He's moved to my part of the country. We're going to be fishing here together soon. That's a flathead, too. Is that a flathead? Yeah, Missy, you have caught the first flathead in an right, iron cat right, tournament, I think. No, I think Squirrel caught one. As soon as I get the coffee on my That's awesome. I don't have Way to go. Oh, there he is. Wow. That's a dark color one. Flathead. All right. Sharina says she's going to go to her spot now. It's open. So maybe she'll get a, a better service. There it is. Beautiful fish, Missy. Beautiful. Wow. So yours? So here's my guy. All right, I'm coming. Hang on, let me write this down. Sorry, sorry, All right, I'm coming. I'm. A, I love being. I love that we have to go back and forth between screens. Here we go. All right. Hold it up there. What you got? Is that a 16 inch or more? We got 19 on this little friend. Beautiful, beautiful. <laughs> close up, close and personal. <laughs> Rebecca, how many fish is that for them? Is that, is that eight? I have eight for no real loss. Wow. Awesome. Awesome, awesome job. Hey, nope, Chrissy Brown's got a fish on. No. No, hung up. No. I saw that rod bend and I was like, dang, <laughs> that's a monster. <laughs> Awesome. Mr. Tim says, come on, all the contestants need to advance. Yes. yes, I agree. We're giving away one of these awesome hats I have on my head right now. Enter in catfish and crappy, hashtag catfish and crappy with no spaces, just as you see it on the screen, and you'll be entered in a chance to win one of these awesome hats. And if you didn't get to see it, then I don't know where you've been. You've seen these hats all over YouTube, and uh, they're on. You'll get a chance to have your very own. Thanks to Mark for donating that hat. Appreciate it. Mr. Dan's Creations is all for Tame Alicia. And we have uh, Sandy Creek so going, go, Lori Ann. It's your time. It's your time to shine. <laughs> Donald Ware is here. Ah, Bud Banks Outdoors. That's a new name for me. They can't do that, Stevan. That's against the rules. They have to actively pursue fish. <laughs> but yes, they are definitely moving on. So right now, anybody who's just joining, uh, we have Bex and Vani, no real loss. With eight fish, the biggest, and they have the biggest fish so far with 19.2 pounds. All blue cats. Pontoon Jody is on the board moving on to the next round with one blue cat. And Missy uh, just caught her first fish. It was a flathead. And so she's moving on to round two. So awesome. Oh, that was a fish? All right. That means it's my turn. 
That's your. It means it's your turn. You, Chrissy, Alicia, Amy. It's it's time for y'all to get on the board. And and Sharina, Sharina's. I think she said she's moving to her, her uh her favorite spot so she can try to get some uh, better service. Mom, that's not Missy's first fish. Yeah, it was. She had grass huh. on the first time. We thought it was. We oh. thought it was fish. Yeah. Okay. Yeah. She had a wad of grass. <laughs> All right. Well, here we go, y'all. If you didn't have a chance to enter, you're going to miss out. Here's the last chance to enter. Get you a catfish and crappie, crappy, however you want to say it, hat. Yep, she's here. Uh, she was messaging us, telling us she saw her spot was open, so she may move there to try to get some better service. Uh, as long as she catches a fish live on the screen in four hours, then um, she's good to go. So even if you're going in and out. <laughs> camera down. Missy has a camera down. Camera down. Camera down. <laughs> All right, here we go. We're going to press the giveaway tool. And boom, here we go. <laughs> Mr. Rick said that she had the side salad. <laughs> she had the side salad dish. <laughs> Wayne Huska, awesome supporter. Uh, always in all these lives. Congratulations, Wayne. Um, Mark, Mark in chat will tell you, Catfish and Crappie will tell you how to get in touch with him. He's going to shift that hat from uh, uh, Catfish and Crappy Studios. All right. Congratulations, Wayne. Appreciate it. Appreciate you being here always. Looks like Amy's casting back out there. Thank right, you, Mr. Go. Mike. He's, come on, y'all. Hit that thumbs up. Yeah, appreciate it. Yes, ma'am. That mud cat, that was for my dad. Woohoo! Go, Missy. That was an awesome mud cat. And that's awesome, like how how we have so many different names for flatheads. Isn't that cool? Shovelheads, mud cats, yellow cats, flatheads. All of them are right. You call them what you want. <laughs> I That's know it really awesome, does depend on where you're coming from. It really does. All right. Let's go to Miss Lori Ann. Miss Lori Ann, you there? My flatheads are just elusive. <laughs> that's that's what I elusive call flatheads. Elusive. Elusive. I haven't caught one this year <laughs> either. Don't feel bad. Lori, um, so tell everybody like where you're fishing at, um, what you're fishing with. I am in, in the most beautiful spot, I can tell you that. If I catch a fish today, it'll be amazing, but I'm just loving it down here. I am on the Great PD now River in South Carolina. And I'm actually on a back channel, kind of like a, I think it's a, a creek, really. And um, I'm at a point, everything's kind of flowing in this way at me. But um, right I'm now exhausted. I have... Um, I have chicken, I have lemon chicken, I have the anise chicken I'm trying, uh, I have the strawberry jello chicken, I also have eel, which I have on right now, finger mullet, I have my usual man hater, Manhattan, the bunker baby. <laughs> <laughs> I love that one. <laughs> I don't know if I'll toss that one or not, we'll, we'll see what happens. And I am getting a lot of bites, and you'll see me, I pulled in a, over here because I got hit real hard, but it, it could have just been something other than what i needed <laughs> right awesome well good luck it definitely is a beautiful spot and i'm gonna yeah. take my log logo down from covering your face there there you go <laughs> everybody knows oh, what hey. channel we're on. <laughs> there you are <laughs> fish on there's another one fish number nine Boo, 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 as Beck says. <laughs> she is killing it this morning. Hey, Beck, the next round, no chicken. 
She's using that chicken, Missy. You might want to make the switch. <laughs> oh, we got some Lori fans. Catfish Bill 66, Dark 30 Outdoors, and myself. So, go Lori. Miss <laughs> I mean, Lori's my girl, so. Aww. Bud Bud Banks Outdoors says, Bex is a beast. She sure is. Dark 30 said, they are in a hot spot. Yeah, listen, we only need one. I mean, it could just that's be it. the big one. You never know. That's the thing, and that's what I was trying to tell people. I mean, it's awesome that we're catching lots of fish because it's more entertaining. Yeah, like if absolutely. somebody's catching a bunch. But um, <laughs> yes. but to but to win, all you have to do is catch one in those time allotments, and, and you can win the whole tournament. So that's what's kind of unique is, uh, yeah, it's cool to catch the biggest one. It's cool to catch the most, but uh, that's not how you win it. I think it's Long just cool it, to catch anything. <laughs> yeah, I, and I, listen, if anybody knows what it feels like to not be on the fish, it's me right now. <laughs> uh oh, uh, Miss Kitty says nope. No, Miss Lori's no, her girl. Had chicken on that one. <laughs> That's my sister. There she is. Bex is running to the other rod for rod for fish yeah. number ten. Uh, got hooked up over there. Mr. Tom LG Bass says, Lori M, Lori M, Lori M. <laughs> yes, double. Martin UK said, go team pontoon Jody. Mike Irvin said, he's team Sharina. She has won an iron. She won the original Iron Cat. So we Did do Sharina have make two. The back? We do have two Iron Cat champions in the contest. That's a nice one. Oh, yeah, that is. Yeah, look, he's only got one eye. Oh. Aw. But look, he's doing great. Look how big he already got. That's awesome. I hate Good when fish. they only have one eye. <laughs> That's fish number nine for no real loss. Especially since, you know, their eyes are gone on the side of their heads. It's not yeah. like us that we can still look forward. <laughs> yeah. They kind of like have to turn sideways to look. <laughs> yeah, they can never look out the other side. But it happens. Well, Mr. Mike Chavez says, go ladies. He loves them all. <laughs> all right. Well, while we're uh, waiting for the next fish, Let's go over and talk to, well, Miss Alicia Barnett. Miss Alicia, if you don't mind unmuting yourself. Oh, no, I got you. No, I got you. Tell us where you're fishing and uh, what you're fishing with. So I'm fishing at Taylorsville Lake. And sorry, right when you said my name, I turned the direction of my trail motor some of lines. I was trying to make sure they weren't going to get all twisted or knock you over. Oh. Taylorsville Lake. So I'm at Taylorsville Lake in Kentucky, and I have a buffet with me. Um, I have DMV's recipe on one um, rod that's about to go out, so that one's not in the water. But I have um, shad. There's a ton of shad in here. Um, I have minnows. I have um, hot dogs. I have, um, I'm trying to think what all's out right now. Um, but I have lots more to put on there. I've got night colors. I've got, I've, I've just got a ton, ton of stuff. And I'm going to just keep trying different things. That's awesome. But the, I was a little bit um, late getting my camera started because two nights ago I was in someone else's line and was trying the setup I have right now for the camera to see if it would work. And um, all of a sudden, Oh, no, my, my trailer motor battery wasn't working anymore, so I had to use my back seat um, to use the small motor, and um, so I had to move my camera, and then all of a sudden, it splashed in the water. The tripod, the ring oh, light, the no. phone, everything, and went about two feet down. Oh, no. So, yeah. So You're today, muted, Bex. Uh, I was trying that much harder to make sure that that didn't happen again. Yeah. Sorry. 19 inches. All right. Fish number 10. Fish number 10. 
Yeah, I'm, you definitely don't want that to happen two, twice in a row. <laughs> no. Yeah, and I had a cracked screen, and I have no clue how, like, I think the fact that it was plugged into the charger kept the water from going into the charging port. Um, I wiped it off immediately, but I was able to finish, you know, uh, almost completely finish out their live with them. Um, and it just worked. Like, I, it's surprising. Like, my microphone was working, my camera was working, but it sure was at least two feet underwater. Yeah, Bex and uh, yeah, definitely Bex and Vani are worn out. <laughs> Y'all might need to take a rod out of the water. <laughs> you know that the um, you know as Uncle look Uncle Lou puts it, that's the um, they call that the Potatoes River. <laughs> the Potatoes River. <laughs> uh huh. <laughs> we got another super sticker from Wayne, who's for two dollars. Thanks a lot, my friend. Appreciate it. Looks like uh, uh, Sharina and Thomas are on the, the look for a new spot. So we'll get back with them when they get there. Awesome. Good luck, ladies. Team Amy. All right. She's out there trying. Potato River. <laughs> well, I say potato. <laughs> <laughs> All right, well, y'all got to get to doing these giveaways. Uh, I just got a message from another person said they wanted to give away some stuff. So let's keep on moving. Uh, we just gave away a catfish and crappy hat. We've given away some Mike Turner stickers. Uh, let's see. I got a pontoon Jody sticker in the mail yesterday. And I don't know if anybody's ever seen these. Uh, maybe they have, and I'm just late to the game. But check that out, y'all. Pontoon Jody sticker. She is fishing out there right now. Isn't that nice? It's kind of oh, got the, that's yeah. awesome. So we're gonna give away one of those right now. I'm gonna take my face off the screen. And you're gonna enter in. I'm gonna make it, I'm gonna make it super, super easy. It's gonna be hashtag. Well, hold on, let me get it up here. Hashtag Jody with an I. Hashtag Jody with an I. Just like that. And that will win you one of these awesome pontoon Jody stickers. Mr. Bill Becca, is in the house. Becca, I've gotten smart. Or, well, I believe it's smart. But I've got me a little plastic bag here. <laughs> and so after we do the giveaway, I put it in a plastic bag so I don't give it away again. <laughs> oh, actually, that is a really good idea. <laughs> and this was marked Saturday. And the other one's marked Sunday. But y'all, I mean, like I have tons of gift. I have later on we're gonna give away some kudas, some kuda scissors. Uh Walmart specials, of course. Yeah, I uh, better some, stay away from those. Some team <laughs> catfish hooks. Um, some more team catfish hooks. We got ton, like a whole pile of stickers. And then I got a bunch of these for the iron cats. We're gonna give one away each day. But uh, I got these little hand counters, and Bex could probably use one of these because she's catching so many fish. A little hand counter to um, count your fish while you're out on the boat or out on the bank. Heck, as fast as she's reeling them in, we could use that right here. I know. <laughs> so we got that. We got a bunch of stickers from a bunch of different people. Um, we have a uh, Cast King reel to give away today. Another one of those Spartacus reels that we're going to give away. I need um, that. We also have uh, a catfish hat. Where's that one at? I got everything here. Oops. Dropping stuff. Mr. George Ray, did you update your name? I'm pretty sure now it's Fish in the Dream with George Ray. <laughs> Fishing the dream with George Ray. Now, what in tarnations did I do with that message? Welcome, Bluegrass State of Mind. Mark Greer. Here it is. Okay. Real and Raider. So we, we're going to give away this catfish hat. I have one just like it, but well, this one's brand new. Still got tag on. And then tomorrow we have awesome prizes as well. We have, we're also giving away Palmetto Cats t shirts. 
We have a PC Fun Alloy M reel to give away. We have a box of weight from Brad Caldo to give away. And from Santee Drifters. No, there's George Ray right there. Oh, well, somebody else is somebody else is in there as George Ray as well. Really? Yeah, we might need to watch that. Yeah. Well, the George, the real George Ray, always drops something special for me all the time, so you can always tell which one that is. Yeah, that's, I mean, this is the George Ray that I recognize, so that's why I was asking if he updated his name. Right. There may be another George Ray. Could be. I think we got one. All right. Oh, Fish number nope. 11. He did say that that was him. Oh, okay. <laughs> yeah. There's Mr. George. Sean with uh, Catfish Heroes, also known as Catfish Cowboy. Catfish Cowboy. <laughs> Yeehaw! <laughs> Mike Chavez said, come on, Amy, get you one. <laughs> At first I thought I said, get you some. <laughs> but yeah, right now we're doing a giveaway. Hashtag Jody for an awesome pontoon Jody sticker. I put mine on my boat yesterday. Will the real George Ray please stand up? Please stand up. <laughs> oh, yeah, I mean, he, he just can't spring that on us. I know. You know? <laughs> <laughs> He's trying to stack the deck to win a pontoon Jody sticker. I get it. <laughs> he said that was my new channel by accident. We got you, boy. We're just giving you a hard time. <laughs> see, was it Tosha Way? Tasha, maybe. Ta Tosh A Way. Tosh we do way. have a big cat. We have a uh, 19 pounder already. And a flathead, which is something we had. I'm pretty sure, I can't remember. Squirrel, if you're in here, did you catch a flathead in the boat tournament? I want to say you did. I can't remember. And there was two flathead wannabes. Yes, he did. He did. Okay, cool. Gotcha. Reeling Raiders, what's up? Don't forget the two, the two that were all their heads were all smushed in. <laughs> you ladies, all right over there? Um, yeah, it's fun. <laughs> you guys look you look like you're on a little bit of a slope. So you're having to walk up and down that slope over and over. <laughs> yeah. You know, since we started, we've never had all of our rods in the water. Now I know that. It's crazy. I, I mentioned earlier, I said y'all might need to take a few out. <laughs> yeah. You can just put a few back in if somebody starts catching up to you for most fish. There you go. Yeah, we've been doing just three for the last yeah. two or three minutes. That's awesome. I'm glad you, you you ladies are on it. Thank you. Fishing with Rob Max says, come on, Amy, start singing. It works for Kevin. Yeah. <laughs> Wild Turkey said, come on, ladies, let's get everyone to the next round. They are. They're trying. I had your mute. They're trying. Sister Christian, oh, <laughs> that sounds too much like the original. Be careful. <laughs> oh, okay. <laughs> it's like old Dieter Melhorn just went live. And I was over here singing him, and he y'all missed that. I just want to thank our tournament sponsor, the Catfish Conference. Oh, there it is. Thanks, Catfish Conference. There That's another awesome fish right there. Yeah, beautiful. Not 19 pounds, but a beautiful fish. No, nah, but he's 10 plus for sure. Yeah. All right, awesome I'm going to get him back awesome in. Awesome job. Yep. Got a little bit of a belly on him. <laughs> yes, yeah, we'll do We'll do a little overview here. Let me, um, Dieter who. <laughs> so that was fish number 11, I believe. Yeah, that's what I got. Awesome. 
So a little overview. So right now we have uh, we have eight ladies in today's tournament. We have four tomorrow. Um, one lady, Miss Sharina, is uh, trying to get a better spot for service. She's here. She's just trying to get uh, a little better service. Uh, up top, we got uh, my amazing co-host, Miss Becca, Mudtramp0715. All these links are in the description as well, y'all. Go check the links out. Go check out their channels if they have one. And uh, hit that subscribe button if you like what you see. Uh, Lori Ann's fishing in South Carolina. Missy Kennedy's in West Virginia. Um, not using chicken. She's made sure that we know that. Uh, Amy, three plus one, is in Kentucky. Um, and then Bex is in uh, the D.C. metro area on the Potomac River. Pontoon Jody's on the Tennessee River. Uh, Miss Alicia Barnett is on Taylorsville Lake in Kentucky. Miss Chrissy Brown is in West Virginia today. And then Miss Sharina is in Indiana. And it looks like she might be back up. There she is. We see you now. We see you now. So she's down there in Indiana. So right now the fish count is Bex from No Real Loss has 11 fish the, and the biggest fish, 19.2 pounds. Miss Pontoon Jody has one fish. And Missy Kennedy has one fish, and it was a flathead. So some good fish being caught. All three of those ladies move on to round two. Uh, you have four hours. So from 8 to 12 p.m. Eastern Standard Time to catch the first fish. If you don't catch a fish in four hours, you do not move on to the next round. The next round is from 12 p.m. to 2 p.m. And uh, in those two hours, you have to catch another fish. All the fish, catfish have to be 16 inches or longer. It doesn't matter the species. Um, so that's two hours to catch another fish. If you catch a fish in those two hours, you move on to the third round. And the third round is the last round. And you have to catch a fish every hour. Um, if you do not catch a fish in an hour, you're out. Unless we have more than one angler that doesn't catch a fish um, in that hour, then we go into what's called sudden death, which means that the next fish in 16 inches or over wins next catfish in wins. So we've gone to sudden death, uh, twice before, and uh, it's been exciting and exhilarating both times. <laughs> so, uh, I wouldn't be upset if it went to sudden death. All right, here we go. We're giving away a pontoon Jody sticker and go. Good luck, everybody. Mr. Chad is in the house, and I would like to say a special happy birthday to Miss D. Yeah, happy birthday, D. Martin S. UK. Awesome. Send me an email with your address. I know you're in the UK, and I'm still going to send it to you. So uh, go ahead and send me your email. Or, I mean, your, um, shoot, I can't talk. Your physical mailing address. To the email scrolling across the bottom and I'll send it to you. Congratulations, Martin. Another awesome supporter. There's Mr. Stan 3. Stan 3. Uh, Micah Williams is in the house. Jody is down there focused. Jody, what are you fishing with? What kind of baits? Probably skipjack, I imagine. I'm using fresh skipjack. Fresh skipjack. Yeah, I'd use that too if I were where you're at. We don't have skipjack here in South Carolina. I think I'm in my wrong spot. It's foggy when I got here. I actually need to be up a little bit, but... I'll give this one two more. <laughs> yeah, I mean, you got time, so you're good. It was a memo Martin, I probably do have your address, but if you don't mind, send it to me again so I don't have to hunt for it. <laughs> Appreciate it. Yep, you're moving on to the next round, Jody, so if you need to move, you, you definitely should feel comfortable doing that. Uh-huh. There's a, a, I think you might pronounce it Dewani, Dewani Flagger. 
Well, Kim, well, Kim, that's a new name for me. Yeah, he works with me at my school. Oh, yep. oh okay. Yep. He's a good, uh, awesome supporter and just a good dude, period. All right. Let's see. Let's give away some other stuff. What do you want to give away, Miss Becca? Um, didn't you say you had some shirts? Yeah, I got a shirt. We can give away a Palmetto Cat shirt. How about that? Yeah, that sounds good. All right, I'll load it up. You got Outdoors Addiction, Mr. Jack Jesse in the house. And Joe Sutton's in the house, and he wants to give a shout out to all the ladies. Good luck. TX Tiger, come on, Lori, throw a swamp worm out. There you go, Palmetto Cat shirt. Hashtag PC shirt. We'll that sounds you. like I need to dress my laptop. <laughs> Stand three, you should have a fresh one in the mail. It should be to you by now. But I, I sent you and your your old man a refresher shirt since you guys wear them all the time. The least I could do is send you a, a nice fresh one. Yeah, epic catfish in the house. Hi there, Mr. Tim. Montana Whisker Stickers, welcome. Bud Banks. Terry Lane. I was going to wear my Palmetto shirt, and I said, I'm not getting this arm on that. <laughs> Kenneth hey, Powell. You would, you would have messed it up. You know I would have sent you another one. You know how I am about my orange. Yeah. <laughs> There's Mr. Steven with Central Valley Adventures. We got There's 135 a, people watching. That's awesome. Thank you for coming a, in and supporting these ladies. They're all such wonderful folks. You know, we are really, truly a blessed, a very blessed community. Mm -hmm. I've started to thank them, but I want to thank them again. Uh, I want to thank the cat. Uh oh, fish on. Fish on. Fish on. All right, Amy's got a fish on. I'll shut up. We'll go. Get it, Amy. Go, Amy. Go, Amy. Go, Amy. Go, go, Amy. Go. <laughs> oh yeah, get you some. I think it's yes, a shot. I don't think it's a fish. You don't think it's a fish? You think it's a yeah. turtle? It's a turtle. Oh no, Dak blasted turtles. Oh, no. I don't know. Oh. Oh, I don't know about it. I don't know. I ain't never seen a turtle fight that hard. Right. Can I can I net it for? Yeah, you can net it. I don't think that's a turtle. Man, I want to see what's gonna come up. Hurry up. <laughs> <laughs> I can't stand it. I can't stand this suspense. That ain't no turtle. That's a fish. It's heavy like a turtle is what she's trying to say. Oh, I got you. <laughs> it's really a world record flathead. Right. Probably. It is a turtle. It is a turtle. Oh, oh man. Big old salt shell. Dang, that's a big turtle. It was fun to catch. Is that yeah. <laughs> I was like, the way you were fighting, I was like, there's no way that's a turtle. But, big yeah. old salt shell. <laughs> Dang. So it got to the boat, and then it wasn't coming up. Were some pliers up there? Oh, man. Well, it was action. That was probably left. more fun than the tree limb I caught. <laughs> <laughs> At least I caught something. Maybe that's just an optical illusion. Yeah. <laughs> Maybe it's really a fish. I'm still rooting for you, Amy. Thank you. There it is. It don't stop you. <laughs> oh, oh, man. Timelina said, I vote that turtles count for Amy. <laughs> hey, yeah. It kind of bit like a flathead. Looks like Bex has got another one on. Go, Bex! 
Yeah, I bet they ain't no turtle. Uh, she might have caught a kayaker. There's one going by. <laughs> He's. We had to warn him because we got a fish on. You would think the uh, you would think all the lines and the rods would be a hint, but not for some people. <laughs> yeah, right. Very well possible, Palmetto. She hit a kayaker. She's using a uh, chicken. <laughs> <laughs> Missy is ruthless. Maybe if it was fried, Missy. Mr. Dan says there needs to be a strangest cat Sometimes category. Walk over this way, Lisa. That's not a bad idea, Dan. Yeah, it really does. It depends on where it's hung at. Looks like this one's fighting her pretty good. I'm gonna go soft shell. It ain't. Fight like a fish. You ain't get it. Well, it did. I think she's net. Yeah, I think she's got it. Yep. <laughs> That one was good. I was hoping it would go with both. Yeah, that's a nice one. 10 plus. Careful. Mr. George Ray says, Come on, Miss Lori. Right? Let's go. Let's go. Yeah, definitely wasn't a fishing kayak, Tim. Yeah, catfish. Blue catfish. Mr. Randall Rhino Outdoors is in the house. <laughs> Wild turkey said a non-target species category. <laughs> <laughs> Dallas Libert said, come on, Lorian. That's that's fish number twelve for no real loss. They are tearing it up. Thank you so much, Jojo, there for coming is. in. Another nice one. Good job, Pretty lady. Pretty color. Pretty color. Yeah. All right, gotta get back in. All right, good job. I want to hear them talk though. They need to talk. The catfish, I mean. <laughs> Oh, thank you. <laughs> Where was your line out over there? All right, let's see. What was I saying? I was uh, giving thanks. Didn't wait a minute, hold on. Somebody I thought somebody said to fish on. Looks like Jody, yeah. Yeah. There's Mr. Brian in the house. Brian B. Go Catfish. Go, Jody. Go. Go, Jody. Go, Jody. Go. <laughs> Larry DeLong's in the yeah. house. Kane uh, Sample. Probably. All right, fishing the boat. All right, that's number two for Pontoon Jody. Well, while she's getting that one out of the net, let's give out this Calmetta Cats t-shirt. Again, if you want to enter real quickly, it's hashtag PC shirt, just as it is on the screen. You have to enter it in just like that. Mr. Dan says, Alicia, you got a fish coming soon. All right, here we go. Catching them Hello. fishes in the house. Gene okay. Tillman. Catfishing Curtis. Congratulations, man. You want to palmetto cats shirt make sure you send me an email palmetto cats at gmail.com with your shirt size and your address 
Palmettocats at gmail.com. All right, let's go back to Jody. He was weighing that fish there. 13 and a half. 13 and a half. That's an awesome fish. Hey there, Miss Julie. Miss Julie is part of another community that I'm in, and I was telling them all about the tournament today. So thank you so much welcome, for coming Julie. in. And thanks for spreading the word, Miss Becca. I appreciate it. No, he was hooked good. He wasn't going nowhere. <laughs> Take your time, Miss Jody. All right. Kane Simple said, This is awesome. It is. Uh, can the contestants keep what they catch? No, sir. It is CPR only for this tournament. Now, legally they can. Like everything they're catching as long as they um as long as they follow their state rules they can, but from this tournament it's all CPR. Good question. Lori hasn't hooked up quite yet, but it's coming. It's coming. Taste no says loss. this is one this is one tournament that he's glad he's not fishing in. <laughs> We've already got 15 fish caught in the first hour and a half. Steven just subscribed to Pontoon Jody for no real loss. Thank you, Steven. And if anybody else wants to check out the channels, not everybody puts out content, but some of them do. So go check out those links in the description if you want to check out their, their channels. And if you like it, go ahead and hit that sub button. Also, we have links to all of our sponsors and prize uh, giveaways uh, in the description. For instance, we gave away a catfish and crappy hat earlier, and uh, his link is in the description if you want to check it out. Um, Ogi73 is a little bit behind if somebody wants to type that in chat. What's up, John Euler? Hi there, Mr. John. There's Miss Jenny. The house. Here comes that fish. All right. Oh, it's look like at an, that one. It's like another angry male. Wow. Way to go, Jody. That's got some pretty color on up there at the front. Yep. Awesome job. Awesome job. She said that was 13 and a half pounds, y'all. Congratulations. That's fish number two for Jody. And she said she was worried about the morning bite. She says, I fish at night. Well, doesn't look like doesn't look like she's uh, having a problem today, does it? <laughs> oh, there's another yeah, fish for no real loss. I'm showing him to you got another one on wow that's fish number 13 and then she's got 14 on the line Dang. holy cow has life is in the house good morning my friend these uh, ladies rebecca, are on fire Re rebecca and jamie that they actually said a good point right there they said they love getting to see the catfish from different states it, yeah. that is yeah that's interesting to see how i the catfish at no real loss right there, and then the one that Miss Jody just caught. I mean, they're like they look totally different, but you know, but they're the same. Right. All the different colors and everything. We caught one. Mm -hmm. I think yesterday I caught the darkest cat blue cat I've ever seen. Like it was almost totally black, and then the underside he even had black speckles all over him. Uh, really? And I checked. I checked the anal fin because I thought it had to be a channel cat, but no, it was the it was a blue cat. So it just depends on where you catch them, how shallow they are, I guess. And I know Pontoon Jody's probably fishing in like a hundred foot of water. No, I'm in 38. 38. I'm past 
it off in 38. I'm over lid. There you go. I have this beautiful open space, but a real narrow casting window. It's crazy. Yeah, with those overhanging trees. Yep. yep. These girls are on fire. <laughs> Take note, you men out there, just off the hide in the fishing cupboard. <laughs> A lot of coppery color. Okay, that's interesting. Steve, you're you're a little behind in the stream. Somebody wants to type that in there to Steve. Steve Sellers is behind. We gave that shirt away a while ago. Have y'all caught your breath yet, Bonnie? These guys are getting really rude. They splash me right in the face when I'm trying to get them out. <laughs> How rude. <laughs> Y'all might just have to take all of them out but one. <laughs> uh, fishing around Chicago, a bill said, should there be a cap on how many fish you catch in order to advance to the next round? A cap? No, that wouldn't be fun, I don't think. I don't, maybe I don't understand the question. That's another beautiful one. I'm going to weigh this one just to check. Okay. You know, Bex, I just thought about something. Until recently, all these fish you've caught would have probably broken your PB, right? Yeah, all of them. <laughs> Up until like and, a week ago. And now you're like, yeah, here's another one, whatever. <laughs> yeah. Whatever. Here's another 13, 14 pounder. Uh, no good deal. Your your um your new PB what was it is it it did go over forty right thirty six pounds thirty six thirty six yeah <laughs> Mike Chavez said a rude one pooped on Uncle Josh last week so at least at least you don't have to worry about that Vonnie. <laughs> Once you get 10, you gotta start over. <laughs> She's right, captain. Not worth uh, not bigger than the other one. No. So but if you look in the distance, we have water skier. Yeah. Alright, there he is, guys. Nice. Get it back in the water. Another angry male, it looks like. Bex is weight jaded now. The green is the data, right? Awesome, awesome, awesome. Oh, look at this. Look at this debris Alicia's got floating by. That's. You must be dragging baits, Alicia. She's muted. Yeah. I'm not sure if I'd... Yeah. Are you dragging baits? Uh, I am dragging baits, but I'm about to uh, switch tactics. This debris over here is not fun. Yeah. I was like, I was like, man, that debris is floating down the river, and I forgot you're on a lake. So I was like, yeah, she must be dragging baits. Yeah. Well, hopefully that'll work out for you. All right, Miss uh, Becca, you want to go over the stats, what we got so far? So far, I've got 15 for no real loss. I've got the, 14. Which it, I thought that's just the one she just pulled in was 15. No, 14, 15. We'll, we'll call it 15. <laughs> yeah, I was going to say, because the one she just pulled in, I had 14, and then I marked, you know, I did my little thingy. Gotcha. For that. And then 19.2 uh, pounds so far for the biggest. Mm -hmm. And then Miss Jody's got two. And Miss Missy has one. And all the others are uh, they're coming. They're their fish is coming. Oh, Absolutely. and Miss Amy has a turtle. <laughs> Can't forget the turtle. We're going to do another sticker giveaway here. We're going to give away 
a three plus one outdoor sticker. I got a whole bunch of these in the mail yesterday too. So that's uh, Amy and Larry down there. This is their sticker. So we're going to give one of those away. And to enter to win, all you have to do is enter hashtag three plus one. Uh, two stands fishing wants to know number three wants to know what what is Miss Alicia fishing out of, and she's in her boat. Topper is uh, twelve by thirty six, so just a little bitty thing. Some of the say it one more time, Alicia. I had you muted because I'm getting feedback. So um, oh. say what you're fishing oh. out of one more time. It's a tracker topper. It's a twelve by thirty six. So uh, there are some kayaks that are bigger than me. <laughs> hey, you got a fish or what you got? Yeah, Missy just, just texted. Missy texted said she just lost service, so we'll uh, hope that she can get back in. But she's moving on to the next round, regardless. Steve Sellers wants to know um, what everybody's PBs are. Um, 22.5. There you go. Yeah, if y'all just want to shout them out, that's fine. We we did a show last weekend, and uh, but not everybody was there to say the PB, so that might. What's yours, Alicia? What's your PB? Um, the biggest out of all three is 14. 14. Miss Chrissy, what about you? What's your biggest catfish? 22. Okay. Bex just said hers was a 36. Miss Jody, what's your biggest catfish? A 42 flathead and a 45 blue. Wow. And Miss Lori shouted hers out. I think she said 22. Miss Amy, 5. what's your biggest 5. one? 22.5. Uh, 22.5. Sorry. sorry. 20, 27 is Amy. And she just <laughs> caught that down here. Not with me. On the river. But she caught it down here in Santee Cooper without my help <laughs> or without Paul Blackwell's help either. <laughs> Catfish in America says his is 78 pounds, 12 ounces. Holy cow. Holy smoly. I don't, I've never like seen a fish that back big in person. Uh Oh, Oh, uh. I call those holy Moby catfishes. <laughs> <laughs> Once again, we're giving away a three plus one sticker. All you have to do to enter is enter hashtag three plus one. Just like it is. Reminder, you must enter the hashtag as you see it on the screen or the giveaway tool will not register your entry. It's very important. And I've been trying to do this, um, but thankfully we're getting interrupted by fish, but I really need to do it, get through it. Thank you to our tournament sponsor, which is the Catfish Conference. Catfish Conference is giving a free hotel room stay. Jody, you got a fish? She said, yeah, I got interrupted, but I'm I'm happy. <laughs> Jody's got a fish on, y'all. I'm happy to get interrupted by fish. Those are some big reels. Those are like big pins. Hi there, Mr. Avid. Avid fisherman in the house. Ooh, nice bend in the rod there. Jody, I think you have one of the best angles because you got it kind of up a little bit too. Look at him fight. Get it, Jody. Woo! He goes, I ain't coming up. That's a good fish right there. Look at it. Great googly moogly. I'm telling <laughs> you, the suspense kills me. I love it. Uh -huh. I didn't hear you there. Oh, my God. Oh, that's a good one. He's 
Those fish, when they fight like that, I don't even care if they tangle me up. I'll re-rig everything for a fish like that. <laughs> Look at that sucker go. Yeah. He's staying down. You, I Look like them the when they're feisty. It's a good example of fighting a fish with the reel. You got to fight the fish with that reel. Set and drag is so important. Oh, yeah. Look at the bent. Look at him go. Woo! Two stands three says that's going to be a 30 plus. It's a good one for sure. Hadn't even surfaced. Yeah. <laughs> Martin said that fish don't want no photos. <laughs> Look, everybody just stared to the, I mean, just glued to the screen. Is that? that fish wants to uh, to bypass the C and the P and go straight to the R. <laughs> he don't want to come up. No. Nope. Holy smokes, that's a raw bender. That's exciting. Mr. Mike Upry says, loving this. You're doing awesome, Miss Doty. All right, he's in the net. Congratulations. Ooh, that's a nice one. That's a flathead. Oh, look at that sucker. All right. This is new big fish for sure. I don't know who gets more excited, me or them. <laughs> I can't wait till I get over there and start being able to fish the river and pulling these big ones, you know. And oh. that's, a, that's a sweet doggy. No, you got to do it like he does it. Shall we? Doggy. <laughs> <laughs> It's going between 30.80 and 31.50. My next one. Did you just say only? <laughs> no, I didn't. Can you see it? Oh, I trust you guys. You guys can read it. Okay. And then and then make sure you tear off the net. 1.7 for the net. So what was the what was the um <laughs> 30.8 was the lowest number. Oh, it's strong. Yeah. Uh-oh. Lori's got one. Yeah, so if it's 30.8, and I think she said you have to deduct 1.8 for the net, so that would make it 29. Lori's got a fish on. Nope, negative. Nope, false alarm. She's oh, sure to get excited for a second. Snag me up. All right, let me get Jody back up here. You said that's your husband, Jerry? Did well, she thanks, say Jerry, Jerry or for helping her Jerry. out. So that's, we're going with 29 pounds? Well, yeah, because her lowest, well, she said it locked or didn't lock, but it, the lowest one was 30.8. And I think she wow, said 1.8 for the net. Look at that beast, y'all. Awesome fish, Jody. Woohoo! And Uncle Steve donated a hundred dollars. Said awesome. Good morning, everybody. Good morning, Mr. Steve. Jody, fantastic fish. That is freaking awesome. Way to go. That's the biggest flathead caught on an iron cat so far for sure. Way to go, Jody. So that's three fish uh, for Jody, and now she is the new big cat leader. Way to go. All right. Holy that was smokes, exciting. my rod bent right over, but it wasn't there. Didn't hook up, huh? Didn't hook it, nope. It's okay, Mr. Ricky said, Lori's just practicing for when she does catch a fish. <laughs> 
Looks like Bex has got another one on. Get it, Bex. Man, we have some awesome fish in action, y'all. Make sure you hit the thumbs up. I mean, this is this is some awesome action we got this early in the morning. Frank Zuniga's in the house and says, nice fish, and, and telling everybody hello. There's right, Dobson's coming in. I don't know. Are y'all checking baits, Bonnie, or does she have a fish on? Y'all are muted, so I can't tell. Well, I'm sure they'll come. Uh, they'll come show us if they got a fish on. <laughs> Way to go, Jody! Thank you so much, Uncle Steve. We appreciate that. Uh, that super chat. Again, you're always so um, so giving to all these channels. We really appreciate you. All right, stats update. Go, Miss Becca. <laughs> While you're show, doing that, I'm gonna give away this sticker. I show no real loss. Well, and well, depending on if she gets this, whatever she's getting in now. But fifteen, and then uh, Miss Missy's got one. I'm sorry. Yeah, Miss Missy's got one, and Miss Jody has three, and who and also has the largest at twenty nine pounds flathead. Nice. Sean Catfish Heroes just won him a three plus one sticker. Congratulations, Sean. Send me uh, an email, palmettacats at gmail.com with your address, and I'll get that sticker out to you, my friend. Oh, there's yep. Jesse Lopez Outdoors, and he says, good morning. He must have died and gone to heaven with all these beautiful ladies slaying fish. Ooh. You <laughs> smooth talker, you. <laughs> Looks like got another one in. Vonnie's Vonnie, are you limping? Some catfish tearing you up like that? <laughs> I was I don't remember what I was doing. I was looking for something. That's number 16, I believe. Yep. 16. Oh well. Nice. Congratulations on that enormous guy. That's awesome. Yeah, Jody, that, that was a nice flathead for sure. Oh, Catfish Hero says he never won anything before. There you go. <laughs> now you can't say that no more. Nope. Maybe maybe Mr. Mark from Catfish and Crappy, he says the same thing. He never wins anything either. <laughs> I used to win a bunch, and now I don't win anything either, but uh, I'm, a, I'm absolutely okay with that. I so actually won... Um, uh, the other day, I won a, a, a lure, I don't know, a little thingamajiggy crawfish type whatever box of lures. Mm. And you've, you've won two reels here in the past couple months. I know. I've won two reels. I've won two catfish rods. Uh, I won a game camera. I won, I've won all kinds of baits. I've won the, the um, Santee uh, drifting weights, the uh, Patriots float. I'm like excited. <laughs> Speaking of Santee Drifters, it's one of our sponsors for this e for this uh, tournament series. So we're going to give away a pack of Santee Drifters. Mister Mike, I hope you're enjoying that scale. I'm telling you, those are good. Those are good scales. I don't think anybody has said that they don't. You know, they all say they lock in really well and um, just love them. Just if you don't know what Santee Drifters are, Santee Drifters are a dragging weight um, made by right here in my hometown. Well, close to my hometown in Cross, which is next to Monk's Corner. But they're made by Jimmy Smith. And he also has a YouTube channel called Fishing and Gear Outdoor Entertainment. Um, so check out the SanteeDrifters.com in the description to get you some Santee Drifters. And I also have a promo code down there so you can save 15% on your order. Um, so make sure you check him out. Thank you, Jimmy, for sponsoring uh, two days of giveaway. So we'll give away one today and one tomorrow. 
a pack of Santee Drifters. And of course, if you win, make sure you email me at palmettocats.com. That's scrolling across the bottom right now. All right, I'm going to try this again. <laughs> I'd like to thank, thank our overall tournament sponsor, which is the Catfish Conference, Herve and Steve over there at the Catfish Conference. They, for the winner, the grand champion of the Iron Cat Ladies Tournament, will win a free night stay uh, in a hotel in Kansas City, Missouri for the Catfish Conference here in November and a set of tickets. So that's the grand prize. Um, and how we're going to decide that. The ladies have decided that the winner from today and the winner from tomorrow will have a fish off. So we'll do another fish off with the two winners and uh, whoever wins that will be the grand champion. Um, and they, the ladies will decide when we'll, we'll coordinate. I'll have to help too. So we'll decide when we're free. Um, you know, we'll, we'll try to keep it at, on a good time slot so everybody can watch. But, uh, you know, people people work, and we're going to get that scheduled. But the winner of the – the overall winner will get that prize. So thank you, Herve and Steve, for donating that awesome prize. That's an expensive prize. I mean, that's that's a couple hundred dollars um, just to stay in that hotel. And it's a nice – I think it's the Crown Plaza Hotel. So, I mean, it's, it's a nice hotel. Um, so how do they win? Becca, do you have it memorized how they win? Uh, what do you, what do you mean? <laughs> <laughs> no, I'm just picking with you. So how, how do we win? How do you win an Iron Cat tournament? Well, uh, this is a, a last angler standing challenge, which means from 8 a.m. Eastern to 12 p.m. Eastern, they have to catch at least one catfish 16 inches or longer. And um, it doesn't matter what species. So it could be bullhead, white catfish, blue catfish, flathead, uh, whatever species. It doesn't matter. As long as it's 16 inches or over, it qualifies. Um, so if they catch a fish in the first four hours, and that's been Bex, Jody, and Missy have all caught a fish in the first four hours so far. They move on to round two, which is from 12 p.m. to 2 p.m. And so they have – those two hours to catch another fish, 16 inches or longer. If they catch a fish in that time frame, they move on to round three, where they'll have to catch a fish 16 inches or longer uh, every hour. And the last angler standing will win today's tournament. Um, if we have more than one competitor that takes an hour to catch a fish in the round three, then we'll go to Southern, su Southern death. <laughs> That's called heat. <laughs> I was like, say, wait a minute. <laughs> sudden death, which means that the first fish caught 16, first catfish caught 16 inches or longer will win. So that's how you win. Yes, uh, there are two cat cons this year. The first one will be in November of this year, the 19th and the 20th in Kansas City, Missouri. And then you'll have the original one in February uh, in Kentucky, as always. See, you explain that so much better than me. When you said, how do they win? I was going to say, well, they catch fish. You know, <laughs> that's how they win. Well, look at this, y'all. Ladies, Paint Services by Steve said, for one, he did a super chat to say it. Thank you so much. But then he said, I'll send a Bill Dance Catfish Special Rod to the winner from today and the winner from tomorrow. That's awesome. Thank you, Steve, for doing that. That's very, very generous. Nice. Very, generous. very generous. You know, there's a lot of generous people out here. It's, there it's, pretty, it's pretty amazing. You yeah, know, I, just I, I can honestly say that everyone up on screen is generous as well. Everyone's so giving. You know, I mean, it's a it's a little bit of everything. It's, you know, from anything from ninety nine cents up to like you know his hundred bucks. I mean, you think they're everybody's working, you know, they're spending their hard earned money. You know, they don't have to do it, but they're just wonderful. All the people that are just sitting here watching everything, Absolutely. you know, it, it's just amazing. And they yeah, don't and even realize how much they're you know they're contributing just by sitting here and watching. Yeah, exactly. And I was going to say that if you didn't say it, 
You know, even if even if you're not able to donate anything, just you giving the watch time and and number one, supporting lady anglers. I mean, we've had 153 people in here solid for over an hour now. Um, being here to support all these ladies, showing them that uh, they're just as important as any male angler out there. So we're going to watch you and we're going to make sure that you feel supported. And then number two, giving the watch time to my channel, just being in here, you just you watching helps me out. Um, the fact that you watch that commercial helps the channel out. Um, and then if you go even a step further, you can help out even more by just going and visiting the links in the description, all the ladies' channels, um, and all of my sponsors' channels or websites. So thank you. Well said, Miss Becca. Well said. And we're doing a giveaway right now. Speaking of sponsors, Jimmy from Fishing and Gear, SantiDrifters.com has donated a couple packs of Santee Drifters for the tournament. There's Mr. Elston, Mr. Chunky Cats. What's going on, Chunkster? You know, he was he was pretty amazing. And I actually I actually cried because we have, um, speaking of chunky, we got a big fish on the chunky rod. Okay. <laughs> Go ahead, Miss Becker. Uh, chunky actually sent me one of his rods. And I I literally it, when I saw that thing, because I you know, I didn't even know it was coming. And I saw it sitting when I opened that box. I really did. I literally cried. You that's know, awesome. that's awesome. Yeah, he he told me he was gonna do that for you, and I was like, she's gonna be so surprised and happy to get that thing. That's awesome. And I t I, I told him I'm not gonna cry up here on screen. I'm not gonna do it. <laughs> no, nope, not gonna do it. Let's Skin see. and scales, welcome. Just got Mr. home from Bob. work. This is awesome and a great way to relax. That is true. But, you know, one thing that I do, um, one thing that I sometimes do when I'm watching these tournaments is so relaxing that I'll fall asleep on the couch. <laughs> but with all this fixed action, it's hard to fall asleep. That's There's right. Mr. Garrett, fishing musician. Painting Service by Steve says, uh, do a drawing for a rod also, Kevin. Wow. Wow. Thank T. Lynn so from Steve. Tennessee says, let's go, Miss Jody." Fantastic. Awesome. All right. Well, let's give away this pack of Santee Drifters. Here we go. Boom. 72 people entered. Let's see who is the lucky winner. I better Take start doing these giveaways quicker. Hey! Wow, Mr. Mark. Mark. <laughs> it's not a conspiracy. You have one. <laughs> Mark <laughs> was joking. He was joking, but he said that he thinks StreamYard has a conspiracy against him because <laughs> he always sees his name go by. Well, there you go, Mark. <laughs> I think he was osmosis and. There you go. <laughs> Congratulations, man. It's like Bex is still reeling that fish in. It must be a good one. I know. I was like, how much line went out there? I think I was watching uh, Catterman, and I, I didn't even realize that because, you know, sometimes you know, he fishes for sharks and stuff. And yeah. Sometimes they actually have to walk the line out so far. I mean, they not walk it. They put it in their little uh, kayak or whatever it is. They, you know, they row out so far. Then they cast it out and then come back. So that's pretty interesting to me. Man, this one's like, looks like a good fish. It's hard to tell on those whisker seeker rods if that's a whisker seeker that she's got. Hey there, Mr. Eddie Gross and Carmel Muncy. Chunky says 35. What's up, two vets, two old vets? Hey, 
Oh, I heard somebody else say fish on. Oh, Miss Jody. Oh, Jody's got one. And the race is on. <laughs> <laughs> what is that big rod Bex is using? She says a chunky rod. Hi there, Mr. Rez. How you doing? All right, y'all. We got two fish on, two fish at a time. Bex from No Real Loss and Pontoon Joe. She's putting her back into that one. What do we got you left for time? You can do it. Put your back into it. You got two hours left in round one. Right on the dot. Oh, Chunky said that's an ugly stick catfish special nine foot. All right. Mr. Rob, two L vets is in the house. You can do it. Put your back into it. <laughs> Skin and scales, what's going on? Yeah, that was a cheer that I uh, used to do back in school, you know. Yeah. Well, you probably heard them all since you're there. Oh, but, yeah. yeah. Oh, yeah. <laughs> and then, of course, we always end it with, you know, beat it, bust it, but they need to reel it, you know, reel it, catch it. <laughs> Rams bait and tackle. I'm um, San Antonio is in the house. Mr. Lance. Uh, fishing around Chicago, a bill says, Lorian, what made you uh, choose that spot? No, uh, well, I came down, checked it out yesterday. <laughs> and it's um, away from the boat dock. And it's in the shade. It's still on the Great PD River. And I didn't have to, like, mow it down. Well, my actual bank that I'm usually on, uh, the grass and everything is all grown up. Right. And being that it's something new, I just wanted to try a new spot and something different. I mean, I'm still in the Great PD, but it's different. So. Man, Bex is still reeling that fish in, y'all. That's where those Jody's, mussels come from. Jody's got hers on the deck. Tootie said, I'm rooting for my gal Lori. Nice. <laughs> oh, that's Tootie, my mother. Oh, okay. <laughs> I've seen her in a video. Yes. Rootin' tootin' Tootie. Well, the next giveaway is going to be a... We're catching so many fish. I got to do this in between fish or while we're catching fish. This is a sticker from Fishing Cooking with Mike Chavez. Good looking sticker. Oh, there's another flathead from Jody. All right. That makes four for Miss Jody. Yep. Nice flathead, Jody. You're frozen up right now. It'll unfreeze. There you go. Nice fish. Nice fish. Summerbot says Miss Jody's going to bring home the bacon. <laughs> She's gonna bring home the catfish nuggets. Bring them home the bacon. Da, 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 da. And Bex is like, still, this must be a big fish, y'all. I mean, she's been fighting that thing for five minutes. Like, no doubt. There goes Bonnie netting it. All right, it's in the net, looks like. Nope, not yet. Mr. Brent, uh, fins and fowl is in the house. Jody is the flathead slayer today. So here, while she's fighting that, hashtag Chavez. Hashtag Chavez will win that sticker. Welcome, Mr. Jeremy's Tournament Cats. He's telling everybody, go ladies. Man. This is like the fight of the century right here. So you guys are pulling in the fish. I'm over here on an online fishing tournament. You guys are... <laughs> I think Vani is like in the water. Oh yeah, because it almost looks like she's losing her balance a little. And this is an interesting fight. I wonder if it's hung up in something. Maybe that's what she's doing. Thank <laughs> you. 
Uh, make sure that everybody in the chat, make sure that y'all put your hashtag Chavez the exact way that you see it up on screen. I believe some of y'all are spelling it incorrectly. That is a big fish. I see it. And you only have to enter it once. Um, but if you have if you have misspelled it, please go back and re-enter it. Just like that, y'all. No spaces. Mr. Aaron is in the house. Catfish regulators. Mr. George wants his Mike Chavez sticker. <laughs> it's a good looking sticker now. I, I, I'm not going to lie. I got one on the boat. Oh, she got another rod going down. Zan Z is in the house. That's a new name that I don't recognize. <laughs> Welcome. Look at that, y'all. Bex has got another rod going down. Choose your battles, Bex. Choose your battles. <laughs> 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 Don't worry about us, Bex. You get the fish. Mr. Jeremy, I'm actually working on my logo right now. So when I do all that, then I'll get some stickers. I'm actually thinking about changing my channel name. I mean it's gonna stay the same. It just I'll just drop off the 0715 and I'm gonna put Beck in the front of it. I'm just curious to see his fish. Looks like she ran and grabbed the grippers. Maybe it's too big to fit in the net. Oh, they got it. I heard a woo. This might be a new big fish, y'all. Maybe a new PB? Mm -hmm. Last chance to enter. Hashtag Chavez. I got to get moving on these giveaways. I got too many... Too many to do and not enough time to do it. That's a song. <laughs> I got oh, no. too That's... many to do. Yeah. <laughs> if it's not a song, I can definitely make a song. I can, I can have Rap and Lori to back me up. Yeah, right? <laughs> <laughs> Mr. Got, Nick, so goes in the house. I got my rhyme master, Miss Becca. You know, I just actually finished the lyrics to one to one of my songs. I thought for sure, Kevin, the cooler weather was going to have the bite on down here. I, I mean, it's not. It's still a morning. I mean, doesn't mean it's off. How how often have you uh, replaced your baits or recasted? Have you done often, anything like often. that? Okay. Yeah. I'll move in there. Yep. Yeah. Oh, no. Did we lose Bex? No. Yes, we did. Uh oh. She better fix that. I think that was a new PB. All right, here we go. We're gonna give away this sticker. Hopefully, Ooh. she's not doing that for dramatic effect. I hope not. Because <laughs> everybody's biting down their nails. Ernie Brown. Oh, no. <laughs> Downtown Ernie Brown. Way to go. Ernie Brown. Chrissy, tell Ernie he won the sticker. <laughs> you won the sticker. Did you come back? No. Nope. Not, not yet. You're hitting all the falls. The suspense is killing me. I know. It's like, come. Come back. Man, I can't find Mike's name on my list. Where did I put? There it is. Ernie Brown. Downtown Ernie Brown. Just want him a sticker. Downtown. Fishing and Freedom is in the house. Welcome. D.L. King. James Poston. Uh, Mr. Bill says, Lorianne, you need to move. There's Bex. I need some hearts. All I need right. some love over here. All right, Bex, show us what you caught. Hmm. 
We see you. We see you. Can't see it. Huh? Can't see that. Do I have a phone? Or your phone? Hold on a second. Hold on a second, buddy. Watch the phone. Can they hear us? I don't think so. Oh. I just sent a message, told her we heard her. <laughs> we got to see that fish. <laughs> I can't go through all that without seeing that fish. Oh, she looked like she was pretty beat up there, too. Hey, Stevan, if you have Vonnie's number, text him and told him, tell him we saw him. Here they come. We see you. There we go. Do we have a world record, Vonnie? And the chat stops. This will make oh, look, at oh. look at her lifting that fish. Oh. It's big. <laughs> Holy smokes. Hey, tilt oh, the camera wow. down a little bit. Tilt the phone down a little bit. That looks like she's holding an alligator. <laughs> Give me a second. Put the camera down. This makes number 17 from his bags. This is going to be a new PB. Look at her. Holy smokes. <laughs> She's like, Bonnie, come read it. <laughs> what is this? 56, 9. Whoa. 56, 9, 7. 56, 7. 56. Take off the, the net. A, a, 1.6 for the net. Man, take the 56. You got it, girl. Yeah, 56. We're going to call 56 it 56. 56 all day. Holy. Guys, I fell in. Trying to get them. All right, I'm going to show you guys. Smoke. I'm going to take this and move it down. So wow. that would be, what, what, how does it go? That would be a chunky's like 70. Is that how that goes? <laughs> Chunky style. <laughs> Holy cow. Okay. Tilt your camera down. Tilt your camera yeah. down so you don't have to lift it so high. Even Miss Amy's. Look at that. Smokes. Look at that monster. Miss yeah. Amy's even saying, way to go, Bigs. Yeah. All right, we're going to get him back in the water. You got to pick him up. Y'all got to pick him up. You got to get a photo with you. Wait, wait, wait. Yeah. Tilt the camera up. Tilt the camera up a little bit. Yeah, somebody get a <laughs> Oh, <laughs> too far. <laughs> Has is giving his sweet doggy on that one. Tilt it down just a little bit. There, right there, perfect. All right, y'all. Look at that! <laughs> Holy Moby catfish! New PB and new tournament big fish. That was definitely a team effort. Y'all go let that pig go. Fifty-six pounds. Wow. And Great job. The best Great part job. about this is that it's going back in the water, y'all. Yay! It's going back in the water so that somebody else can catch it. Isn't that awesome? Yeah, could you push it in my direction? <laughs> <laughs> yeah, well, give them your address. Yeah, yeah. <laughs> Catfish Hero says, da -da -da -donkey. <laughs> Yes, wow. Stick so a note in its mouth you. and I'll find it. <laughs> the note that in the bottle. Is, <laughs> that is an absolute beast. Wow. Oh, I can't stop smiling. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, and, and the fact even... is they, they both had to, I mean, they both had to hold it up. Can you imagine the weight on that sucker? Yeah. I mean, anybody would need help. You guys are gonna have to start carrying a lull, uh, what a, not a lull. What do you call those things that you use to uh, a dolly? Yeah. <laughs> well, I knew it was big because they they fought that thing for like five or six minutes, and then like Vonnie was down there swimming with it. <laughs> she yeah, was like trying to bear hug. 
Goodness gracious. Hi there, Mr. Maurice Kaysen. I hope you and your wife are doing well. Wow. She stays on my prayer list. I like this comment. Buck Williams said, Bex has dethroned Chunky. She is now the DC queen. <laughs> wow. You <better> get it. <laughs> wow, wow, wow. I know Stevan wishes he was there to celebrate with them. <laughs> Whew, man, that's a... That's going to be hard to beat that one for Big Fish, I, I must say. That's, that's going to be hard. I think uh, two stands, uh, three might be behind in the chat. Bex, tell us. you you got to give us a little rundown. Uh, so, <laughs> the drag started peeling, obviously, right? Hold on. <laughs> So Boom, where man, we are, super where we are is a big wall. And not a big wall, like a drop. About five foot drop. And there's two rocky banks for you to try and net the fish. And so obviously for the longest time, it was just pulling me back and forth. I only had 25 pound line on. No, a 30 pound line on. Um, so really taking my time. I hope you guys can hear me okay. Yep, we can. And, Seven uh, says, Bex, I am proud of... I'm jumping up and down. <laughs> and then he said, proud of my girl. And he said, Bex voice changed. That means she's super happy. <laughs> I, I am. I'm super happy. Um, Bonnie fell in the in the drink. Uh, I, I tried to tell her to stop running back and forth between these two ledges because I was like, we got a long time. But she was determined because that's, you know, that's what, a, coming close. that's what a good partner does. And uh, finally, we got it out. <laughs> Well, congratulations. I, I think both of you get to claim that as your uh, PB. All right. Because there's, there's no way that you, either one of you, I mean, y'all could have ended up getting it in by yourself eventually, but it looked like Bonnie was in that water wrestling the catfish. <laughs> awesome. Awesome. Great job, ladies. Oh, all right. I'm not sure. <laughs> Chrissy's fingers. Is that Chrissy's fingers? Yeah, it's her fingers. <laughs> <laughs> that is not Islands in the Stream. <laughs> <No>. <laughs> oh. So y'all, obviously we've we we've got some people that aren't up on screen. Missy texted me and said that she uh her trans her power steering went out in her car. The truck. Uh, Bex Von, y'all are muted if you're trying to say something. Okay. Um, and then looks like we lost uh, Alicia too. And then I got it, Chavez. Thank you. And then it looks like we also, uh, Sharina is waiting for her spot to open up. All right, there's Alicia coming back. There she is. Oh, look at that shirt, hey. too. Uh, yep. Nice shirt. <laughs> <Woo -hoo>. Right? <laughs> <laughs> and I got circle hooks productions right here as the hat. Yeah. To go with that. So, Uncle Lou, up. yeah, she just caught, her and Bonnie just caught a 50. Oh, we got fish on. Hold on. Sorry. Boom, there it is. Chrissy Brown's on the board. Way to go, Miss Chrissy. There you go. Chrissy, that's a nice channel cut, isn't it? Yeah. Congratulations, you're moving on to round two. Hi. I was wondering what all that moving was for. <laughs> I, was at the, I was using the restroom when it happened. That's what I was doing. <laughs> Do you need me to measure it? No, ma'am. That's definitely over 16 inches. Okay, he said that's definitely over. So, but if you would show the camera one more time, so we can see, we can see your awesome channel cat. That's a nice channel cat. quarter. Nice. Stick your hand on it and hold his belly out there, Chris. What do you mean? 
Dude, yeah, it's gotta be way up flat. No, we got it. That's definitely over 16. Thanks, y'all, for measuring it, though. Good. Nice channel, cat. Can you take a picture for John? Yeah, you can. All right. right. Good job. I might be able to. Uh, Just use mine. Wait, if you get, get down, down there. Come over this way and go down. Yeah, definitely nice channel, Cat. So, Miss Chrissy Brown is moving on to round two. Congratulations, Chrissy. So, the standings right now, I got, uh, correct me if I'm wrong, but I got no real loss at 17. Uh, with, yep. the biggest, with the biggest fish at 56 pounds. And that's going to be hard to beat. <laughs> then we got Miss Misty with one. Got Miss Chrissy with one now. She's on the board. And Miss Jody with four. Man, I got the biggest cotton mouth right now swimming. I mean, it's so freaking close. I can see the colors right on the back. <laughs> Ryan Board said, Alicia, get out of my spot. <laughs> <laughs> oh, and I forgot. Miss Amy with the biggest turtle. Yep. <laughs> Second, I need, I need breath. All right. And I forgot... I need to do better. I have all these hats over here because I'm planning on supporting everybody today. And I already gave away a three plus one sticker and I forgot to put the hat on. So here it is. Sorry about that. <laughs> There's just so many fish being caught. I just <laughs> don't know. Oh, man. All right. See, cool. I, can't, I can't wear a lot of those. Like everybody that normally has, you know, the hats. Uh -huh. um, I, because I wear, believe it or not, I wear a junior's. I got a really small, you know, head, so it's hard for me to wear like regular ones because they don't, they're too loose on me. Gotcha. All right. Oh, where are we? <laughs> Man, I've got, I got to get to these giveaways, y'all. Yeah, Dan, I wouldn't worry about the thumbs down, man. People, people hit a thumbs down on a charity giveaway, man. They don't care. <laughs> I, I don't I don't worry about it. I'm so happy for all the thumbs up. That's what I'm gonna focus on. All the awesome thumbs up. All right. Did we yes, we just gave away the three plus one sticker. The or, Mike Chavez. The Mike Chavez sticker, yeah. yeah. I can't Say wait for Mike Chavez Kini. to get a hat. Oh, Buck Williams says Bex, after you catch your breath, we need to see a dance. Oh, yeah, for sure. <laughs> oh, Fishing and Freedom, $2. Thank you so much. Amy is holding out for dramatic effect. Go, Team Amy. <laughs> and then uh, we had we had another super chat earlier while Bex was giving us the rundown. I think it was from Wayne again. Thank you, Wayne. I appreciate it. Uh, and if y'all, if I ever miss one, Becca, if you see me miss one, please let me know, and yeah. I'll be sure to go back. All right. Let's see. Lots of awesome convex is going for the second title. That's right. Oop. Ryan Bort says, come on, Alicia. You got this. Uh, let's see. Alicia has fallen off the stream, so hopefully she'll be back in a second. What's up, Aaron? How you doing? We've got so many fish, so many fish on the board right now. It's it's and, and, and some big fish too. We have a 29 pound flathead, a, a 19 pound blue, and a 56 pound blue. We've got a channel cat now, thanks to Chrissy. Uh, we've got three flatheads, and I don't even know how many blues. I mean, uh, no real loss has 17 blues. Uh, Jody has. Two flatheads and two blues. Missy has a flathead, and Chrissy has a channel cat. So lots of good fish being caught. Our next giveaway, y'all, we're going to give away a reel. Let's do it. Enter hashtag Cast King. We're going to give away this Cast King Spartacus spinning reel. It's a 5,000 series. Um, we found a good deal on these on Amazon, Amazon, and we bought a bunch of Me and a couple guys did. And so... Uh, Cast King Spartacus. If you're a spinning reel person or you just need a good spinning reel, enter in hashtag Cast King and you'll, and you'll be entered in your chance to win one of those reels. And even if you're not, enter it anyway because that would be a good gift for somebody. 
That's a beautiful reel. Yeah, I just put my inner in for that. <laughs> <laughs> I got rods I need to put reels on. <laughs> yeah, yeah, you do. And y'all, we have some upcoming giveaways. We have a catfish hat, uh, a, ha a hand counter, so you can keep track of your fish. I might send Bex one of those just because. <laughs> Bex and Chuck. Right. And uh, let's see, we got, we got some team catfish hooks. We have some CUDA scissors. We have a whole ton of stickers that I got to get to. Um, we already gave away a Palma de Cats t shirt. We have a hook uh, and a Bill Dance rod we have to give away. So we got tons of stuff. And I got to get moving on these or else we're going to run out of time. Catfish Weekly said he needs a counter. Uh, please visit all the links in the description, y'all. This is not the only day of the tournament. Tomorrow starts day two of the Iron Cat Lady Angler Tournament. We have uh, Katie Collins, Catfishing Katie Collins tomorrow. We have Lisa, the Fishing Chick, tomorrow. We also have Rebecca from Carolina Real Screamers, who's going to be in the tournament tomorrow. And we have Lizabella from Angler Holics. Sorry, I got distracted. <laughs> so we have Lizabella, Catfishing Katie Collins, Lisa from Fishing Chick, and Rebecca from Carolina Reel Screamers. We had so many ladies enter that I couldn't get them all on the same day, which is amazing. Um, just a year ago, we didn't have that many uh, ladies that publicly fished for, for catfish. I'm sure there were always um there but now they're out they feel confident they're being supported everybody in the community has been awesome supporting all lady anglers and it's just this this is just the start of it all i'm sure steve seller says where's my feller here's your come on sharina she is waiting for her spot to open uh she didn't have very good service on the last one Pink Palm Princess. Let's go, ladies. Let's represent. Pontoon Jody got to catch something. She's got 20 rods out. She's she's actually already caught um, four. And she's only got six rods, six rods out. But uh, just to clarify. <laughs> um, but she uh, she's got four fish, and the biggest being a 29-pound flathead. So. Jody is holding her own for sure. Kevin, you should send me one just because. <laughs> Man, if I had it like that, I'd send everyone a reel. I feel that way. I feel like sometimes I just wish I could just do the whole, you know, just everybody. It's, it's Yeah. Avery Honeycutt, see, welcome. We're doing a Cast King giveaway. We got 91 people entered in. We got 169 people watching. Boom! We got a super chat from Dagabound 205 Wild Action. Two dollars. These ladies are putting in the putting in work. Yes, they are. They're doing a great job. We've caught so many fish. What's the total fish right now, Becca? The total fish right now is 17, 18. 17, let's see, 17, 18, 19, 20, 21, 22, 23. 23 fish in the first two and a half hours. That's not bad. Not bad at all. I was supposed to be doing things today, said Kane Sample. <laughs> you know, I can't believe in that one tournament uh, that that uh, did the uh, did a couple weeks ago or whatever. I can't believe that they caught 130 yeah. catfish. That was that nuts. Was, yeah, that blew my mind. And all from the bank, right? Yeah, they were all from bank. Woo. All right, we got people popping back in. What's up, Jeremy Colvin Fishing? 29 pounds, that's what I'm talking about. Ladies represent, going to subscribe to this right now. This is different, and I'm digging it. Well, thank you, Straight Malicious. Welcome to the stream. We see you, Bex and Bonnie. All right. Sorry, not sure what's going on. 
I see uh, Jeremy Cohen. If that uh, if we're fishing here, the phone would be on fire because it's hot. <laughs> <laughs> All right, cool. We got a hundred and two. Man, people really want this reel, don't they? All right, here we go. Let's give it away. Boom. Welcome, Mark Greer, He's Whisker and Stripes, G Style. Oh, John Boy said I meant a clicker, not a reel. You can get them pretty cheap on Amazon. G Style Fishing. Congratulations. I've seen you in here plenty of times. I appreciate you. Send me an email and anybody who wins. Uh, if you win a prize, you must email me at palmettacats at gmail.com with your name, what you've won, and your mailing address. Don't send me a message on uh, any other platform, Twitter, Instagram, nothing like Well, I don't have a Twitter for this one. But uh, send me an email. That's the only way you'll get to redeem your prize. Congratulations. All right, we got Miss Missy popping up here. Looks like she's laying down. Missy, you okay? Yeah, I'm looking for Um, let me get back to y'all a little bit, okay? Okay. What's that? She okay, said, let, let her get back with him a little bit. Okay, yeah, take your time. Take your time. You've already gone on to round two. So as long as you're in here by, we, uh, by the time we start round two, you'll be fine, okay? Okay. Yeah, you All take right. care of yourself, girl. Yep. Oh, looks like Bex has got another one. She's walking up with the net here. And another one. And another Ooh, okay. one. <laughs> <Can you fire? laughs> All right. Chad said, uh, there he is. That's another good one. We got they're, Bex. They're a lighter color blue there. Yeah. Chaz said, I've been with my girlfriend for six years. She's never been catfishing till she got with me. Now every weekend she has to go fishing, so it's awesome to watch ladies fishing. There you go. Miss Tootie says, there must be no fish in the whack-a-mole. <laughs> uh, we're going to get Lori started here. <laughs> Good thing I'm on the great TV. Ah. <laughs> we have a, a Lily Blue in the house. That's a new name for me. And another one. And another one. Whiskers and Stripes, what's going on? Yep, Kane that said, makes, Let's go, ladies. Makes 18 for no real loss and a total of 24 fish all together. <laughs> I'm fine with that, two old vets. Yeah. Go check me out on um, Instagram. I'm on Instagram and Facebook. I have a uh, Facebook page. It's uh, just a fan page. It's not a group or anything. But I share a lot of pictures there and and uh, all kinds of stuff. Uh, Miss Melissa, the counts are no real loss with 18. Uh, yourself with one. Miss Chrissy with one, and Miss Jody with four, and then the the largest so far is fifty six pounds for no real loss. Okay, cool. I'll try uh, <laughs> try to get to all these. Uh, let me message him back. Willie, I'm gonna message you back. Fish on. All right, Amy's what? on. Go, Miss Amy. It's small. It's a fish. It's a fish. I'll take it right now. No. I got you, Catfishing America. Hey, I remember that spot y'all are fishing. They were fishing that spot when they made their 800th subscriber. Yeah. It's a turtle. It's another turtle. Another turtle. Oh Lord, Amy's yeah, gonna start cooking these things. Yeah. I should say we having a big old oh, pot of turtle steak. Right that's a big snapper. It ain't a soft fish. That's a snapping turtle. Yeah. 
Yeah, that ain't a happy turtle. <laughs> look at that look on Amy's face. She's about to beat that thing to death. It's That's how we get face. after a long day of fishing and not catching anything. It's snappy. Yeah. Snappy. <laughs> And the signal, the cell phone signal is not treating some people good today. Uh, just a false alarm. We got a turtle, y'all. All right, so I'm getting all kinds of messages about giveaway, so I need to, I need to keep going. Let's do the catfish hat next. I'm gonna put on my catfish hat to show you that it's a different one. <laughs> people are like, "You're giving away the one you're wearing." Oh, that's not a catfish hat. I was just gonna say, wait a minute. <laughs> I've got all kinds of hats over here. I'm all messed up. Good go. morning, Mr. Steve Austin. How you doing? There we go. Good morning, Mr. P. Hunt. How you doing? All right, we're gonna give away his catfish hat right here. It's uh, black with a white mesh snapback. Uh, I'll be sending it out, and it's got green. You can't really see that, but it's green writing. All right, thanks, Brooks. Appreciate that. All right, looks like Alicia might be trying to keep her phone from overheating. All right, enter hashtag catfish with a K. Hashtag catfish with a K to win this awesome catfish hat. This is the exact hat you will win. Make sure you enter it as it is on the screen. There we go. Thank you for catfish to being a, for being a tournament sponsor. Their um, their link is in the description, y'all. They have awesome apparel, boards, cutting boards. Um, uh, some scent sprays you can buy, shirts. Uh, is catfish is, is a lifestyle, y'all. And you see people wearing catfish gear everywhere. I've seen pictures of people wearing them, uh, wearing hats and shirts when their babies are being born, when they're getting married. <laughs> it's crazy. People love this company. So uh, it'd now be there, an honor to win this. Go there ahead. has been a little talk in here. Um, Catfish in America, I think if I read that right, he said that he likes to give a guided fishing trip away, but that yes, might be something that he needs to contact you like ahead of time to do details or something. Yeah, um, well, what I'm going to do is I'll give it away. I wrote it down and then I'll let them contact him and they can work out whatever they need to work out. <sighs> But yes, I do appreciate that catfish in America. That's not the first time he's done that. I really appreciate it. Right. I see. I've seen him do that before. Dex, you're getting to sit down. In the water. <laughs> I'm ordering food. So I, I'm, I'm ordering food. Is it $100 in pizza? Uh, it's probably going to be like $200 in food. She hasn't eaten yet today. <laughs> Y'all have killed it, and congratulations on your PB. I know you were out of breath earlier. You really couldn't talk, but congratulations. Yeah, that's, that's, a, that's an awesome fish. Like, that's just amazing. That's a that's a fish of a lifetime for a lot of people, including yeah. me. <laughs> yeah. Hey, Kevin, we're going to oh, make it I'm glad I got to do it with you guys. All right, no problem. Heads busting, all this going down like it blows my mind. Yeah, we're it's it's awesome. Is that feedback noise coming from Becca? I I doubt it, but no, I don't. I'm in my house. There ain't nothing going on in here. It was Jody. They're talking about that little popping stuff. Yeah, no, so I don't I'll, ever have I'll, that. I'll mute people, but we just uh, Miss Becca will just have to help me watch for fish because we won't be able to hear him say fish on. Look who's joining us all the way from the great state of Arizona. Oh, what's going on? I didn't expect to go on. I wanted to see if I got reception. She's testing it out. You know, if you popped up backstage, we had to bring you up. Oh, shoot. Uh, wait, how's my hair? Is there anything uh, in my teeth? 
<laughs> you look gorgeous, girl. Oh, Lord have mercy. Y'all caught me off guard. <laughs> <laughs> well, the, the signal looks great. Better than I've ever seen you, actually. Oh, good, 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 good. Yeah, sounds awesome, too. Okay, oh, good. Yeah, and I, uh, I made a little something to keep the heat off my uh, phone. My little box. Can you see that? Oh, wow. Check that oh, yeah. out. Hold on. Put a little fan put that up. on it. A little fan on it. I Look at that. that. Is that noise gonna? That's probably gonna be too much, huh? Uh uh. Well, why don't you put it in there and let's test it out while you're here? Oh well, heck, let me see here. Y'all gonna look at my mug here. <laughs> <laughs> I did not expect to go on. <laughs> Always expect the unexpected. Lord Surprise. Okay, let's see. So here goes the fan. Mm, I mean, it's kind of half and half. So what you'll have to do is when you when you want to talk to us, you'll just have to turn it off. But it's not like it's not annoying. You know what I'm saying? Yeah. Like a popping or a, or a feedback noise like that. Yeah. Yeah, it's not no. like my voice. <laughs> <laughs> you, you hush. <laughs> But hey, when you're out in Arizona and it's 200 million degrees, you do oh, what you need to do to stay alive. Right. <laughs> yeah, I got a, I got a cool little area here. Um, looks good, but the current's really fast. I'm picking up a lot of weeds. Right. A lot of weeds. So if y'all are wondering, uh, Lisa from Fishing Chick, uh, she's going to be in the tournament tomorrow. So uh, we look forward to that. And she's just popping. She messaged me, said, I'm going to pop up. But uh, she didn't know she was going to be on screen. <laughs> well, awesome. Well, are you going to do any fishing today while you're out there? Just a little bit. I'm going to run into bait and uh, outside. Gotcha. So, gotcha. Hope all good luck. I'm about ready to drop out there. Man, what was she, that? Oh, Bex is just killing it out there. Yes, she is. <laughs> I'm like, oh man, but that's all right. I'm just gonna come out here, have some fun. That's right. That's what it's all about. And, uh, and I want to wish luck and thanks for putting this on, Kevin. This is awesome. Oh yeah, thanks for letting me. <laughs> all right, ladies. We y'all are. I mean, Lisa, y'all have a good one. All right, brother. Okay, girls. Good luck, and I'll catch you guys later. Hey, right. does. See you tomorrow. Awesome. Hey, backbone. There's Mr. Brad Caudillo. Brad's in the house. We're going to give away his weights tomorrow. I can't wait. Get it? I can't wait. <laughs> <laughs> Must be getting hot out there in Tennessee. Uh, Pontoon Jody's got the visor on. There's Mr. Jeff Elsler. <laughs> Welcome. Really? What you got there? Eating those snacks since it's what I know about. All right. There's snacks. Those of you who asked what the snacks were. They're Krispy Kreme mini curlers. Oh, wow. I want one. Ooh. <laughs> Can you, like, shove one through the screen? I'll eat one for you. <laughs> okay. Just make sure you throw a few of those little mmm in there. <laughs> okay. <laughs> She said, okay. <laughs> <laughs> All right, here we go. Let's give away this catfish hat, everybody. 99 people entered. I'm sure we can get to 100. I'll wait for a second. We're giving away this awesome catfish hat. I meant to say that um, you know, you can visit catfishclothing.com and you can save 20% on your order. I have a discount code in the description, too, if you don't win this one. But if you still want to get an awesome hat, you can check it out in the description. Buck Williams wants to know what time tomorrow? 12 p.m. Eastern Standard Time. Um, I want to make sure that everybody has a chance that they, if they do, that they can go to church and uh, still come and watch all of the action. So uh, it'll start 12 p.m. Eastern Standard Time. And we'll go from there. 
<laughs> a moment on the lips, a lifetime on your hips. So we're okay with that. <laughs> I was say, gee, thanks. I don't want it anymore. <laughs> don't remind us. <laughs> <laughs> it was good for a moment. Okay. <laughs> <laughs> All right, looks like we got some more people joining uh, joining that catfish giveaway. 105, that's more like it. Here we go. And boom. Good luck, everybody. It's an awesome hat. I have one almost like this. Mr. Mr. Tully. Tully. Congratulations. Mr. Tully, you know the deal. Send me an email, palmettacats at gmail.com with your address and what you won. And I'll get that out to you. Congratulations, man. I love when that little giveaway tool does all those little, what are they called? Not sprinkles, but what is that called? Confetti. Oh, yeah. <laughs> yeah, like yeah, and we don't have to clean it up. That's the best nope. part. No. Nope. <laughs> all right, cool. Uh, Miss Beckett, while I'm setting up the next giveaway, would you like to go over the, um, you know what? I, I, we gave away that Spartacus, but I think something happened and I forgot to write it down. Who won? Do you remember who won that one? Uh, no, but I can tell you in just a second. Okay. Uh, sorry, I wanted Eric. to say it was G style, but I don't. <laughs> I don't yeah, know if that's that was, what it was. G style. Okay. You're right. Okay. I just want to make sure that that was the right one. I can tell you who it was not. <laughs> <laughs> <Ms. Bud Trent. laughs> uh, we can't push the time back, Eric, um, because we don't want to go into the evening hours with the tournament. But y'all make sure to check out hashtag Fish Church. Eric Burnside has a Bible study every Sunday. Make sure you check him out. People all the time have multiple streams running. I know Becca does, and I do too. You know the deal. Yeah, I still got to. Um, I'm. I still got to do. I'm gonna do a little tiny live stream. It won't be very long, you know. Believe it or not, uh, but uh, <laughs> I still got to give away the surprise prize that I'm gonna give away from that seven to seven. Uh -huh. It's all the any all the competitors that did not place or did not win one of those five categories. I wanted to give them a chance to win something. So I'm putting all of them in a hat or drawing and then they're, then they're going to win. Awesome. That's, that's really cool. But I hadn't said what the prize yet is. <laughs> uh, Ernie said, Chrissy's phone keeps overheating. Yeah, we understand that. You need one of them boxes that Lisa built. <laughs> oh, looky there. Mr. G style says, I'd like to give the real to Bex. Oh, okay. Awesome. Look at Bex's face. <laughs> boom, 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 boom. <laughs> You'll be lost. Boom, 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 boom. Thank you. That's amazing. What? What did you get? A real. <laughs> yeah. Thank you. I know that Thanks, is Gisa. really, okay. really amazing. <laughs> Man, the cheese is, is flowing hard in here today. <laughs> oh, that's awesome, dude. Thank you for that. And it's going to go back to a lady so she can keep catching them fitties. You can start over the one here. I know. I'm that's not going to get really more amazing ever. for no real loss. Yep. <laughs> exactly. <laughs> that looks like a cool spot there, Amy. Probably. Yeah, we found some shade no matter what. <laughs> this got to be a flathead off that rock ledge. We can only hope. <laughs> Welcome to Jad Dad Jokes 101. <laughs> I know I'm the biggest dork on the planet. Well, you're in the right you're in the right chat for that. <laughs> See. I'm winning the tackle bag that I won. Love that thing. Never got the sweet. Oh, uh, Fishing and Fre Freedom, he has shipped that now. He sent me the the tracking number and everything, so it is on its way. Yeah, and those little tackle bags, they're, they're, they're pretty awesome. They're very handy. Next up, we have uh, your boy Troy sticker somewhere. Yep, here we go. 
Enter hashtag Troy to win one of these awesome Ya Boy Troy catfishing stickers. He was kind enough to send me a few of those. I got one on my boat. Now I got one to give away. We got 170 people watching. Make sure y'all enter hashtag Troy to win one of these awesome stickers. I like how on that um that logo that his body makes up the Y. Yeah. <laughs> you know, that's pretty I, I like that. Putting the, the stickers that people are winning in my trusty little bag here. Let's see. Fishing around Chicago Bill says, What do you call a catfish with a bow tie? Now I I it might be the same answer, but I always say, What do you call a catfish that's wearing a tuxedo? And the answer is very sophisticated. <laughs> So I'm not sure if that's where he's going with that one. Um, check out your resolution settings. So if you're um, if you're watching on a phone, tap on the tap on the screen in the top right hand corner. There's three dots. Make sure you're watching in 1080 um, or 720, depending on your device. And if you're on a computer, there's a little there's a little gear down there you can click on and change the resolution that's usually what it is now alicia's screen is has been blurry i think she's trying to keep her phone cool so that if you're talking about that then that's that's what that's about oh, oh. listen isn't that amazing look at those birds man that takes me up in arkansas already my birds in the background, <laughs> in the background i think, I think. Ooh, I'm yeah, I figured they were up there with you. Hmm. Let me check it out on YouTube. But hopefully, we're not all blurry. No, I, well, I it don't look blurry to me. Uh, not really. Mm -mm. No, I'm if, I do, on... if I do this, yeah, you're kind of blurry. <laughs> hey Kevin, do you have time to play an intro? Yeah, y'all want me to pray, play it? Good idea. Play it and play all it. Right, I need we... all the help I can get. <laughs> all right, here we go. That's good. You're really, you, you know, you're actually really good at making those things. I wish I was that good. Ah, thanks. Appreciate it. I always start with the music. Uh, Buck said that he left and came back in and it fixed it. Mm -hmm. Yeah, sometimes it's sometimes it's resolution and or sometimes it's just poor connection. All right, we're giving away your boy Troy sticker. <laughs> Thanks, Jesse. Appreciate it. Very cool quality. Appreciate it. Y'all enter hashtag Troy. You're going to want this sticker. It's a high quality sticker. You're going to want it. And it seems like the trend is now to collect everybody's stickers and stick them on your tackle boxes. I stick them on the inside of my panel of my boat. And it looks like a like a tchotchkes or a, or a mellow mushroom or whatever kind of trendy restaurants you got. Pretty cool, pretty cool. You know, right, I can't gonna... tell you last time I was at an actual restaurant. Yeah, it's been that while. We started going yeah. here a little while ago. Kind of like the last movie I watched, you know, was Jaws. <laughs> like in the theater was Jaws? 
Yeah, pretty much. Wow. Now that is a long time. Is Jody? Oh, I thought Jody might have had a fish. We're in a fish lull right now. What um? What is the? Let's update people who are just coming in with the fish count. And while you're doing that, I'm gonna uh, use the restroom. I'll be right back. All righty. We got no real loss with 18, and she also has the largest of the day so far at 56 pounds. I mean, I can't even remember last time I weighed 56 pounds. But uh, anyway, so she's got 18 largest 56 pounds. Uh, Miss Missy has one on the board. Miss Chrissy has one on the board. And Miss Jody's got four on the board. And she also caught a 29 pounder earlier. That makes a total of 24 catfish. I mean, they're all doing an amazing job. There's ones that um, they're not on the board yet, but they're going to do it. I got faith in them all. You know, they're, they're all really great anglers out there. It looks like Miss Amy, uh, it looks like they got moved to a different spot now. Miss Chrissy's still trying to come in. Um, Miss Alicia, how are you doing out there? I don't know if she can hear me because she's muted. Miss Lorian, do you still see those cotton mouths out there? Uh, no, I that one that went by. Um, I was trying to see where it went, but no. And is this is this a brand new spot for you, or have you fished it before? No, yeah, this is a new spot for me. Um, Mike Costello has been down here, and I think this is this might be where he had that shot fired. Um, but I'm not a hundred percent certain on that. Well, it's a beautiful spot. Mm -hmm. it of course, is. I don't know. Um, the fish are amazing. I mean, they're huge jumping out of the water. I mean, not as huge as what Bex just got, but they're jumping all over the place. They're yeah, just not biting me. Hmm. Yeah, and you've got all kinds of all kinds of bait too. But it's hard, you know, when you it, it's hard when you go, you know, when you're at a new spot, you know, that you're not used to and stuff like that. So big kudos to going out to a brand new spot, you know, during a tournament. For real. So, mm -hmm. Well, thank you. But I, I mean, even this, my usual spot isn't much different. So. <laughs> hey, you catch some awesome fish. So um, you, I just, you. I just, I just respect you. Cause you're, you know, you're in it for, it's not so much the glory as it is. You want to, you know, you want to, I mean, the glory would be nice, but uh, <laughs> yeah, <laughs> but uh but you're there to, you know, just to, she does it because she loves it, you know? Yeah, I really just wanted to, you know, today I knew I didn't have a chance, you know, but it was just to be a part of this is great. It's absolutely great. So I, I'm thrilled to death to, to be here and uh, supporting all the women anglers. And uh, I'm sorry if I sound funny. I've actually been sick for a week and I can't hear out of one of my ears. Huh? Mm -hmm. Yeah, huh? huh? It's weird when you can't hear yourself. <laughs> I'm sorry, I couldn't resist that one. <laughs> it looks like Miss Bex has got a fish on, but before we go over there, I'm gonna give away this sticker real quick. And that's something we all need to remember. You know, Lori is reminding us that, you know, while it is awesome to catch the biggest and the most fish, just being out there fishing is a real blessing. Buck Williams, congratulations, Buck. You won a your boy Troy sticker. Make sure you send me an email at palmettocats at gmail.com with what you've won and your address, and I'll be sure to get that out next week. Congratulations. Let's go over here to Miss Bex and watch her reel in this fish. Is it well, another fish or something? I still have I an hour over here, so don't count me out. <laughs> oh, never. Nobody, nobody's counting you out. Um, while Nobody she's reeling that in, I'll be right back. <laughs> okay. This is another nice fish, though. Not a 56, but it's a nice one.
<laughs> Stefan said he's so jealous right now. <laughs> hey! Bonnie's shirt is slimed. Both of them are wet. That's how you know they've been slaying the fish. That'll make fish number 19 for Bex and Vonnie. Telly said, good luck, ladies at work listening. Well, thank you for listening. All right, guys. <laughs> That's a nice dark one right there. Yeah, there you go. We're in the shade now. My phone Good was fish. overheating. All right, we'll get this guy back in. Does it feel like you've been lifting weights all day? <laughs> yeah. <laughs> yeah. Sure. Awesome. Awesome sauce. Hey, the best thing about Amy being out here is I get to eat the snacks. That shouldn't be the best thing. You might want to rephrase that. Well, I'm talking about <laughs> I'm not having the fish, so she's doing the fish and I get to eat snacks. He meant the best thing about being out there with Amy is he gets to spend time with his lovely wife. Thank you, Kevin. That's what he meant to that's what he meant to say, Amy. Well, that and her her fabulous caramel popcorn. Well, what he meant what he meant was he didn't have to say that because that's that's a no, and that's a given. <laughs> she don't know it by now. Probably like fifteen. Yeah, but it don't matter. It don't matter if she already knows it. You got to say it over and over. <laughs> You've been married long enough to know that. Oh yeah. You're right. <laughs> I'm just right. picking with you. Oh, no, I like to cheer Bex and Bonnie over there and bring them food. There you go. I think Bonnie already ordered two hundred dollars in pizza though. <laughs> We've also been married long enough. She knows I stick my foot in my mouth a lot. <laughs> <laughs> That's right. One more hour to go. One more hour to go. Right now, uh, Bex is in the lead with most fish, with 19 fish, uh, and the biggest fish at 56 pounds, setting a new personal best record for her. And uh, she couldn't have done it without Vonnie down there swimming and wrangling that fish, jumping on top of it and uh, throwing it in the net. And, <laughs> and then... Uh, uh jody pontoon jody is moving on to the second round she's got four fish she's also got a nice fish a 29 pound flathead which was an awesome fight uh missy who is uh taking a break she has a flathead and is moving on to the next round and then christy brown who's having uh she's right there look she said her phone's been overheating but we see her down there at the bottom. Um, she's got a channel cat. So we have three different species represented. Uh, we're the iron cat record. Uh, that is the iron cat record. You are absolutely right, Dan. Before it was Brian B. I think he had a 45 pound blue. So uh, that's right. Bex has the new iron cat record for biggest fish total. So that's another good uh, little, uh, note there thanks dan for pointing that out yep it is dobson it's it's well actually so we have two iron cat records we have uh pontoon jody with the biggest flathead and and then uh bex with the biggest fish overall hey sharina we we see you you're still lagging a little bit but we can at least see you kevin kevin Yep. I didn't know I was muted, but I need to step out for a minute. You need a what? I just need to go. Um... Okay. I'll Here be back. I'm gone. <laughs> do what you need to do. My 
All right. So Alicia's stepping out. I couldn't really understand. I, it sounded like she said she needed to step out permanently. Um, I hope everything's okay. But maybe she, maybe that's not what she said. Maybe she'll be back. But Shireen is back on the, on the screen now. Um, she is lagging a good bit, but we can see her, and that's the most important part. So, yeah, we have a couple of new records. Uh, and we still – I don't know for how long, though. That's okay. Just try your best, and uh, you're up on screen represented, so that's the important thing. Uh, let's see. We're still wait. Amy's got two turtles, <laughs> but no catfish yet. Um, and then Lori Ann is still waiting on her first fish. Uh, what's everyone fishing with? Straight malicious. We have uh, a whole bunch of baits. We have chicken baits to fresh skipjack. Um, Missy was fishing with a goldfish earlier. Uh, we have earthworms. Alicia just lost a rod. Oh, no. That's not good. That's why she sounded upset. Yeah. Hopefully she'll be okay. Uh, it happens to the best of us. <laughs> I've lost. I've lost two myself. It's never fun. Never fun to lose a rod. They are too expensive to be losing. All right, y'all. Uh, we're going to do this hand counter next as a giveaway. I always love these hand counters. Uh, let's see. I'll get the StreamYard giveaway ready to go. We'll do hashtag counter. So this is what we're winning before I put it up. It's a little silver fish counter. And you click the button and it counts your fish. And it's got a little reset over here so you can reset it. So for those of you who catch a bunch, uh, that's definitely, definitely, or even if you don't catch a bunch, if you're catching some and then, um, you know, you just lose count, it's nice to have something there to refer to. So here's the, boom, hashtag counter. There you go. I need a counter. I never remember how many I caught. Chunky's trying to win one. I sent Chunky one a long time ago. He must have lost. I think he did say he lost it. I never need to count that high. <laughs> yeah, you can count 9,999 fish. But you can also use it for different things. That's awesome. Let's see. There's Sharina coming back in. Awesome. So, yeah, uh, let's see. Remember that um, if you win a prize, you need to email me at palmeticaz at gmail.com with your name, what you've won, and your mailing address. While we have a little lull in the action here, I want to thank Catfish Conference. This is the official uh, Iron Cat Ladies Tournament sponsor because the winner – uh, of the uh, both days put together, the grand champion will win a free hotel night stay and two tickets to the Catfish Conference in Kansas City, Missouri in two months. It's coming up quick, y'all. That's in November, November 19th and 20th in Kansas City, Missouri. So that's an awesome prize. We thank Hervé and Steve over at the Catfish Conference for throwing that up there. My phone is buzzing. Okay. I want to thank all our prize sponsors, Muddy River Catfishing, PC Fun, Tidal Weight Sinkers, Santee Drifters, Catfish Clothing, and Catfish and Crappy, who all donated awesome prizes to give away in chat. Thank you so much for all of those. And then I have a whole bunch of other sticker prizes that I couldn't possibly fit into the little scrolling marquees at the bottom of the screen. So thank you for all of you who sent me stickers. Uh, remember, when you enter in a hashtag, you have to enter it in exactly as it appears on the screen with no spaces. Hashtag counter, um, or else the the giveaway tool will not register your entry. So make sure you do that correctly. We wouldn't want you to think you're entered for something and then not be entered. This is day one of the tournament. Day two starts tomorrow 
at 12 p.m. Eastern time. We have four more ladies that we couldn't fit into the challenge today because we can only fit uh, nine people up on screening uh, plus myself, so 10 people total. And so we have four awesome anglers coming up tomorrow. That's Catfishing Katie Collins. We have Rebecca from uh, Carolina Real Screamers. We have Lizabella Kirkpatrick from Angler Holics Fishing and Outdoor Adventures. And we have Lisa, the fishing chick from Arizona. So those will all be up there. And all the all the links to the description to the competitors' channels, if they have one, are in the description. Also, links to all of our giveaway sponsors um, to the to their websites or their channels. And uh, obviously a link to the Catfish Conference website. Go check it out for your tickets and more information to about the Catfish Conference. And we are ready. Miss Becca is back with us. We're going to give away this. Uh... Oh, yeah, you were doing the hashtag catfish. Yep. <laughs> yep, you got to enter it exactly. Here we go. We're going to give away this fish counter. Good luck, everybody. 74 entries. Boom, Tiger Muskie with the $2 super chat. He said, good luck, ladies. Thank you, Mr. Wayne. Painting services by know. Steve. Congratulations, Steve. Uh, let me see here. Steve. Awesome, awesome. I have your I have your uh, address, paint service by Steve, so I'll send that out to you next week. I like how Michael Morello uh, entered that. It was Counta. 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 <laughs> <laughs> yes, yes, yes. All right, awesome. Congrats, Steve. Yes, yes, yes. Nebraska Wildcats, what's up? Kara Ellen Ellen found my answer on shots fired down here. <laughs> oh, you found a bullet. Or is that shell. a shell casing? A shell casing, nine mil. No, that's not good. That does not make me feel any better when you're out there by yourself. <laughs> At least it looks old enough to have been there for a while. <laughs> uh, it's not actually that. It's still pretty no? uh, coppery. Oh man. Uh. Which is one of the reasons we decided to go this tournament in the daytime. <laughs> Not that people don't shoot people in the daytime, but. <laughs> yeah, right. But let's keep thinking that way. That's right. Boom. Catfish and dreams with a $5. Ladies day. Oh, what a day. Thank you, Mr. Brandon. <laughs> Adva so is here and says, go back. Oh, she's been going all right. Bex has got her new PB and the tournament big fish and the, the Iron Cat series big fish all in one fish. Isn't that awesome? 56 pound blue cat. And I think we're still at um, 19 for no real loss, right? So it's any more than 19 okay. fish. All right. Well, the giveaways aren't stopping here. We got too much to do. Sharina's back, so we're going to give away one of her stickers. I love that view that uh, Miss Amy's got over there. Isn't that mm -hmm. gorgeous on the side? All right. Uh, let me show the sticker first. There's a Sharina's Keeping It Real sticker. Right there. Pretty cool sticker. and Interesting design. So we're giving away one of those. Oh, Pay Services by Steve said, send the counter to Bex. All right, I'll do that. Miss Bex is wondering. I think she's wondering what she just got. <laughs> you got she a fish that, counter. <laughs> yeah, she just had that look like, wait a minute, what? Something else people are sending to me? She definitely could use it for sure. Yeah, fish counter. Here, I'll show you what it looks like. What, for real? Yep. What? Thank you. <laughs> Painting Thank services you. by Steve. Well, yeah, there you go. I don't know if you saw that. Yeah, we're. I'm following on 
I have two phones because my phones are never reliable. <laughs> <laughs> All right. To win a Sharina sticker, we're going to put hashtag keep it real. Thank you to Sharina for uh, donating some stickers to give away. She's been in and out. Poor girl's had so much problems with the internet around there. Bex is getting it done, Eric. Welcome, Mr. Greenwell, Mike. And then Mike's fishing home. What is it? We've got a... Uh, 184 wonderful people in here. Isn't that crazy? Oh, 185. Somebody wanted to up yep. it one. Yep. <laughs> so this is for a Sharina's Keeping It Real sticker. Put hashtag keep it real. Let's see. Um, uh, Michael Marillo, uh, Bex and Vonnie, they have 19... Total fish right now, and with the biggest one so far, uh, 56 pounds. It was amazing. If y'all want to go back and see that, she fought it for at least five to eight minutes. She fought and that then, sucker for like five to ten days. And you know it was <laughs> on a chunky rod, so you know it was it had no backbone to it at all. So that fish was doing what it wanted. <laughs> I mean, no, don't get me wrong. Those ugly stick rods are awesome. The world record was caught on an ugly stick, but it was definitely easier with some backbone. <laughs> but that, I definitely, she will remember that fight for the rest of her life for real. And then uh, Vonnie was in the water swimming with the fish, trying to get it in the net. <laughs> Go ahead, Miss Beck. Well, no, I, somebody, uh, Catfish and Dreams, asked how far back that was. And I was just going back to kind of look, and I think it is, I think it's it's like 59 minutes, so it's about an hour, about an hour back. Greenwell Fishing said, can you tell Amy and Larry 3 plus 1, I said, hey, and I'm pulling for her. There you go. She heard me. Hey. How you doing? Chunky's going to get me? No, he knows. That's why he buys those rods. He buys those rods specifically because they're whippy. That, that wasn't no shot fired. He knows that. Them rods just don't have any, they don't have any backbone at all. Shoot, even he's talking about he needs to get his room. blue cat rods back from Haz because he's been slaying the big ones in the boat. <laughs> Yeah, it's keeping it real. R E E L, just like in Sharina's title. Sharina's keeping it real. And just a reminder to everybody: the hashtag must be exactly like you see it on the screen. There's Mr. Kelly Bullock. Uh, ask Amy who picked the spots today. So really, the weather and the cell phone were set to pick the spots today. So uh, earlier in the week, we were fighting um, um, thermocline, and uh, and we got a bunch of rain, and it's kind of it's kind of turned over. But yeah, circumstances picked our spot today. Mm -hmm. And if everybody in the chat don't know it, Miss Amy is an amazing baker. Oh, well, thank you. That's my side mm. hustle. Thank you very much. Yep, she is. I mean, <laughs> I know because I've tasted it. So <laughs> she said, Thank you. That's my side hustle. Thank you. Thank you very much. We love this, Amy. Sound like Paula Dean over there. Well, thank you, darling. Country is cornbread. <laughs> Just put some butter in it. Butter bacon makes everything better. <laughs> Don't you know that, right? <laughs> All right, here we go. We're giving away a Sharina sticker. Good luck, everybody. Mm -hmm. 
Bo oh, again. Williams, again. What did he win earlier? I believe he won an, uh, was another sticker, I think. If he won something, I didn't write it down. <laughs> yeah, he did. He won, he oh, yeah. won oh, something. He won a, your boy, Troy. Yeah, the sticker. So now he's got two stickers. You know, and it's amazing to come up on that tool twice, too, because there's so many people, you know, so truly lucky people. Absolutely. Bank to the table with a four ninety nine boom, 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 as Bex oh, would hi say. There. <laughs> I haven't seen you in a little while back at the table. Thank you so much for coming in. Yep. I appreciate everybody who shared it out. Appreciate everyone uh, who's uh so I'd say it's going pretty good. <laughs> and you know what? Just a little hint. Um my surprise prize, you know, um he kind of just walked in the chat. <laughs> If you uh -oh. got to know what I mean. <laughs> oh, oh. Just a little hint. Little tiny hint there. That's my lucky charm. Yeah, because when he comes in, she always gets, hey, that's right. So where's this fish? Hey, it's coming. It's sniffing the bait right now. <laughs> it's sniffing the bait. <laughs> <laughs> uh, we're going to move on to another sticker giveaway, Fins and Fines. He also has a tournament coming up. I'll talk about that in a second. There's a sticker. Awesome sticker. Um, Where do you want to go? Mr. Bob from Fit. Man, Bob's got a new boat, too. He's got an He's Angler got Quest angler. pontoon. That is like my dream boat. I think it's awesome. But Bob will be having a, uh, a tournament called Fisher Wish, and that's coming up on September 18th. And uh, he's invited me to fish it along with a bunch of other people. And uh, all the proceeds for that tournament go to the Make-A-Wish Foundation. So him and some other people have coordinated that. And I'm looking forward to fishing in it. And that's not this weekend coming up, but next weekend. So I better start finding some fish if I want to be able to compete. <laughs> and I will tell y'all, the Make-A-Wish Foundation, it is an amazing organization. And uh, one of my twin little nieces... Uh, that was born with only one ventricle in her heart. They um, they granted her wish, and so and I'm gonna cry. So I better stop. Yep. So, uh, anyway, they're an amazing organization. Cut that out. Cut that out. Cut yeah. that out. <laughs> Very well worth it. Yep, that's awesome. And I'm looking forward to fishing it. And Bob's just a, a nice guy all the way around. And so, you know, I'm happy to be able to help him out. He even got old Kayak Catfish to shout out his tournament for him. How about that? Yep, he did. Knoxville Vinyl. That's a new name for me. Welcome, welcome. Yeah, that's, I was trying to click on it earlier, but the hashtags were going so fast. That's the right. Two stands. Uh, Bob is almost to 1,000 uh, subscribers. So if you haven't checked him out, I'm okay with somebody putting his link in the chat if y'all want to do that. Bob is a nice guy. He donated stickers for me to give away, and he's having an awesome tournament to benefit others. All right, we're doing a Fins and Finds uh, giveaway. We have about one more minute to enter in hashtag Fins and Finds exactly as it appears on the screen. Shade Tree Fishing's in the house. Welcome. Brandon Outdoors. And there's one of my favorite names right there, Chicken Gravy. <laughs> <laughs> I mean, who doesn't love chicken gravy, okay? I mean, seriously. <laughs> I mean, really, talking about Paula Dean, you know, I got him a gravy. <laughs> Y'all, and if you haven't, um, you know, make sure that if you're not subscribed to this channel, I would appreciate your subscription as well. Uh, been trying to grow the channel, and it's going well, so you would be another addition to the family, and I would appreciate it. If you haven't already, hit the thumbs up for this stream. If you have social media or you have a thousand subscribers, um, either one, please share it out to social media or to YouTube and get more people in here to support these ladies. Also, all the links to, to uh, channels that are in the tournament, if they have uh, a channel, is in the description. So you can go check those out. And if you like what you see, consider subscribing to them as well. 
And then all of our uh, tournament uh, prize giveaway sponsors are in the description as well. So don't forget about the people that support us because without them, we wouldn't be able to do all these prizes, y'all. And Mr. Ernie said, Chrissy's moving in case you missed it. Okay, cool. Looks like Alicia's getting cranked back up here. I got my rod back. Yes! Way to go! <laughs> yeah. So I had an umbrella covering my phone, two of them actually, and a bunch of wind came through and it spun the umbrellas around and made it like an above water drift sock for me. Oh, Lord. And so I went to the back of the boat to get that taken care of. And that's when the rod went over the front of the boat. And, um, I tried to snatch it up with like, I had another rod right there that had a big hook on it. So I tried to do that and that didn't work and it was just gone. And, um, it was in the troll motor. <laughs> yeah. The one time where it's okay for your line to get tangled up in the trolling motor. <laughs> yeah, exactly. Yep. And you know what? And you know, I gotta say that I could hear her passion when she, you know, when that rod went in or whatever, because we didn't know what was going on at the time. Right. You know? Yeah. But I knew it was something and, and yeah, that's that's a hard thing to see one of your babies go under the water. <laughs> Yeah, well, I mean, if you've ever seen me on panel, you'll know that I talk about this all the time, but it was, y'all are going to, like, laugh at me, but it was the Zebco 33, but it was, like, a vintage one with the cork handle, and, like, it's a really good, nice one, and, like, it just killed me, but I have it again, so. <laughs> hey, I have high respect for Zebco 33s, and that yeah. almost made me have passion right there. <laughs> <laughs> Awesome. Well, it looks like Bex is reeling in yet, or just netted another one. Pete's we Whiskers Pete. is in the house. Yeah. Um, yeah, from South Africa. Good to see you, buddy. We hope all's going well over there. There you go. There's number 20. There you go. Numero 20 for the Woo! machine. That is no real loss. That makes a total of 26 for the day. Awesome. Awesome sauce. You know, I wonder what that really tastes like. Awesome sauce? Uh-huh. I wonder what's now in you it. Could, you could probably ask Bex and she could tell you because she's been eating it. <laughs> uh, is Alicia in the SS Delta Burke? <laughs> yeah, it was like Chris. <laughs> I told him I was naming that my boat that. Bonnie McClary said, You go, girls. Pete said, All is well. Our season just began the 26. Fish wow. That's why she needs the clicker counter. Yeah, she does. But well, she's going to get one. Catfish Weekly said, "Awesome sauce tastes like crappy." Or he thought he said crappy. <laughs> yeah, I was like, I'll always correct that. All right, here we go. We got fifty-nine people entered in to win a sticker. Boom! Here we go. Um. Miss Catfishing. That's appropriate. <laughs> <Yeah>. <laughs> <laughs> Miss Catfishing won a Pins and Finds sticker. Make sure you send me an email, and I'm going to put that on the bottom, scrolling across the bottom, palmettacats at gmail.com. Send me your name, what you won. My dog is alerting me. Probably an Amazon delivery or something. And... Uh, Send me your email with your name, what you won, and your address, and I'll get that out to you. Miss Lizabella's in the house. Lizabella will be up here tomorrow. Awesome. And I didn't right, even well. say, I talked about him, but I didn't say hi there, Mr. Chris. <laughs> All right, our next giveaway will be another sticker, and it's going to be a Brian B. Catfishing sticker. I always do that. I put it up before I show what it is. Come on, focus. Brian B. Catfishing. He is an iron cat 
challenge champion as well. He won the boat challenge. So if you'd like to win that sticker, put hashtag Brian B up on the screen. Or up in the chat, not on the screen. Uh, Miss Lorianne is at the top in the middle of the screen. I mean, she's not. Mm -hmm. Yeah, there she is right there popping it back in. Yeah, we have some that have been popping in and out all day. Um, so, we're, you know, that's that's one of the challenges of these online tournaments. You know, catching fish is hard enough, but then trying to maintain – a good signal is really the, the real challenge. And then once you get the signal, especially in these hotter temperatures, you have to keep your phone from overheating. <laughs> so it's a, it's a multi challenge tournament, um, which in some respects, I guess could be harder than going to an actual live tournament. Um, maybe not harder, but more frustrating. How about that? <laughs> I'm trying to right, so we have 30 minutes, 28 minutes left. And right now we have four contestants moving on to the next round. And that's Bex from No Real Loss, Jody, Pontoon Jody, uh, Missy Kennedy, and Chrissy Brown. And I don't, Missy Kennedy, and uh, I think she was overheated and she had to take a break. And then Chrissy Brown's phone overheated. Um, so we'll we'll hope that they can pop in for round two. Miss Sharina is trying so hard to pop in and out. I got her up on screen now. She's working hard, y'all. Y'all root on Miss Sharina. Let's go, Sharina. You can do it. Let's go, Lori, Amy, Alicia. We need a fish, y'all. That's also part of why I chose this spot. Is I mean, I'm in the shade. Uh, usually, I'm out there baking in the sun. You know, I've gotten a. Uh, um, heat rash and everything out there and so I thought, oh this is nice <laughs> that's all so good though so good. this is non-negotiable you need to catch fish <laughs> <laughs> but they're all working hard everybody's doing what they can i keep wondering uh, miss amy is that a is that a flag that's hanging there is there something on it or is that just like a or is it, what's on there? It's just a hand towel. Oh, okay. I kept wondering if it was like a flag that was waving. Well, you're catfishing. Uh, give it to me at Catapalooza. Oh, wow. Okay. Yeah. I've seen, some, yeah. I've seen something on it, but I've just, I can't, I couldn't like, you know, see it well enough. Yeah, actually, this very first ride, the white one, the Patriot ride, um, I won it in a raffle, and they give me that towel to go with it. Oh, that's pretty sweet. Yeah, it, the raffle was to raise money for uh, So, it was pretty awesome. Now, that makes it even better. Right? I got a screenshot that I'm going to show everybody as soon as I get it down. Thank you, Wayne Huska, again for another super sticker, $2. And I really appreciate you. Yes, boom. Thank you, everybody. All right, I'm going to add this picture here. Now, I just downloaded. Oh, there it is. All right, so y'all want to see the biggest fish ever caught in an iron cat tournament of course, of course we do. do that's a silly question <laughs> there it is boom <laughs> oh, look, awesome. at that. <laughs> wow. look at those chavez. smiles mike chavez sent that to me and i appreciate you mike he took a screenshot and i'm sure he sent awesome. it to bex and them too what an awesome fish I mean, they didn't look happy at all. <laughs> Somebody asked if Alicia was paddling. She's muted. Hang on. Oh, she's running the motor. 
<laughs> There's Mike Chavez. He gave the thumbs up. Let's play a game. Let's play a game. How many times can Serena go in and out in 20 minutes? Let's go. <laughs> I still hear well, it seems pretty good right now. <laughs> just make sure you're up when you catch that fish in just a second. All right, here we go. We'll give away the Brian B. sticker, and boom, here we go. Round and round it goes. Where it stops, nobody knows. Got a lot of names in there I've never seen before. Fishing around Chicago. Congratulations. Um, where's that on my list here? There it is. Fishing. I like the whistle, by the way. <laughs> Thank you. I like the whistle better than the motoring. <laughs> Was that a hint? Don't ever do I, I, that again. I, I, that used to be one of my favorite songs. Not so much no more. <laughs> Man, the trash talk is coming out. And Can you I see the bird? Can you see the bird out here? Um, let me put you on big screen. Hang on. And you know I'm kidding. No, I know. No, I don't see him. Yeah, I do. I see him flying now. I'm trying to still find them. I think I need to clean my screen. The little white <laughs> white specks. Jeremy's tournament cat said, "Keep it motor red." <laughs> <laughs> you just had to go there, Jeremy. <laughs> now everybody's saying motor, and you done started something now. <laughs> oh, y'all are priceless. Oh man, that's funny. <clears throat> so hey, we do I have got, some uh I got one. Look, look, shade tree. Please no motoring. <laughs> <laughs> well, we can just time shade tree out. That's okay. <laughs> just kidding. Just kidding. <laughs> oh. All right. So we have another sticker giveaway. This is a muddy river catfishing sticker. Uh, you get you get one of these with everything you purchase from Muddy River Catfishing. You can check out the link to his website in the description. And if you want to purchase a guide trip with him on Elephant Butte in um, New Mexico, you can also check that out on his website. But we're going to give away this sticker right now. And all you have to do is enter hashtag MRC. That's all you got to do. Let's see. Becca, uh, I think you're kind of, but you're not. <laughs> Let's see. Uh, a compliment uh, immediately <laughs> followed with the put down. <laughs> I saw that. <laughs> uh, Becca, I agree. No motoring. Oh, <laughs> Avid. Come on, Avid. <laughs> uh, that's funny. Just for that, I'm going to go live tonight from the water, and I'm going to sing it all night. <laughs> that is like, that's fine. I just won't watch. <laughs> I actually thought about going fishing tonight, but I don't know. These tournaments kind of wear you out, even hosting them. Yeah, somebody earlier, I don't remember who it was, somebody earlier, but hello there, Mr. Roger Muskrat. Um, but somebody had put in there that they were going to go fishing, I think, tonight because they're going to be right here tomorrow. Mm. Awesome. I appreciate that. I know I'm going fishing on Monday. I probably won't go fishing tonight because I went yesterday, and then I'm going to get to go fishing on Monday morning too because it's Labor Day. Everybody and their brother will be out there, but that's all right. Boom. Motor <laughs> Thank you, Lucas, for that opportunity to sing it again. And thank you for the $2 super chat. <laughs> Y'all are so funny. Benefit tournaments tonight here. 
Is Chad having his tournament today? Uh, um, oh, Mr. Chad, I think, took uh, Miss D out for her birthday. Mm hmm. Time to mute, Kevin. <laughs> Probably is going to catch a 55 on Monday. Yeah, man, listen, Jeremy's tournament cats. He, he went live. He went live Thursday and Friday night. Thursday night he caught a few, uh, but then Friday him and his buddy went out on Lake Moultrie and anchored up in a spot. And um, man, they tore up the fish. They caught a couple forties, uh, and then a like he said a fifty pound flathead. So they were tearing them up. Uh, Missy Miss said, Mill yeah, there you going go. up and getting sick. Heads busting. All right, Missy. Well, listen, Missy. You did what you set out to do. You come out and caught a fish for your daddy, and you don't you don't worry about coming back in the stream. I want you to make sure you're healthy. So, uh, Missy, just for those of you who are watching, Missy did qualify to move on to the next round, but it sounds like she won't be moving on to the next round by her choice. Um, so we definitely understand that. Health is number one. You can't do anybody any good if you're not healthy. I heard you sing that first live feed I seen yours scared me. <laughs> I created a monster. <laughs> Prayers for Missy. Yeah, y'all say a prayer for Missy. Uh, Muskrat wants an update. That's Becca's division. She's going to run through that right now. Uh, no real loss. They've got 20 fish right now. They've also got the big one. They've also got the big one of the day at 56 pounds. Miss Missy's got one on the board. Miss Chrissy has one on the board. And Miss Jody's got four on the board. And she caught a 29 pounder as one of those. Flathead, 29 pound flathead. That makes 26 total fish today so far. That's awesome. <laughs> yes, ma'am. I hear you, Jody. Go ahead. I'm gonna move spots because boat traffic. No problem. Pick up. Go right ahead. Oh, All right. I, I, I got to be right back. One of the cows just knocked uh, the cattle panel over. I'll be back. Uh oh, yeah, go take care of it. <laughs> Might as well pick All right, y'all. We have, let's see, 40, 77 entries for the Muddy River Catfishing uh, Tournament. Or tournament. <laughs> the sticker. So make sure that if you want to win that sticker, you enter in real quick. Hashtag MRC. We're going to give away that tournament. Ladies putting it on the men tournament. Ladies putting it on the men tournament. Missy is awesome. Yeah, she's she's fantastic. I'm glad she got to come out and at least catch a fish live. That's awesome. Back and forward. Oh, you're all, you're fine, Frogster. Go, oh, Sharina. Who's in her hand? She got a fish? Well, she had a good bite. Okay. Chris is trying to win his own sticker. <laughs> Uh, Missy said she, her blood pressure is going up. She doesn't feel well. So she's going to withdraw from the tournament. Leave it to the farm animals to cause a problem. <laughs> All right, here we go. We're going to give away this MRC sticker. And boom. Good luck, everybody. Tomorrow, if you come in the tournament, we'll be giving away a Muddy River Catfish and Hoodie. Big Slim 91. Congratulations. Make sure you send me an email, Big Slim, with your address and what you won, and I will get that out to you. Congratulations. Like I said, tomorrow we will be uh, 
will be oh, giving away some more prizes. Missy just sent me a photo of her uh, a big flathead. Awesome. All right. All right. All right. <laughs> All right, thanks, Avin. All right, we're moving on with the giveaways. Let's see. All right, y'all, I got a bunch of stickers in the mail. Uh, it's been a week or so ago now. I can't really remember. Let me find it over here. But he sent me a bunch of them to give away. And that's a channel called Mike Costello Outdoors. He's from the great state of South Carolina. He fished with, uh, fished with Lori a few times. And uh, he gave me a bunch of stickers to give away. So we'll be giving that sticker away. All you have to do is enter in the chat hashtag Mike C. Mike C. All right, Lori, how's it going? What we got, 15 minutes? Pretty much, a little less. Yeah. You going to jump in the water and grab one? Absolutely not. <laughs> not after seeing these cotton mouths swim by, I can tell you that. <laughs> I'm getting a lot of bites, but... No hookup, Sharina? I can't hear. <laughs> but I can't hear. No, it's but like I might next. move up back to my usual spot after this. <laughs> <laughs> Looks like Bex is reeling something in. Might be some driftwood. Twelve minutes. Twelve minutes and everything's going. Yeah. And you can't. Can't keep. All right. Well, I'm not sure if Bex has got one or not. She's definitely down there fighting something. And these ladies are fighting it out to the end here. <laughs> turtle, turtle, Amy. <laughs> Our other phone overheated, so might as well have right. some fun with it, right? Might as well. Might as well. <laughs> Turtle, turtle. So we're entering in hashtag Mike C to enter to win a Mike Costello outdoor sticker. Got 195 people watching. Looks like Bex has hooked a kayaker. Oops. Bex, kayakers don't count. <laughs> she can't hear me. <laughs> There's the hundred dollars in pizza. <laughs> oh man. Everybody's trying hard, y'all. Y'all make sure you check out all these channels in the description, please. Uh, Mike Turner said Kevin Big Slim wants to give Alicia the MRC sticker. All right, we can do that. So, Alicia, I'll be sending you an uh, MRC sticker, Muddy River Catfishing sticker. I was racking my brain trying to figure that out. <laughs> <laughs> your lucky charm, your lucky I charm. I know, I'm like, who? <laughs> who? Who that? Who that? Who? Oh, there's another fish there. She's trying to hey, hit me. This guy's 19 and a half. All right. In fact, he's got one on. He's telling me to help. That's fish number 21. <laughs> <laughs> Flying fish there. <laughs> Goodness. Muddy River who? <laughs> I 
I'll tell you, there's nothing worse, too, when you're watching all the fish pop water, pop water, pop water. It was exciting this morning. Yeah. Yeah, we have a we have a lot of mullet um, that do that. Do you have the flying mullet like we have down here? Oh, I don't know. These they're pretty big fish. I don't know if they're bass or what's going on out there, but a lot of bass fishermen uh, hmm. come out. So maybe. <laughs> but some of Your them flora. sound like monsters in there. So. Yeah, it could be carp too. Carp like to bust the water. I wondered, yeah. Muddy River Catfish uh, just said, do you get points for... Uh, I don't think so. I think it's, there, it's close, closely related. Yeah, the carp bust. Yeah, the, the mullet, yeah, on the Cooper River. Yeah, they fly in the, through the air. All right, there's fish number 22. Woo, let's go. Wow. <laughs> Good job. Bex and Bex and uh and Vani are feeding their fourth family now. <laughs> yeah, Stan said sucker is different. They kind of look the same, but I said Vani, I said you and Bex are feeding you could have fed your fourth family now by all the fish you've caught. Right? Except for the except for the blunt nose one, we don't want to we don't want to eat that one. No, he was too cute. <laughs> they caught a they caught a blue catfish that looked like a pug, a pug and a catfish uh, mixed. <laughs> All right, here we go, Mike Costello sticker. Here we go, and thank you to Mike Costello. I don't think he's in here, but he sent me a whole pack of stickers to give away on these tournaments. So thank you so much. Lance Makugi Mac Makugi <laughs> Congratulations Lance send me an email with your address and I'll send that out to you All right 11:53 we have 7 minutes left 7 minutes for Amy, Sharina, Alicia and Lorianne to hook up If I catch a fish right now in 7 minutes I'm going to punch it right in the snout <laughs> and Jody's moving spots, so it looks like it'll be. Uh, and I'm not sure what happened to Chrissy. If someone would message Chrissy and see if they're trying to work that out, um, or maybe that's the problem is their phone. Maybe message Ernie because <laughs> moving on to round two so far is Bex, um, Jody, Missy, and Chrissy. Missy has, uh, Bowed out of the tournament. My cool guy. My cool guy. My cool guy. Okay, I got you. Um, so it's Chrissy, Jody, and Bex. Chrissy was moving spots. Okay, cool. So Chrissy and Jody and Bex will battle it out. Unless a fish is caught by Amy, Alicia, and Lori or Sharina right here at the end. Which it could happen. I, it could happen. It could happen. It could that happen. Bad. That would put the twist on okay, it. Dun, ta -da -da. <laughs> the cliffhanger. Here it comes. <laughs> yeah, that's right. All right, here's our next sticker, y'all. Uh, newer channel, Angler Holics Fishing and Outdoor Adventures. Um, Liz Bella and James Kirkpatrick. I've joined our family here in the last couple months, and they're doing a great job. Very entertaining, very friendly people. And they sent me a couple stickers yeah, to give away this there. weekend. So we're going to be doing this giveaway next. So all you have to do to enter I'm is to enter hashtag angler. That's it. That's all you have to do. And it has to be just as it appears on the screen. No spaces, spelled correctly, including the hashtag. Ladies, I just want to tell you all, we have over 190 people watching right now. 194. 
Vex is probably saying boom, 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 boom. And Amy's like, all right, honey, that's awesome. <laughs> Alicia's gonna get a fish at the last minute, said Dan. Did you get your hundred dollars in pizza? <laughs> I'm gonna order pizza tonight. Why not? Oh, pizza, that sounds awesome. It does. Yes, yes girl. Yes. Motoring said our yeah, <laughs> Thank you, Bonnie. Thank you. So I also got Bex a hundred dollars in water. <laughs> hundred dollars in water. Everything back to normal there, Miss Becca. I'll finish fixing it later. Okay. I just got it back up. I got wire everywhere around here, so I just wired it back up and stuff. And I'll I'll go out there and just I'll fix it a little bit later. I mean, do what you need to do. You know, we'll, you know, yeah, stand right. is offered to come up, but all right, cool. Yeah. Got me an Angleholic sticker. Looking good. Yep. We got, uh, Kevin, what's the score? Well, I'll update you this time because Miss Beck had to step away. Let's see. We have Bex with, from No Real Loss, uh, with 22 fish. 22 fish. The biggest being 56 pounds, 56 pound blue cat, which is her record. Um, the tournament big fish and the iron cat series, big fish. Uh, Miss Jody has four fish. The biggest being a 29 pound flathead, the biggest flathead caught in the tournament and in any iron cat tournament. Miss uh, Misty Kennedy caught one flathead, but she has since um, bowed out of the tournament for health reasons. She said she's not feeling well, and we definitely want her to uh, feel better. And then last but not least is Miss Chrissy Brown has one channel cat, and uh, I think she's moving spots. So as soon as she gets some signal... Uh, and gets back in, she will be up. Look at that. Miss Alicia got her a panfish. Oh, look. It's a really little cutie pie. Look at that little thing. <laughs> I'm trying to uh, unmute her. I think you so have to unmute sweet. yourself. Uh, Plus it's I'm, a little I'm not sure how it keeps muting. But, um, yeah, yeah that's my favorite bait. I was doing it. I hope that Alicia enters Chad's panfish tournament in November. I definitely can catch panfish, but I can catch catfish too, but I, I haven't seen anybody else in a boat out here catching any today either. So it's not just me. Yeah. Like Amy said, it's been the weather with Kentucky, that rain we had after all that drought, it just messed everything up. Right. Was there One a smallest fish in that? Does Sharina have a fish on here at the last minute? That hey there, Mr. Rondale. Oh, did she say she caught a snake? I don't know. I know. She just went out. Boom! Two stands with the 222. Thank you, Bex, for the 22. You know I love the two. Hey there, Mr. Art, Mr. Roger, Mr. Roger. I hope you're doing. I hope you're still doing okay. I hope. I hope that Sharina can pop back in and we can see what she was catching. I could have swore she said something about a snake. If it's a catfish, she'll move on to round two. If it's sixteen inches, what was it, Sharina? Huge. Hmm. That was she a gar, and it was awesome. Oh, it was a gar. Oh, gar. <laughs> <laughs> well, awesome. Well, that is the end of round one, y'all. That is the end of round one. We're going to let the contestants that did not move on have the screen real quick. We'll start with Sharina. 
Serena, I know you're lagging, but go ahead and say what you need to say. Hopefully it'll come through. Nope. <laughs> <laughs> no. All right. Oh, maybe. How are you guys? Good luck. In yeah, there. she's yeah, lagging pretty bad. Huh? That's okay. Maybe we should have an after show. And guys, fish on, okay? Yes. See you soon. There you go. I heard that. I heard that. Thank you for trying so hard, Serena. You did a good job. Awesome. Thanks for having me, okay? Yep. We'll have a show and we'll talk about everything and uh, we'll definitely get you back up. Awesome. All right. Bye-bye. Hey, yeah. All right. We're going to bring up Miss Amy. What's going on? Hey, I'm sorry I didn't catch anything today, y'all, but I'm not going to give up. We're getting ready to move spots. We're going to keep on fishing. But you did catch something. You caught two hey, giant did. turtles. Turtle, turtle. <laughs> I did. I caught turtles. And you know, that was the most special thing because ain't nobody else caught a turtle. That's right. <laughs> You're right. <laughs> exactly. Well, well, That's right. I caught two for kinds. Well, listen, you still have the link. If you you and Larry end up getting on some fish, please pop back in and show off your fish, even though it, it won't count. We like seeing fish. It, That's right. Count. You are I'm the... On the... I'm on the last minute of the day fishing with my number one guy, so it'll count. It just won't count on the tournament. <laughs> See, he should have been... He should have said something like that earlier. Take notes, Larry. <laughs> just, just like hey, Trendale Kill 91... Trendell said, Thanks you're the Iron the Turtle Champ. That's right. <laughs> hey, thank y'all for uh, having us. Thank you for watching. And uh, hopefully we'll jump back in here later, y'all. Awesome. Much love. God bless y'all. God bless you. All right, y'all. Make sure you check out the links to these awesome channels in the description. Um, 3 plus 1 is in the description as well. Miss Alicia. <sighs> hey, oh, you I got had, fish you on. A, oh, it was you, probably some fish. You um, had some ups and downs the whole day, didn't you? Yeah, today was rough. I never thought in a million years that I would get eliminated in the first round, but it happens, and it was still fun. It was also depressing and sad at times, but it was fun overall, and then I'm really glad I got my rod back because. Like I literally had to get off screen and cry for 30 minutes. <laughs> <laughs> well, listen, I'm happy that you are brave enough to get up here and do this tournament live tournaments. Well, any tournament in general is tough for anyone, no matter, no matter your gender at all, but you know, getting up here and, and battling like you have and sticking with it. I'm, I'm very proud of you and I know everybody else is too. Yeah, it was fun. I hope to do it again so I can redeem myself. Yes, ma'am. We'll definitely do it again. <laughs> All right. Thank you. All right. Have a good day. All right. Thanks. I'm going to still be fishing too. I'm just going to go to a totally different spot. <laughs> awesome. And if you have service, if you catch it, if you catch one, get up here and show us. All right. Sounds good. All right. Bye bye. Clearly, we, you know, fishing brings out, you know, the the emotions in us, and and definitely when you catch a big one, you definitely get emotional, and sometimes. That breaks your heart, <laughs> you know, when you can't find the fish, when you, when you feel like you, uh, you know, you've put everything into it, you can. All right, Miss Lori Ann. Oh, you're muted. Hang on, that's my fault. All right. The screen is yours. She's giving us kisses. <laughs> oh, I didn't realize you're the one muting it because I kept seeing it mute, 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 and I was like, why does it keep doing that by itself? Yeah, we have every once in a while we have popping sounds, and I just try to figure out who it is by elimination. <laughs> I just didn't know I'd see it on this side. Yep. All right. So you tried hard. You tried a new spot. You went out on a limb, and uh, for Literally. this these four hours, it didn't it didn't uh, pan out the way you wanted it to catching a fish. But you know, I, it looks like a really good fishy spot. It it does. It really does, and. Uh, the bait shop actually said there's some there's a potential for a 60 foot hole in here somewhere that you can get to on the bank. Now I don't know if I'm near it or what, but you know, who knows? But hey, I, I'm still thrilled to death. I'm so happy that 
you know, the girls did so well. Congratulations, Bex. That's amazing. And Vonnie. Uh, and really, I just wish everybody the best of luck. I'm just thrilled to participate. Awesome. Well, you did a great job, as always. And y'all check out Laura the Explorer. And the link is in the description. She goes live fishing all the time. And she puts out videos where her and her mom go uh, go uh, traveling around the state and look for uh, adventures. <laughs> so go check her out. Thank you so always, much. For always team Lori. Yep. <laughs> uh, Miss Becca is definitely a fan. Team Lori. Uh, thank you all. <laughs> all right. Be safe. Thank you. All right. Bye-bye. All right. Well, let me see. There's Chrissy. Then there were three. Then there were three. Who will it be? Who will be the Iron Cat Lady Angler Challenge Champion? <laughs> I really think all of them are champions right now. But, of course, we need to verify that by going on in the tournament. Chrissy Brown is back in the house. Looks like she got it figured out. Chrissy Brown is on the board with, uh, got to the second round. How about that? With one channel cat. Uh, Missy, uh, Missy Kennedy also got to the second round with a flathead, but for health reasons, she bowed out. So we hope that Missy gets the feeling better. Um, Jody, pontoon Jody down here on the bottom right has had an amazing morning with four awesome fish, two blue cats, two flatheads. One of those flatheads was a 29 pounder. What an awesome fish. And then Miss Bex and Miss Vonnie have tore it up out there on the, on the Potomac 22 fish. Um, the two biggest being a 19.2 pounder and then a 56 pound blue cat. Yeah. And I'll put that up right here. Uh, this is, uh, Bex's new PB, definitely the tournament big fish so far, and then the Iron Cat big fish. So it's going. We're doing great. How do you feel about moving on, Miss Jody? We figured it out. As long as I don't have to move again for belts, I've got three coming right now. <laughs> Thank you, Mr. Again. Wayne, for another $2 super sticker. Appreciate you. So you're dealing with uh, the Labor Day weekend boat traffic, huh? Yeah. Yeah. Well, luckily, most times this is the last weekend that those boaters come out. So. <laughs> I mean, All right. it's their holiday, too. That's right. That's right. All right. How about Miss Vonnie? Since you're up there, how do you all feel about moving on? you got to unmute yourself. Um, I'm sure we, well, we feel great because we um, – well, I guess we would get to keep fishing whether we moved on or not, but it's fun to uh, to move on with you guys and, and, uh, and keep on going. I'm not That's gonna right. <laughs> That's okay. <laughs> Have you dried off yet? Um, yes. Actually, I'm wearing like the, the kind of like light fabric. So, yeah, I'm, I'm, inside my pockets is still wet, but everything else. My socks are still wet, but I'm good otherwise. Well, I hope you get to go swimming again for another giant blue cat here in the second round. I would be <laughs> willing. Oh, here comes Betsy. <laughs> Guys, when I say that she fell in, like she went in the Potomac and she uh, wrestled that fish. <laughs> I, I, we saw. I started saying, don't let the hook come out. And I was like, oh, my God, that's a possibility. So then I was holding him under his little arm fins. <laughs> and like trying to like you know because i was like oh my god if i lose this catfish it won't be it won't be a happy day short marriage <laughs> that's the one thing i was just thinking about because think about it she just said you know she wasn't saying you know bonnie you know watch yourself don't you know don't go floating down the river she was going don't you get that hook out of there <laughs> yeah. you better keep that sucker in there at one point, she was trying to net it above the. I mean, it was too big. For it my was net. just so huge, right? But she's trying to get it over the fish, and I was like, "It's never gonna go over the fish," because he kept <laughs> diving and stuff. It was crazy. Yeah. It was great. It was good. It was great fun. It was exciting. It was a true pleasure to do it with you guys. 
So, yeah. yeah. Uh, I thought it, I thought it was awesome when you went and grabbed those fish grippers. I was like, oh, it's on now. Yeah. So he's grabbing <laughs> those like, fish oh, grippers. <laughs> and I know she was thinking, what if I miss and they go floating down the, the river? <laughs> <laughs> Hello, Redneck Cooking TV. We had somebody from France in here earlier, and it, it wasn't it wasn't Steven. It was Ikoka Apriso Ariel. Uh, did I say that right? Probably not. But she said that hello from France. Of seven. Okay, awesome. Love your show. Hi, girls. Bravo uh, for your performance. Awesome. And I did want to, um, uh, Mr. Roger earlier, uh, when he, you know, and I asked him how he was doing or whatever, he was, he said that he went out fishing last night. Um, and caught a 15 pound flathead and that's his very first fish after the surgery he had and that he was stoked and everything and he's like god is good and amen. you know amen and and it, that's exactly right y'all i mean I, I it chokes me up <laughs> i mean i just I, i'm so glad mr roger that you were able to do that and yes he is miss chrissy brown can you hear us yeah, I can, but I got a train right now. That's okay. Are you are you are you stoked about moving on to the second round? Yes, yeah, absolutely. Awesome. Well, keep up the good work. We hope you get another one here soon. We're hoping. Looks like Bex has got her round three fish on. There we go. This is uh so this is round two. They have two hours to catch a fish instead of four. And it looks like Bex has got her her fish. If it's 16 inches or over, and it's a catfish, then she'll move on to round three. Hey there, Mr. James, Patriot Catfishers America. We have some, uh, I believe, Pontoon Jody bought some bobbers from James to give away today as well. Isn't that right, Jody? Yeah. Yep, so we're going to give those away after we pick this sticker since he's in the house. Ooh, that, that's a small one, but it, it looks like it's 16 inches. We'll see. So that's the rules, everybody. It can be any species of catfish, but it just has to be 16 inches or more. And I think that's going to make it. I think it'll be 16. So while they're doing that fish... Let's go ahead and give away this um, Angler Holic sticker. Thank you to Lizabella and James for sending me one to give away. Uh oh, it's oh, Jody. I see you, Jody. We'll come to you. Oh, it's a good one too. Chris Uselton, congratulations! All right, dang, I'm hitting the wrong button. Come on, Kevin, get it together. And I'd like to say yep. congratulations to Miss Lizabella because she's—I'm pretty sure she's fixing to get married yep mm -hmm. uh, she said that the other day on the show this was look at her fight that fish Whew. all right we got we got one here but we want to show it to you because it's just um over 17. Woo! Now, I, listen ladies i believe you you have no reason not to tell the truth because you're catching so many fish <laughs> but thank you for being honest and showing us all sure. right that's number two that's the first one this round and number 23's total for them. All right, let's get back to this fish that Jody's reeling in here. I'll send the winner a MAGA pack of pink floats. All right, cool. That's so sweet. That makes 29 total for the day. Awesome. Jody seems like she's got another good one she's fighting. It's a striper. Yeah. Still cool. <laughs> it don't count. No, it don't count, but it's a it's a nice fish to watch. Striper. Well, striper lives matter. <laughs> yeah. Just make sure make sure it's watching. What's that? Two old bats is he watching? Um he was earlier. Two old vets, are you still in chat? I want to see this striper. 
Oh, look. Yeah. Dang, that's a nice one. That's a nice driver. Uh huh. 23.70. Goodness gracious. Wow. <laughs> no wonder she wants two old best to see that sucker. Yeah, everybody's saying put that sucker in the cooler. <laughs> they got big everything over there in Tennessee River, man. It's appearing have, that way. We have stripers uh in in uh, Lake Moultrie, but they don't get that big. If they do, they're rare. We get them here uh, a little bit down south of here, but we get them here and they get pretty big. But um, matter of fact, that's that's the only tournament I've actually ever actually fished as far as a tournament was a striper tournament. Welcome, Mr. Matt. Want to be outdoors? Want a day week fishing? Jamie Lett. Look at that sucker. George Hen. That's a nice one right there. Oh, that might be Jorge Hen. the biggest one sure. I've caught. Wow. That, that is a nice, I mean, that is actually a really nice one. Yeah. With those and, men, they're hard to get to live in the heat. That's amazing. I saw you, James. I, um, we'll definitely, we'll definitely, uh, Make sure you know who the winner is. So that's a, that's an interesting release. I want you to explain to the people. Um, I've seen other people do that before. They don't uh, make it in the heat. You have to do that to try to get the air back in them. Then they'll float for a couple minutes. Then they'll get uh, revived and go back down. If you don't, then I'll get them with the net and throw them back in again. But you gotcha. When you so that's your them, you'll keep them hanging out because the longer you keep them out, the less chance of them to live. Yeah, and those things fight for their life. Like they fight super hard and they give everything they got. Yeah. So that's your that's your PB striper? Yeah, I think before it was 17. There you go. How much did you say it was? 25? I don't remember. <laughs> <laughs> the one that's she just caught? Yeah. She's, yeah, she said 23, I believe. That's awesome. Well, congratulations on your new PB Striper. That's awesome. Thank you. Still got to catch a catfish, though. <laughs> <Yeah. laughs> <laughs> it, it, <laughs> you get it. We know you'll get it. Yeah, they're saying in the box. 23.7. I should have measured them. I think it was 40. All right, so we're going to give away. So since it's only appropriate, we got Patriot James in the chat. And Pontoon Jody just oh, caught there, that fish. And, there goes Bex, too. Oh, really? I she just, just ran down to her pole. There goes the bells. Bonnie says, listen, I ain't got time to catch no fish. <laughs> I know. <laughs> I need sustenance. <laughs> she said it's another really big one. Uh-oh. I just got dry. <laughs> I wonder what the pizza people were thinking when Vonnie walked up with her slime all over her. <laughs> like pizza in one hand, that in the other. You know, yeah, no big no. deal. <laughs> <laughs> well, y'all, Pontoon Jody bought a set of Patriot Catfish Bobbers for someone to win in a giveaway. Uh, so... Put hashtag Babas. Babas. I shouldn't have spelled it that way. People are going to get it all wrong. <laughs> Babas. Oh, crud. I typed it in. I just typed it in wrong. <laughs> <laughs> hashtag Babas. Catfish in America makes you take out the space 
In between the hashtag and the B. No spaces. No spaces. While she's fighting that fish, I just want to thank our tournament sponsor, which is the Catfish Conference. The Catfish Conference has donated a free hotel room stay for the winner of uh, these two day this two day tournament, uh, along with two tickets to the Catfish Conference. So that's an awesome prize. Thank wow! Look at it! Look at it going. Uh, Miss Amy, Miss Amy just said that they hit a stump, broke the transducer. They're taking on water. She's got the bilge pump going on and trying to make it to the ramp. That gum. Prayers, girl. Man. Yeah, that ain't good. You better let us know that y'all are okay when y'all get to the bank. Seriously. And this is another big fish he's reeling in. Keep that tip up, girl. Don't lose it. Look at it. Look at it. Go. <laughs> Man, that's action right there, y'all. She needs a blue cat rod for them big fish. Miss Amy's getting a lot of prayers right now. Yeah. And, of course, Mr. Larry. I mean, he's with her. <laughs> <laughs> We're not just praying for Amy. All right. Potomac River is on freaking fire. What is it ever? No I wonder what, everybody don't like it. <laughs> I tell you what, like they better stop catching so many fish or they're gonna have even more people move into DC area. <laughs> Uh, yeah, we, we can yeah. pray for them real quick. Heavenly Father, I want to lift up uh, Larry and Amy. Uh, you know, they're having boat troubles right now. I just pray that you get them safely back to the boat ramp. And for Missy, Lord, who's not feeling well. Uh, Lord, just leave you in their hands. In Jesus' name, amen. Amen. Thank you, Missy. Yeah, I should have done that to begin, for, to begin with. Man, look at this fight. Yeah, by the time, you know, she finishes fighting that fish, uh, Miss Vonnie could have had another slice of pizza. <laughs> I, just, I have to laugh. I have to laugh at Mr. At our Uncle Lee, you know, calling it the potato. <laughs> so, so now all I can think about is Vonnie down there, like getting in a bowl of mashed taters. <laughs> <laughs> Vani is earning her pizza today. I wonder if Steven is like contemplating getting off of work. He's like, or, or whatever he's doing. So that's it. I'm going down to the river. <laughs> Yeah, Papa T said, been there, don't want to live there, but really want to fish there. Yeah, I, I've been there, and I, I can't stand that traffic. Yeah, I don't Can like we any put the traffic. Iron Cat on our new banner? Uh, sure. I'm not sure what you mean by that, but anything that promotes the Iron Cat is also fine with me. <laughs> P. Hunt said, I think Vonnie just likes getting in the water to cool off. I'm sure, you know, it does help with that. Will O said, does Bex, uh, does Bex has what it takes? Oh, okay. <laughs> Absolutely. 
that's uh that's uh has his tournament his 1v1s is uh do you has what it takes <laughs> if steven puts on a dress it's really on then <laughs> Catfish in America cover banner. Yeah, just uh, let me see it before you put it up, and, and we can definitely do that. I'm, I'm okay with that. There's That's Kelly length- Tor. That's a lengthy fight, Bax. Exciting. Yes. What's up, Skelly? Eddie said, oh, no, taking too long to net Catzilla. She's wiping the sweat. She's had some ultimate fights today, hasn't she? Well, has she ever? Pete said, this is huge. It must be. Oh, there. Look at it. Look at him trying to pick it up. Goodness gracious. Oh, goodness. Oh, my goodness. <laughs> All right. Somebody needs to get Steve Douglas to get these ladies a monster rod holder net. <laughs> Boom! $20 from Daniel. Thank you. Oh my gosh. Unmute, please. You want us to measure it? Uh, <laughs> yeah. <laughs> All right, we're going we're gonna to weigh him. She tried as hard as she could to say that without a smirk on her face. <laughs> no, we're not quite sure if it's uh, 16 inches or not. Yeah. <laughs> no, we definitely want to know the weight on that sucker. Will it be a new... Is it bigger or smaller than the other one? Bigger. Bigger. One, two, three, two, six, five, sixty. Sixty. She's saying sixty. Sixty. Six. Wow. Awesome. I wanted to lock in this. Like to... <laughs> she said, "I wanted to lock in. You're gonna have to hold it steady." All right. Let's see if we can put this up for you. <laughs> so six. Sixty even. It went. It kept going between. It went from sixty to sixty-two. Okay. Well, let's yeah. Do, let's do sixty since you're taking off the net. Okay. Yeah, sixty, sixty, like point zero. So we're taking off the net. So like fifty-nine pounds. Why don't we call it chunky style sixty? Yeah, we're just making an even sixty. <laughs> Because it did go up to like 63, she said. Or I mean, listen, like this, nobody has certified scales out here. She's going to make it. She's going to make it feel one more time. All right. Mr. Bobby just came in the house straight to the point and said, wow, this is where I tune in at. <laughs> Bex is going to sleep good tonight, y'all. <laughs> 60 pounds. I'm comfortable calling it 60. I don't think anybody in chat would argue. No. Doesn't really matter anyway. Do you realize that's more than a little person? Like my little niece? That weighs like more than my little niece. Here. All right, one more time. Put your... I'm going to break. Here's this 58 there. We're going to call it a 60. We all decided. We're calling it a 60. All right. So let's show them. Oh, my goodness. Yay! Yes. Congratulations. So, so while Bonnie's getting your... thing in his mouth, the crazy thing is it, it snapped off right at the bank. Wow. And Bonnie got it in the net. <laughs> Way to go, Bonnie. Saving yeah. the day. Broken the PB twice in one day. 56 pounder, and then she just upped it by four more pounds. A 60 pound hog, and the 24th fish caught all day, and the second one caught in round two. That is freaking amazing. And we're obviously they're going to lift it up here and then get it back in the, in the water. And again, to everybody who's just watching or watching for the first time, uh, all these fish are CPR, and that means catch, picture, release. So all these fish are getting released back back into the Potomac so that uh, they can catch them again one day, or you can catch them one day. You guys ready? Yep. 
Get get your screenshots ready, y'all. There you go. Yeah, I was gonna say this is a sit down one. <laughs> yeah. Look, Look at, at that. that. Oh. I'm trying to get. Yes. Yeah. That almost don't fit all in the screen. Do you want to get in? Yeah. Hold on. She wants me to get in. Yeah. Oh yeah. It's a tournament we're in. Actually. We're streaming. All right. Screenshot. Screenshots. Good boy. Right. Good job, ladies. Let's get him back in the water. Awesome job. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Yeah. Sorry. He did. Wow. We got to focus on getting the We got all so, kinds of awesome comments, ladies. Get the, uh, they said, Vonnie oh, patted the fish like, good boy. Yeah. <laughs> 24. 25 more pounds, she would have had the new Potomac record. Hmm. Hey, the, listen, the day is not over. Yeah. <laughs> and then right at the last second, the line snapped, but I had just got her in the net. We're going to focus on getting the fish back in the water, though, just because so yep. they want to keep it healthy. Yep. And then definitely, we definitely. Them. Definitely. <laughs> Look All at right. that. Yeah. There we go. Look at that. They got it in a sling, too. That's how you do it, folks, right there. Take these ladies' example. You don't hang these big fish by the jaw. Um, you put them in a sling like that, and you take care of them just like they did. Great example. Fantastic job all the way around from catching the fish to netting the fish to picking it up and supporting it to uh, putting it in the sling. You know, as fast as they could, they took that fish from the water to weigh it, picture, and back in as fast as they could. Great job all the way around. And Mr. Mike just emailed you the screenshot. That's what he said. Yeah, let me yeah. see. Catfish in America says, if they put on a wig and a dress, can he fish it next year? <laughs> <laughs> Maybe not fish it, but could you you could actually be the biggest blooper. <laughs> yeah, hey, listen, that might be not might. That's an awesome you know, there's so many different categories for the Golden Whisker Awards, but they could definitely qualify for several of them with that fish. You know, there's a new category called Female Angler of the Year. There's newcomers of the year. There's blue cat of the year. All kinds of different awards. Superb fish management. Absolutely bandit frogster. Ladies and gentlemen, Bex has got this. Well, she's got the big fish down, hands down, but uh, that's not how we win the tournament. She definitely got a leg up. But right now, Bex is moving on to round three. She's got two fish in round two. Um, but don't don't count Jody and Chrissy out. They're not out of this yet. Again, it's the last angler standing who wins the tournament. Boom, 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 boom. <laughs> no more loss. Boom, 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 boom. <laughs> hey, but while you're sitting there resting, make sure you check. I'm sure you're already going to do it. But just because that popped off, check all your leaders. Because <laughs> the, the Potomac record is coming next. I feel it. I don't know if my back can handle it. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, Miss Bex, I need you to send me your address, and I'm going to send you a new set of scales. Uh, wow, thank you. Um, I will send you my address. Yeah, it's on my about page. Uh-oh, fish on, Chrissy Brown. Are you snagged? Oh, dang. Miss Melissa, nothing yet from Miss Amy and Larry. 
Boom, Daniel, thank you for another $30 super chat, man. I appreciate it. That's 50 total from you in the past like 20 minutes, man. That's that's so awesome. Thank you. Thank you so much. That's going to help me. Um, so all these prizes I'm shipping out is going to help with that. And then um, each, so we're doing a first place through third place medal for today and tomorrow. We're doing a big fish medal for the whole tournament and then a most fish medal for the whole tournament. So that'll help purchase those medals and ship those medals out too. So um, for all of you who can donate that are donating, I really appreciate it because that's going to help definitely get those prizes out. Uh, let's see. Bex and Vani, the big fish lucky charm. <laughs> all right. So we were doing a, we were doing a giveaway before they hooked that fish. <laughs> so I'll give everybody a chance. Hashtag Baba's spelt just like it is on the screen. Uh, Pontoon Jody bought a pair of um, Patriot catfishing bobbers, Patriot floats. And uh, so she's donated those. So thank you, Pontoon Jody, for that. Let's see. Kevin, let Bex know we'll let her pass on the dance this time. We know she was tired. <laughs> Probably tired and ready to have a slice of that pizza. But I tell you what, though, Miss Becca, I would be okay Fish with, on. Not get, uh -oh, with not being able to eat my snack if I was catching 50s and 60s or any fish. Oh, I, I tell you, I, I can't wait so I can catch something half that big. Me too. Oh, thank you, Becca. <laughs> thank you so much. Becca said, "Very so very blessed to be part of this wonderful community. Y'all are all the best. Thank you, Miss Becca. Miss Becca is also one that always is so generous. But I don't have to tell y'all that. You can see it for yourself. Well, they've just got me so excited today. <laughs> <laughs> Becca's, Becca's almost been to tears three or four times a day in the chat. <laughs> they... Thank you so much. Yep. Make sure y'all check out. I need to walk out. around. I need to walk around with like Kleenexes, you know, yeah. <laughs> tucked into my. Yeah. Make sure y'all check out Miss Becca's link. It's in the description. Um, eventually, she's going to be in a place where she can do a lot of fishing and mudding and hunting and stuff. And y'all can check her out. And then we can show her all the awesome support she's shown us. So make sure you get that channel in your subscription box so that we can do that when she gets to that point. Well, I appreciate that, but you didn't have to say all that. Well, I, I was, I, I've already subscribed, so I'm just trying to get other people to do it. <laughs> the most boat-filled venue produced the most fish. Wow. Oh, yeah. Well, I don't know. Pontoon Jody's got – she's been dealing with um, Labor Day boaters all day too, so. I'd hate to see what our lake looks like right now. Is that a striper floating out there? Yeah, looks like it. I don't know how much that tastes. Aw, that poor oh, thing. You made it back. Hey, we did. <laughs> we made it, y'all. Shoo! It was rough. Oh, thank you. Man, so it so oh, it knocked weird. the transducer oh, off. Here's and, the damage. And, Bolts come out. Those I'm so glad they made the it. Just them little holes. Mm. Wow. Me too. I'm gonna tell you, it was. Uh, it's been about two years ago. We were at the boat ramp and uh, saw a boat that took on a little bit of water. And you know, a boat doesn't have to take on much water before it decides it just wants to flip on over. And uh, so I was kind of scared. I'm glad we made it. So thank y'all for the prayers. Bye, thank you. There's another fish right there. I'm glad y'all are safe, Amy. Awesome. Yay! That's another fish. Thank y'all. That's fish 25 total and number three. Let me get back to Amy real quick. Yeah, I'm just glad y'all are... Oh, well, she left. <laughs> Thank you. Mr. Mr. Steve, I'm telling Ooh. you. <laughs> <laughs> he does that on purpose. What? <laughs> Steve loves competition. <laughs> he he did a one one cent more, but I know. Awesome. Steve, you really want to go there? 
Uh, Steve is so funny, man. Generous people. Y'all are all generous. Yeah, Patriot, Um, it's best. Becca's link is in the description, but two stands just put it up there, too. Oh, well, thank uh, you. To make it a little easier. All right, so let's get back to this bobber giveaway. <laughs> Boom! Steve Adams catfishing the Mississippi River. Thank you for the $10 super chat. I really appreciate it. Thank you oh, so much. Oh, amazing. Hashtag Babas. We're going to give these away now. Thanks to Miss Pontoon Jody. And go. Joe Sutton. All right. Joe's been Congratulations. In here so, Joe, um, send me an email. And Patriot uh, James is, I think Jody said he's going to send those straight to you. Yeah. So um, send me your uh, shipping information and I will get that to Patriot James. That way just there's no confusion. Congratulations, Joe. Brian Smith with a $3 super sticker. Boom, boom, boom. Thank you, sir. Appreciate you. I'm not sure. Kind of explain those super stickers. What are the super stickers? The stickers are like when you don't want to say anything. Oh, like you, okay. You you click the super sticker, and some of them have emojis. Uh, I can't tell on this side if they're emojis or not. Uh, let me see. Let me I know I'm going to go with it. Oh, yeah, he's got the pom-poms. Yeah. Oh, no, so that's my kind of emoji. Can't. Yeah, we can't see the uh, super stickers, the emoji on a... Uh, stream yard but we can see it on youtube oh those are cute mm -hmm. i like those pom-poms i still got my pom-poms <laughs> you do i still actually i think <laughs> yeah you can see them in the chat cool All right, well, the giveaways don't stop there. Um, let's see. Joe Sutton, appreciate it. Will do. Yes, sir. Yes, sir. Congratulations. All right, Miss Becca, will you go over the stats while I load the next giveaway? Yep. No real loss. Are sitting at 24 fish for the day, two fish for the second round. They also have the largest right now and personal best at 60 pounds. Miss Missy had one. Miss Chrissy had one. And Miss Jody has four. And that makes a total of 30 catfish so far for the day. Right on, right on. Thank you for that. Oh, and Miss, uh, Miss Amy had two turtles. <laughs> and Pontoon Jody had a striper. Yeah, and a striper. PB striper. Uh, no real loss. I have a sticker here to give out from no real loss. I have one on my boat and she sent me an extra one to send out tomorrow. I got a bunch of little ones to give out on the but, uh, pretty cool sticker. It's got a Scott Scottish hat on one fish and a French hat on the other because Bex is from Scotland and Stevin is from France. So we're going to give that out and all you have to do is put hashtag big fish because that's what Bex has caught. It's two giant fish today. She's caught a 56 and a 60. Yep. It's crazy. She started out with a 6.7. Yeah. <laughs> then it, then it, then it kind of got a little bit bigger to a 19.2. And then it just like swarmed off the whole screen on that one. <laughs> yep, yep, yep. She might be she might uh be rigging up that blue cat rod to get out there <laughs> since the big fish are biting. <laughs> I mean them those ugly sticks will pull them in, but man, it's nice with a big fish like that uh, to have a little bit of backbone on your rod. But hey, they did it though. They got them in. And she Mr. Said Brad, that, uh, uh -huh. go ahead. I was just saying, Mr. Brad called. I was just time to drive safely. He's driving and listening. And I said, Beck's got a 60? I missed it. Yeah, she got a 60. And it's not yep. too far back if anybody wants to go back and look mm -hmm. at it. 
about 15 20 minutes ago uh, what was I gonna say yeah new PB for Bex twice today twice and right now the anglers have an hour and 14 minutes left to catch a fish Chrissy and pontoon Jody yeah I missed it I have to go back yep yeah, yeah she she wasn't happy with just one personal best. She had to do it twice. Hooks and Hammocks donated five dollars to Becca for supporter of the year. Hashtag Golden Whiskers. So that would be subscriber of the year. That's a, that's actually a category. So if y'all feel that way when that comes around, remember Becca, and you can nominate her for subscriber of the year. I totally agree with that. Thank you, Mister Chris. Straight Militia said, what is Bex fishing with? Cut bait? I think she's she might be, but I'm sure there's some jello chicken out there somewhere. I think she's fishing with some magic. <laughs> there you go. Yeah, th that's the third PB for Bex in like a week. Yeah. She caught a 36 last week, I believe, or earlier this week. The days run together. Um, they were catching them last night, too. The Thursday night. And then... uh two more pbs today we were talking about that earlier like she was reeling in fish after fish today which usually would have beat her first pb like half of them would have beat her first pb and now she's like yeah here's another one whatever <laughs> and now she's like can't even pick up the fish voodoo magic <laughs> they're gonna have to get one of those steve douglas uh 150 pound nets now <laughs> yeah, you need an HD80 or an HD150. All right, so we're doing a no real loss sticker. You're definitely going to want this sticker, y'all. We got 173 people watching, only 64 entries. You're really going to want a no real loss sticker. I mean, they just hit a thousand subs. They, I mean, Bex is catching the big fish left and right. You're going to want this sticker. She's using Chunky's eels. <laughs> she could be. She could be. Eel is a hot bait on that river. That's because she wants to de eel liver the best. <laughs> Yikes. <laughs> Yikes. <laughs> Go ahead. Go ahead. Sing your motoring. <laughs> motoring. <laughs> <laughs> peace listeners this got me so pumped i'm gonna pack my truck backy so monday i'm fishing yeah i'm going out fishing monday too man let's see chrissy aunt and joey today chrissy's aunt and joey today oh okay so lisa is is saying that she's chrissy's aunt i think is that right, yeah. Chrissy? And her Joey, meaning her her assistant. Oh, okay. Awesome. Yeah, and I her get Joey. It I get it. Thanks for the help. Thanks for the help with the context clues. <laughs> Let's see, Palmetto, the last time my dad was that bad, I got booted. <laughs> I'm talking about the dad joke. <laughs> uh I nominated George Reed as mod, George Ray as mod of the year. We don't have that category yet, but that might be something I consider. Mike Turner 712 said it with a five dollar boom. Thank you, buddy. Uh, let's see. Bex needs um, to call out the winner of the Has and Brian B. She's over there doing her dance. Wait, wait, wait. Everybody said they needed a dance for your fish. Go for it. <laughs> oh, man. It's Grease Lightning. You know, we all, we all are a bunch of nerds, but I'm okay with it. <laughs> I know. I'm Kevin, a dork. There's a difference. Yeah. <laughs> Kevin, does Bex have most fish caught in an iron cat? No, not yet. I think Stan or Dan, one of them two. Uh, I actually have to go back and see. 
I'm sure Stan will let me know. I think Stan probably caught like 30 something. But Dan caught a bunch too. I can't remember. Good question. Hey, Palmetto, your motor keeps me fishing when there's absolutely no bite. Yes. It's good to just shout. Especially when there's no fish. Just just shout it out. Just clear the mucus from your lungs and just shout one out. That reminds me of that song. The shout, you know? Yeah. Oh, shout, shout, shout it out. Boom. Muskrat wants to know where Miss Chrissy is fishing today. West Virginia. All these ladies are doing great. Keep up the amazing work. Thanks, Brad. They are. Chrissy, I, I know you're in West Virginia, but I forgot the river. You want to remind people? Die and die. Did what was you, that? Did... Die and die. Okay. Motor. <laughs> uh, your boy Troy said, let's go, Jody. Get a 70. Well, she surely can where she's at. I would love to get a 70. I think we all would. <laughs> That's what dreams are. That's right. Chrissy is fishing uh, in West Virginia at Guy and Dot. Okay, that's why we didn't understand it because it's a funny name. All right. We got you, Chrissy. Thanks, Lisa. Dan had 28. Stan 3 had 25, including his triple 50s. Okay. So, um, TFG Outdoors um, wants to know if they've caught anything. And No Real Lost has caught 24. I hear an echo. But uh, No Real Lost has caught 24. With the biggest one of the day, which is also a personal best of 60 pounds. Miss Missy has, and with two fish being in the second round. And then okay. Miss Missy's caught one. Miss three, fish. three fish in the second oh, round. I'm sorry, three. I, you know what? I had it as three. I said, I just said it wrong. Um, yeah, so 20, I'm sorry, 25 fish. And then Missy's one, Chrissy's one, and Jody is all four. Those are all in the first round. So, we're waiting for Miss Christy and Miss Jody to catch one in the second round. That's right. That's right. So, so two, yeah, I am, yeah, I am here on, on your side, Becca. Uh, let me go. Let me go out and come back in. Okay. So uh, Stan told me that Dan has the record of most fish with twenty eight, but Bex is getting real close. She's at twenty five. So three more fish and you tie the record. Four more fish, and you'll hold all the records. All the records. All the records. <laughs> Thank you, Central Valley Adventures 199. Sprinkles for Bex. Sprinkles. Appreciate that. All right, we were giving away something. We were giving away a no real loss sticker. We got 74 people entered. Here we go. And boom. Good luck, everybody. By Logan Medical Center between the bridge and the train trestle. That's where Chrissy is. Sandy Creek, South Carolina. You want a no real loss sticker? Congratulations. Send me your address and your name and what you won, and I'll get that out to you next week or this week coming up. Sandy Creek. That's an awesome sticker. You're going to like it. It's, it's a nice, thick high quality sticker so i think you'll like it all right did that back, help, did that help the echo yeah check 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 yes ma'am you're good to go okay. good to go well guys i got to i got to get cook kick uh cooking on these giveaways i keep saying that but i'm going slower and slower i have a hill jack sticker i don't know if he's still doing youtube anymore but i got a sticker and he gave it to me to give out so i'm gonna give it out how about that? How about them apples? And I'm wearing a hill jack hat that he gave me. And then we have a hill jack catfishing sticker right there. That's going to be our next giveaway. And we're going to do these a little faster, y'all. So I say that. <laughs> so uh, we're not going to hold it up there for too long. 
Hill Jack. Hashtag Hill Jack will get you entered to win that sticker. And thank you, Hill Jack. If you're uh uh, I mean, straight to the point, don't enter if you don't want it. <laughs> as easy as that. Papa T said, sorry, ladies, but I've got to get to the pharmacy before it closes. All right, man. Well, thanks for watching so far. We appreciate you. All right. Hashtag Hill Jack. We're just going to put this up for about a minute or so. Hill Jack, if you're listening, thank you for the hat, buddy, and thank you for the sticker. Appreciate it. Looks like the entries are still coming in. Hey there, Mr. Dave J. Ryan Smith. And those of you who don't know um, where they're at, let's see. Chrissy Brown just told everybody they're on in West Virginia. Um, Pontoon Jody's on the Tennessee River. Uh, what we like to call the Magic Kingdom, <laughs> which I think the Potomac might be stealing that title at, from the Magic Kingdom. <laughs> and then, of course, the Potomac River is where Bex and Bonnie are. I'm here in South Carolina, and Miss Becca is out in uh, Texas, Tejas. For a little bit longer. For a little bit longer. Is everything really bigger in Texas? Um, no, our parts ain't bigger. <laughs> yeah. I got to tell y'all, y'all catch some humongous, uh, like, well, I mean, I think y'all what call them bluegill or something or brim or something. I don't know. Yeah, Ours don't yeah. get that big. We got yeah. little appetizers. Appetizers. <laughs> well, I think, um, uh, fish snatcher would say you can throw them in the pot. It was pot yeah, shit. that's exactly. You cook them all whole, <laughs> and that's one of the best things about eating. You know, eating them is because I love the tails and the fins, and that's mm -hmm. that, that's. I think that's the best part I love to eat about a fish. Missy Kennedy said, "Bex cheated. I told her no chicken, and she used it." <laughs> oh, that's funny. Kevin, you mean we is in South Carolina? Yes, I am in South Carolina. <laughs> South Cackalac. All right, here we go. It's for Hill Jack sticker. We got 47 entries. Draw. Oh, it might help if I put it up there. <laughs> Evan TV's in the house. Welcome, Mr. Evan. The Bandit Frogster. She has won a sticker. <laughs> Congratulations. Send me an email with your address, and I'll get that out to you. Let's see. Uh, Underdog Mountaineers Catfishing waves to Palmetto and Becca and salutes Bex and Bonnie and all the other lady anglers in the tourney. Big hugs and thumbs up to all the family. But we're waving back at you. Kane has a question for you. Oh, oh, heck, uh, yes, sir, right there. That's the best thing. That's the best tater chips there are. You sit there and fry those up and you eat those tails and the fins. They, I mean, they really are the perfect, what I call like a tater chip, you know, but they're, they're, they're fishy chips, I guess. <laughs> Eating those since, ever since I was a little girl. All right. We're moving right along with the stickers. Now, that is true what Trendkill said. The alligator gar in Texas are legendary. Hmm. All right, we got a pack of Chunky Cat stickers. Right there, there's the first one. Nice big sticker there. And you also get this one. A holographic Chunky sticker. I don't know if that'll... There it goes. This is for two stickers. One pack. And thank you for Chunky Cats Fishing. Elson sent me uh, a bunch of stickers with uh, pre-stamped envelopes to help with the shipping. So thank you, Chunky, for that. We'll be doing that. Those uh, a giveaway for those again tomorrow, too. So everybody wants them a Chunky sticker. Here we go. Boom. Go ahead and enter hashtag Chunky. 
Kane Sample said, I've never heard that before. Missy said she's freezing. She's got a fever and heat wide open. Well, man, something hit you pretty hard, Missy. I hope you get better. We said that prayer for you earlier. I think God's going to take care of you. Mike Mike Chavez said, heck yeah, fishtails are good. He knows what I'm talking about. Chunky, 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 chunky. Hashtag chunky. There you go. Those are some nice stickers. Make sure you enter it just as it is on screen. Hashtag chunky with no spaces. And while y'all are doing that, I just want to thank our tournament sponsor, uh, Catfish Conference. Uh, thank you to Hervé and Steve who run the Catfish Conference. They have donated to the Grand Champion a uh, one-night stay in Kansas City, Missouri, Missouri, <laughs> Missouri, and a pair of tickets to the Catfish Conference in November. There's two Catfish Conferences. This one is to the one in November, and it'll be in Kansas City, Missouri. They're donating a hotel room and two tickets. Uh, to the grand champion. Now, how do we decide the grand champion? Well, whoever wins today and whoever wins tomorrow will do a fish off. The ladies actually came up with that. They said that's what they wanted to do. So the winner of today and the winner of tomorrow will face off again. And the winner of that, that showdown will win the grand championship prize. Awesome prize. Awesome. I think Bex already has a hotel room in Kentucky for that one. So she's going to be trying for the second catfish conference. <laughs> Bex said, I'll be at both of them. <laughs> but, uh, but yeah, so that's an awesome prize. Thank you so much for uh, Hervé and Steve for donating that. Appreciate it. Yeah, I wrote, I wrote that little uh... – that little song, you know, for the catfish conference. I mean, it's uh -huh. usually my little thing. They don't know about it, you know, or anything. But uh, it's, let's see if I can pull it up real quick. It's to the theme song of like Green Acres. Uh huh. Yeah, come on. Come on, computer. There come on, computer. I know, right? Work with me. Work with me. Um, let's see where to go. I'll find it here in just a second. Keep going. <laughs> mm -hmm. Oh, here it goes. It goes, the cat friends conference is the place to be. Cat fishing is the life for me. Water is spreading out so far and wide. Kick those cities. Just give me that riverside. <laughs> <laughs> That's awesome. Well, we'll have to record that and get it to Steve and Herve so we can play it on the loudspeakers at Catfish Conference. We'll get somebody that can actually <laughs> sing. <laughs> it looks like uh jody went out hopefully she'll be back in just a second somebody sent me a photo john parker sent me a photo oh it's an awesome thumbnail or it's an awesome uh thing for bex and uh vonnie i'll put it up on screen i gotta get it to my computer first It's pretty cool. Kevin, you just lost your job as lead singer. I'm okay with that. <laughs> <laughs> oh, man. I don't get no respect. <laughs> <laughs> we'll respect you in the morning. <laughs> <laughs> what was the comedian who did that? I, I just went blank. I don't get no respect. Oh, that was uh, Rodney Dangerfield. Yeah, Dangerfield. Yep, there you go. Here you go, Bex and Vonnie. John Parker made this for y'all. Congrats. 56-pound blue, 60-pound blue, 50 to 60. That's pretty good. He's cool. so good at that. And fast, too. Yeah, I'm that's a, it's amazing. Thank you so much. That's awesome. Thanks, John Parker, for sending that to me so that they could see it. And I'm sure it'll be on Facebook so you can grab it somewhere. Or he can email it to you, probably. 
All right, we're on the second hour. It's 1.05 p.m. Jody and Chrissy have 55 minutes to catch a catfish 16 inches or longer, or Bex will be declared the winner of today's uh, section of the tournament, which means she would have to fish again. Fish again, which I don't think she has a problem with. <laughs> Oh, no, not fishing again. No, oh, no, not again. All and right, we're at, here we we're go. at uh, tw what, what, 20, 25 for Miss Bex. Yep. Right, 25 with uh, three being in the second round. That's right. Personal best, of course, everybody just saw was 60. Uh, and then Miss Chrissy's has one. Miss Jody's got four. Miss Missy had one all in the first round. Um, but nothing so far in the second round for Miss Chrissy or Miss Jody. Mm, all right, where's Papa Potomac at? <laughs> Is that I think that's has has calls himself that. All right, here we go. Chunky stickers. Go. Good luck, everybody. One day a week fishing. Congratulations. Well, we all need that at least one day a week. That's pretty much with work going on. Unless we have a holiday, that's the only time I get to get out there is on Dagum Saturday. <laughs> but some people don't even get to do that, so I'm thankful. Mm -hmm. I used to um, go. I used to go every day before work, mm -hmm. and I would go every day when I got home. That's awesome. Yeah, because I had a t well, and it wasn't. I didn't go to the lake and all that stuff. I went to a you know a local tank that is around me or y'all call them ponds but it is right. relaxing mm -hmm, absolutely uh one day a week make sure you send me an email and tell me what you want and give me your address and i'll get that to you we're going to continue with the giveaways because we're going to run out of time if we don't definitely don't want to leave giveaways on the on the table All right. Next one is going to be uh, for a pack of Team Catfish A dot double action circle hooks. I just went to Walmart and grabbed a bunch of little things to give away. So if you're in need of a pack of three hooks, Team Catfish double action offset circle hooks, uh, go ahead and enter hashtag hooks into the chat and we'll get those to you yeah i just went out and um and got some hooks and some other little stuff you know a couple dollars and just to give out some tackle we got some awesome cuda scissors which i i should have bought me a pair too because now I'm having a hard time giving these away. <laughs> these little Cuda. I got some Cuda shears, which are awesome. But these Cuda scissors, they say they're good for um, braided line. So especially if you fish with braided line. But we'll give those away in a minute. But right now we're doing some hooks. Hooky, hooky. So hashtag hooks. There's Pontoon Jody coming back. Hey, Jody. Hey. I moved on down into a cove down past it. All right. Ah. Um, Straight Militia says, what do you think about octopus circle hooks? Never use them. Well, that's, the, that's another giveaway is octopus circle hooks right here. So you could try them. Um, I use octopus circle hooks. They work pretty good to me. Yeah, um, I know. Basically, I mean, they're. It's almost like, you know, some the some of these tackle companies like they get uh, hooks from a lot of the same manufacturers and they just rebrand them. But uh, a lot of them, a lot of them are octopus uh, style hooks. So, Flat Rock Flathead said I use offset, and that's what these are. I know these aren't offset. The other ones are the double action. 
What's tomorrow's tourney? Well, it's the same tournament as this, but I couldn't fit all the ladies on screen. StreamYard only lets me have 10, 10 um, screens open or 10 people in the chat or in, on the show. So we had to push four to uh, tomorrow. And so tomorrow's tournament will start at 12 p.m. Eastern Standard Time. I actually have a banner right here. It's day two. It starts tomorrow at 12 Eastern. That way, if anybody, uh, including myself, needs to go to church or, or Bible study or whatever they do on Sunday mornings, you can go do that. Strike Militia says, would a snail knot be recommended for those also? I use a snail knot on all my hooks, but, uh, you know, I recommend a snail, yes. But you can use, you can use a uh, improved clinch knot or, or a polymer knot. It's all personal preference. And Mr. Eric, yes, uh, Amy and Larry made it back okay. Yep, they came on, they popped back up on the screen. So we're getting getting some advice here, people asking questions. That's what it's all about. All right, here we go. We're going to give away the hooks. Now let's see if we can get 75. If you haven't entered, hashtag hooks. Go ahead and enter it. We got 70. We, we still have 173 people in here. I know it's it's awesome, awesome crowd today. Thank you all so much. Even if you're not chatting, I know there's a lot. You know, there's a lot of people that just don't chat. You right. know, they'll put they'll put it up on the screen and they'll just watch. And I appreciate those people just as much. Two hundred and twenty-seven thumbs up first. Yeah, not everybody's a jabber box like me. <laughs> My mom and daddy once told me that I could write a 2,000 word essay on a twig. <laughs> uh, all right, here we I, And I believe that. <laughs> <laughs> all right, here we go. We got 78 people now. Good luck, everybody. This is for the ADOT double action team catfish circle hooks. Rams bait and tackle. Congratulations. Woohoo. Rams, just send me your address and an email and what you won, and I will get those out to you. I know it's not much, but hey, it's fun to win stuff. <laughs> and who couldn't use some extra hooks, right? Exactly. What's that supposed to say? I put my name in there. <laughs> All right, I'm gonna keep on going with the with the giveaways here. I just gotta load them up as fast hey, as I can. You know, honestly, you know, it's you know you you're appreciative of everything, you know, um, or at least myself. I I appreciate even the smallest little things, you know, because you think about it, you don't really even have to do it. So it's it's an awesome thing. Yeah, yeah, I agree. All right, we got a Green Machine Outdoor sticker here. Dan from the Green Machine is an Iron Cat uh, oh, to go uh, medal winner. Don't he won. Me. Let's see, and 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 a um, Iron Cat kayak. I think he won the Iron Cat kayak. My brain is fried, but he he's definitely won some big fish medals, and I think he won the Iron Jeez. Cat kayak Jeez. tournament. And um, and he also on the first ever Iron Cat, he was a participant in that. He also hit his one thousand right here on Palmetto Cats Live. So that's awesome. So all you have to do to win that one is enter hashtag machine. Has to and and I know he doesn't use vowels, but we do. <laughs> yeah, Stan just confirmed it. The Iron Cat kayak win. Thank you again, Wayne. Wayne's been dropping them $2 super stickers all day long. Thank you so much, Wayne. I really appreciate you. And he's also a Boom Squad member. 
And for Boom Squad members, I announced it, but I'll tell everybody else. Um, I'll announce it right here. We got something new coming to Pound by the Cat, Miss Becca. Who? Uh, what? We've always, where? I've always, what's that? Who? What? Where? <laughs> when? <laughs> why? <laughs> Maybe some people will be asking why, but um, so we got a couple new things. First, as as far as the Iron Cat's concerned, um, you know we have one, we have two more Iron Cat tournaments after this one. Uh, the first one will be the Monster Hunt, which we had 22 people enter in for that one. Wow. And that's going to be in October. Two days, it's going to be another two-dayer, October 30th and 31st. And then we'll probably have to have a fish-off for that one as well. But I just added another one just to round out the year. Um, the last one of the year, um, and it'll be the last one until next spring, um, is the Iron Cat Walmart Bait Challenge. That's Iron interesting. Cat Walmart Bait Challenge. This is a collaboration uh, between Chris Flores and I. Uh, we're always bouncing ideas off of each other. And uh, so the premise behind the Walmart, and it'll be December 11th. It'll be, it'll be in the winter. So, you know, people that have iced over lakes probably won't be able to participate. But uh, the Iron Cat Walmart Challenge, you have to, you have to purchase. It's a three rod three rod limit number one and number two you have to buy one of six approved baits from walmart and those baits will be rusty's red shad rusty's green shad uh i think it's primo stink bait uh catfish pro uh fiber nuggets or whatever they're called and then that that those little Dough baits. I can't remember what they're called right off the top of my head, but you can choose from six of those and you can bring one bait of choice. And so what we'll do is we'll start off fishing with three rods. You can use whatever bait you want. Start off with most people will probably use their bait of choice and every 30 minutes we'll spin a wheel and whatever bait lands on. If you have bought that bait, you have to put that bait on the hook. Ah, nice little <laughs> twist in there. Yeah. So it'll be the same format. You still have four hours to catch a fish um, just to be consistent with the Iron Cats. But um, as we spin it, every half hour we'll spin it. And if you um, if you bought – so if you, let's say you bought the stink bait, but you, you're fishing with shad, right? If I spin the wheel and it lands on stink bait, if you have that bought, then you have to replace one of your shad baits with the stink bait. And do they have to tell you what all they've bought beforehand? That's right. They have to show the camera exactly what they bought, and they have to buy two. Now, I realize some Walmarts, like I know the DC Walmart is terrible, um, but if you want to order from Walmart.com, you can. But it has to be from Walmart, um, and it has to be one of those six baits. Um, so that's going to be awesome. If you want to register for that one, you can go to my website. If you want to register for any of these tournaments, my website is www.palmettocats.com. Yes, they are all terrible baits. Thank you. <laughs> all, all I have is eel at my Walmart. That's why I said you can order them online. You can order them online. Um, to get them in if you want to participate but if you ever want to participate in one of these iron cats you just go to my website the link is in the description and you can register on the website remember we can only take uh nine anglers uh, unless i have a co-host like today we can only have eight but uh i'm not planning on having a co-host for that one unless unless we don't get nine mines mines just sell chicken no they don't <laughs> <laughs> yeah, this was just kind of a special thing because of the lady anglers. Oh yeah, always special to have Beck on on the screen too. Um, so then the other thing for the Boom Squad members and for anybody who subscribes to my podcast. Um, so basically, what I do is on my talk show live streams, I'll just convert those over to podcast. Um, but I've had recently, I've had some requests to do some more substantial podcast stuff. And uh, so I got with Mr. Michael Murillo and we're going to do a weekly podcast 
uh, for the members uh, on YouTube, but then it's also going to be on the uh, my regular podcast, so Apple Podcast, um, you know, Spotify, all those things. So um, that's going to be something awesome because I've been struggling with this membership. You know, people that that join the Boom Squad and any other memberships on YouTube, I mean, they're making a financial commitment every month. Whether it's 99, look at no real loss. You didn't have to do that, Bex. <laughs> Thank you so much. Boom, 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 boom. <laughs> but um, but I've I've always struggled with that. And and I've talked with Michael Murillo, my wife, and other people about, you know, what can I do for these people because they're paying monthly to support me, and all I'm doing for them is sending them a sticker or um, you know showing them the videos I make. If I get them done in time, they get to see them earlier, uh, you know, stuff like that. And I wanted to do a lot more. So for those of you who are Boom Squad members, you'll get to see that live on YouTube. But it, for everybody else, it'll be converted into a podcast audio only. So I'm really excited about that. Micah Murillo has actually bought a real microphone and... <laughs> We're going to do it. We're going to do it for real. Fishing and freedom. Boom. Boom squad member. And I didn't say that to get new boom squad members. I promise. I know people will accuse me of that. I don't care. I didn't mean to do that to get boom squad members, but I do appreciate the new ones. Thank you so much. Um, so that's coming up new. I'm very excited. We were actually, I was actually wanting to do one last night, but Mike said that he had trivia night. So <laughs> But anyway, uh, that's that's something new coming. Go ahead, Miss Becca. I like Sir Charles. He said, "Been I'm kind of wondering about this one. Been trying to get my ex-wife to go deep sea fishing with me for a long time now. So, <laughs> yeah, I kind of like you know. <laughs> Is that a shark right there? <laughs> oh Lord. <laughs> Uh, I do. I do not condone violence, <laughs> current wives or ex-wives. Uh, that was funny. It was funny. I hope he's just joking. <laughs> he is. He's just joking. All right. So, so thank you for everybody who's joining and who's already a Boom Squad member. I just wanted to do something extra for them, and it's going to be fun. Michael Marillo is a fun guy, and he's full of. Uh, information and we're also going to invite people like maybe Becca might come on there or any of these other ladies and uh, it's sure to be a good time um, all right so hashtag machine if you haven't entered yes you are thank you so much oh yeah when I, after I get over there y'all gonna get tired of seeing me <laughs> hashtag machine we're trying to give away a green machine sticker I'll give you about 30 more seconds to join we got 59 people it's an awesome looking sticker. Dan puts out some great content. Make sure you check him out too. Hi there, Mr. Mark Knight. How you doing? He's another great supporter. One day a week fishing said walking back from the mailbox. Just got my no real loss stickers. Woo -woo. All right, here we go. We're going to give it away. And boom, here we go. There's Christina Dunnigan. How you doing? Hey there, Miss Christina. What do you want? I don't know. What else is up there? I'm going to ask. Dina Good. Diaz, congratulations. No, no. Congrats, congrats. All right, I got to move. Becca, you can talk as much as you want. I got to get through these. We have 36 minutes left. Um, and unless somebody, unless Jody, or Chrissy catch a fish. That might be the end of the tournament. I hope they both do. But uh, in the meantime, I need to get these stickers out. Well, get her done. Let's get her done. I'm, I'm get her done. You go ahead. Chat away. Let's see. Fishing with Big Mike. Why do all the awesome, awesome has happened while he's at work? <laughs> <laughs> well, well all, all his awesome content happens when I'm asleep. <laughs> I know, right? And you know, and then I'm stuck in the middle because I like all the awesomes in the day and awesomes at night. Yeah, you don't never get to sleep. <laughs> this is for a Laura the Explorer sticker. I wish I would have got to it while she was still up here. 
But uh, she was in the tournament today. Didn't get to move on to the second round, but did an excellent job. So put in Explora for a chance to win that sticker. That's right, Bonnie, because Mr. Mike works too much. <laughs> Backyard Cart, that's a new uh, name for me. Welcome. Mm -hmm. Jeff Tony, Murray. Tony, make sure you check out that little, um, what do you call that? Uh, dash. Take out that dash before the hashtag. Miss Real Gals, I saw you earlier, but I didn't. I didn't say hi, so I'm saying hi now. Miss Leisha's mom is still in the house. Make sure you take the space out of that, um, or put an X in that in that space, Leisha's mom. That's why they're under this bridge. That's why they're biting under here. Miss Elizabeth hey. is checking back in. Hey, Real Gals, fish. They sure do. <laughs> Yeah, she won uh, one of the giveaways during that tournament. Chrissy, how you feeling? All right. We're hopeful. You feel a fish coming on any minute now? We're I hopeful. smell one. <laughs> there you go. Mr. Tony right, Cole, make sure you take the E out and replace that with an X. Looks like Miss Jody's putting some fresh bait on. And, and I love her view, like where she's go got ahead. her camera. So, somebody was asking yeah, earlier. Angle and everything. Yeah. yeah. Somebody was asking earlier what she used, what she uses to prop her camera up, like that. That's like a good that. question. Maybe she'll come tell us. PVC pipe. There you go. Now stick it in the hole. Oh, that's how, how does that work? Oh, it's on like a selfie stick. Yeah. Oh, that's interesting. Fishing and stuff. <laughs> Fishing and stuff. PVC pap show. <laughs> you know, he secretly watches my show sometimes. You'll, you'll, pro you'll probably see a video about your PVC pipe pack. <laughs> it works. And it's That's cheap. awesome. Here's the PVC oh. pipe. So it is mounted to the back of my seat. Hey, that Hellcat rod was twitching. It always moves. <laughs> if you get one, get a heavy. Don't get the medium heavy. Yeah, that, those things, like the, the medium is actually a medium light. Yeah, they dance. They sure do. And Miss Jody, Miss Real Gals Fish really loves your shirt. But thank you. My daughter made it. Oh, her daughter made it. Yeah. Meow. <laughs> Matter of fact, she said that earlier, and I forgot to tell you. I appreciate it. So I have a question for you, Jody. Your husband, your your dedicated husband. What does he do while you're fishing? Does he just kick up his feet and relax? Well, he is today, but usually he didn't want to spend the night at first. And I don't sleep, so I want to spend the night. So I got smart <laughs> and got him a cup. So he sleeps while I fish. So you have a cot on the boat? For him. That's awesome. So when he catches a fish, I wake him up. <laughs> I'm here all the time. In other That's words, awesome. he takes, with your shirt, he takes cat naps, right? That's right. Oh, Lord. Here we go again. <laughs> On that note, time to give away a sticker. <laughs> Boom. Here we go. Good luck, everybody. <laughs> Who's it going to be? Thompson! I think I just saw him. He's giving out some stickers, too. I've got to get to those. Congratulations, Dobson. Uh, I saw... Uh, I'm going to get to your question, Straight Malicious. Give me one second. Let me go ahead and start this new giveaway so I can keep moving. <laughs> Rob's Matt. That was so cheddar. <laughs> 
<laughs> oh lord we got them everywhere now <laughs> hi there mr philip how you doing all right i'm changing hats you know what that means <laughs> anna obviously had this hat on before because it was on the second button we're gonna give well a has life sticker it's a sweet doggy sticker right there. Thank you, Mr. Hats, for giving me a whole handful of those. And thank you for the awesome hat. To win a Haslife sticker, all you have to do is put hashtag Haslife. That's a pretty, that's actually a pretty cool name. Haslife? I mean, yeah, how many people would love to, like, have thought about putting their, like, name after that, you know, like a, mm -hmm. you know, like a Becca Life, or, mm -hmm. it's really catchy. Yeah. I mean, you could, it's kind of like a, a lifestyle type thing. Mm-hmm. You know, I always wonder, I mean, it would take way too much time for everybody to answer, but I always wonder, like, how everybody, besides somebody's name, how people come up with their channel names. Oh, we can do it with at least the people on screen. That would be cool. Yeah, mine, I always wondered our, that. Our state tree is the palmetto tree. And so, uh, you know, and then catfish, cats. Bex, how did y'all come up with your uh, your channel name? Well, I couldn't really fish, but I like recording myself fish. And uh, I was like, you know, let's just call it, like, what, why do I enjoy it? I enjoy it because I get to go out there and whether I catch a fish or not, you know, whether we catch a fish or not, we had a good time. So, no real loss. No real loss. That's actually really interesting. Yeah, Bex could not fish to save her life once upon a time. <laughs> I mean, it took her three months to catch a, a bluegill. Look at her now. Yeah, and see, and I always thought it kind of meant, you know, something about, you know, like losing the reels or whatever. But yeah, that's <laughs> totally opposite. Yeah, so I, I'm glad you said that. Yeah, very. Well, the other one we were looking at was like the gratitude angle or something like that, but no real loss stuff. Yeah, well, it's, it's, a great it's catchy. Name. Yeah, it's very catchy. Thank you. Mm -hmm. All right, Miss Becca, what about you? Where's Mud Tramp come from? I know your birthday is July 15th, right? Yeah, but as I said, I think I'm going to change my name. I'm going to drop that off of there, and I'm going to change it to Becca Mud Tramp. You know, it's so. You, it's like, a, you like playing in the mud, right? Yeah, it actually, my name actually started off as a big old joke. Okay, that's where Mud Tramp came in. Uh, because I used to own a mudden, a mudden website and stuff. And so, um, anyway, it just that, that's how it kind of started was because of the Mud Tramp and the, the mudden and everything. And after that, it just stuck. I've had that name for so long. So mm. that's where mine came from. Okay, fair enough. I didn't know that you owned a that the button thing. That was pretty cool. Yeah, I, we also owned a, um, well, when I say we, it was me and my ex-husband. I mm -hmm. also owned a sports site, and I was sports tramp on that one. Nice. <laughs> so, so, but, but it's my passion. Yep. It, so. Right. And then Chrissy Brown is obviously Chrissy Brown. <laughs> and Pontoon Jody is, uh, you know, she's on a pontoon and she's Jody. I I'd let her uh, her say it, but she, she dropped out for a second. I'm sure she'll be back. Sir Charles said, Today I learned that if you're in a canoe and it flips over in the water, you can safely wear it on your head because it's capsized. Oh, my gosh. <laughs> oh, my gosh. Oh, that was awesome. Oh, my Atlanta. <laughs> High five. <laughs> bam, 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 bam. <laughs> On that, let's give away a Half Life sticker. Yay. <laughs> <laughs> that was priceless. <laughs> oh. Who's going to be? Who doesn't enjoy a good dad joke? Sandy Creek won again. All right. South Carolina folks. So she's uh, well, Sandy Creek. I'm not sure. Sorry, I, Sandy. I assume the girl 
name. But Sandy Creek, South Carolina, has won two Potomac stickers. They've won a Has Life and a No Real Loss sticker. <laughs> uh, Christina said, that's a dad joke if I've ever heard one. Absolutely. Fishing with Rom, Rob Max had crickets. Chirp, chirp, chirp. <laughs> Thank you, Mr. Maurice, for coming in, and you have a blessed day, well. Mm. All right. Pontoon Jody, I'm assuming that your uh, your channel name became comes because uh, you're called Jody and you're on a pontoon. Is that correct? Yeah. There you go. Sim <laughs> simple and sweet. Yep. All right. We're down to 24 minutes. Chrissy and Jody have to get on the board in 24 minutes. All right, and I have to do another giveaway. Freddie's yeah. outdoor says South. Is that Kakalaki? Get it right. South Kakalaki. Yeah, okay. Oh, Kakalaki. South Kakalaki. <laughs> All right, we're moving on with the stickers. <laughs> P hunt, that joke was a real stinker. <laughs> guys are killing me. <laughs> All right, we're gonna give away a laughing cat sticker. If you saw Sharina's keeping it real earlier, she had a Joey, her husband Thomas, has his channel too, and it's called Laughing Cat Fishing. And so when she sent me stickers, um, he sent me some too. So laughing cat fishing, if you want to win that one, just type hashtag L F or L C F L C F and uh for laughing cat fishing. Now is that just a coinky dink that we're sitting here telling these dad jokes, we're sitting there laughing, and then you do a laughing cat sticker? Maybe, but am I not allowed to be corny too? <laughs> <laughs> Oh, poor Tim Molina. I never went on Palmetto's channel. <laughs> Maybe today's the day. You know, Mark Catfish and Crappy said he never wins, and then he won today. And so did um, uh, Catfish Heroes, remember? Yep, yep. Thanks, never won until today. Sandy is a nickname for Sanford. I'm a male. Well, there we go. <laughs> my well, see, I'm biased because my aunt Sandy lives in Jamestown. So when I saw Sandy, I immediately thought of her. Uh, LCF, yes, okay, good. Hashtag LCF. Thank you for everybody's hanging in, y'all. We still have 169 people watching. These ladies battle it out. The fishing has kind of slowed down a little bit. Which, uh, you know, Bex and Vonnie are getting a breather and they're probably all full now and <laughs> slimy. <laughs> Has the and slime they, dried? They got everybody all, wanting pizza now. Well, I, I'm definitely ordering some as soon as this is done. Like, there's no, no doubt. It may not be uh, DC pizza, but what kind of pizza did you get? It was just Papa John's. So nothing, nothing local. Mm. But delicious nonetheless. And we got the pizza too. Did you say you can fish with Jesus with pizza? No, I said you can fish pizza, but I said we got the cookie pizza too. Oh, oh wow. Oh. You, you did it up for real now. <laughs> The jokes are real good. Man, everybody's got one today. <laughs> My aunt in Jamestown has a great name. She's an awesome lady, too. She She's about four, five foot two and a 90 pounds soaking wet, but she is the feistiest woman you've ever seen in your life. Every Christmas, she, she cooks for the whole family. Like, you'll come down there and she'll have the whole kitchen, like, Stirred up with ham and turkey and perlo and uh, yams and green beans, all kind, all the fixings. That's right, Mister uh, Rob Smack. He says, "Got us online, Becca." I was like, "That's right, I'm reeling y'all in." <laughs> Fishing with Rob Mack said, "Come on, Jody." She's trying. 
She said this daytime fishing isn't for me. I have three anchors out and still can't sit still. Yeah. That's that's pontoon life for you, with especially when you got boaters out there. Mike Turner seven twelve said, Yeah, thanks, Bonnie. I just had to order pizza for lunch. It's on the way. <laughs> Jesse said, don't forget, Bex, you added extra slime on that pizza for breaking two PBs and two Iron Cat records. Hey, do you have all six rods out? Oh, sorry. I wouldn't let us unmute. We have uh, three rods out right now. So listen... Not to not to force you to do anything, uh -huh. but you are you are four off the pace to tie for the most fish ever caught in an iron cat. I That's know. what I said. Five fish to break the record. Wouldn't it be nice to break three iron cat records in one day? Yes. No make pressure. Her do, make it her went. do it, Bonnie. Make her do it. I'm gonna cast <laughs> myself. All right, I'll cast them out. There you go. All right. Woohoo. <laughs> All right. Awesome. Here we go. Here's that sticker giveaway. Hashtag LCF. Hopefully you got to enter. Thomas is a good dude, man. He supports his wife all the time. He was doing it today again. Thank you for Thomas for setting the standard for us. Shad shade tree catfishing. That's a new one for me. I think. Shade tree catfishing. You know, she said that they got that um that dessert pizza. You uh -huh. know, I wonder if it was if it had peanut butter in it. PB, you know, PB oh peanut my. butter. Back up, back up, back up, back up. <laughs> I used to think that that's what that meant when I first, because I never really thought about personal best, and I kept thinking, why is everybody talking about peanut butter? And that's when I learned it. Yeah, they were talking about personal mm -hmm. bands. Well, Stan, one of the records still is on the James River, and you hold it. It's the most second place finishes. <laughs> <laughs> that's funny. <laughs> he uh, listen. I wasn't going to say anything, but he set himself <laughs> up for that one. He set himself up for that one. <laughs> oh, oh, my cheeks are hurting <laughs> that's a good thing <laughs> um, all right y'all uh, let's see Johnny's pop back out here we go yeah. <laughs> yeah shade tree just send me oh and I need to get back to straight malicious question real quick um, while we're doing that um I don't have any more big stickers. I've ordered them, but I have these small stickers, which are kind of cute. But we're going to give one of those away. Focus. There we go. So this one will be for a Palmetto Cat sticker. Hashtag Palmetto Cats. You'll win one of my stickers. And I'll actually send you two or three of these little ones. The uh, sticker mule had a deal. Tim Lena said, how's round two going? Well, before I answer uh, Malicious's question, Becca can run down for you the stats. So far, we got no real loss with 25 fish, with three of them being caught in the second round. Also got a 60-pound uh, personal best. Then we got uh, Miss Missy had one fish during the first round. Miss Chrissy had one fish during the first round. And Miss Jody had four fish during the first round. So we're still waiting for Miss Jody and Miss Chrissy to get the, on the board in the second round. Thank you so much. So um, Straight Malicious, which is a new name to the channel, thank you for being here. We really do appreciate it. And everyone who's new, make sure you hit that thumbs up and you've subscribed. Um, check out the description for all the giveaway links, giveaway people who's given things away, their links, and... Um, and also for links to the channels. Um, but there's two catfish conferences. One of them is November 19th and 20th. That's going to be in Kansas City, Missouri. 
The link to the Catfish Conference website where you can get all the information on the Catfish Conferences is in the description of this video. So you can always go to the description and check it out. There's also another Catfish Conference in February in uh, Louisville, Kentucky. And that's where they all started out was in Louisville. So you have two opportunities. Hey, Lee, um, two opportunities to visit the Catfish Conference. Everything catfishing in one spot. Uh, they have boats, they have rods, reels, equipment. You'll get to uh, hold the rods and reels, test them out. Um, you'll get to see the boats, get in the boats. You'll get the all the terminal tackle you ever need, um, even some bait stuff, bait tanks. And then uh, they also have uh, master classes is what I like to call them, but clinics where you'll get to hear from actual professional catfishing anglers, the ones that do it uh go on the tours and everything so make sure you check that out catfishconference.com link is in the description uh if you don't want to type it out they're also the tournament sponsor uh the lady that wins uh in the fish off after these two days are over will win a free night stay in a hotel in lou or uh kansas city missouri and a set of catfish conference tickets hi so there mr lee uh, straight malicious had asked me about that so i'm glad i got to answer it thank you to all the prize sponsors muddy river catfishing uh pc fun tidal weight sinker santee drifters catfish and crappy and catfish clothing we'll be giving away um a muddy river catfishing hoodie tomorrow we'll be giving away another set of santee drifters tomorrow we're giving away a pc fun alloy m it's more like a bash reel saltwater bash reel and uh, we'll be giving away five pounds of Brad Caldwell's Tidal Weight Sinkers uh, mixed box tomorrow. Thank you to Catfish Clothing and Catfish and Crappy for donating a hat for today's giveaway. Links are in the description as well. Day two of the challenge starts tomorrow at 12 p.m. Eastern Standard Time. We'll have Catfish and Katie Collins, Lisa the Fishing Chick, Lizabella from Angler Holics, Outdoor Ooh. Adventures, and um, Rebecca from Carolina Real Screamers uh, tomorrow as well as Becca and I will be hosting um, also. And then links to all, like I said, links are all in the description. All right, let's give away this sticker real quick. Boom, here we go. Good there's luck. another new name, 182QKFTW. That's a new name for me too. I've seen it once or twice, but yeah, it's a newer name definitely. Thank you for coming in. Eric Burnside, my buddy. Eric's Eric's already got some stickers, but he can use some more. Maybe he can give them away on his show. He's got a Bible study tomorrow at 2 p.m. Eastern Standard Time. Check out Eric Burnside, and Eric, maybe he can give away some stickers on, on that channel. It's growing, too. More, more, more and more people are coming into that Bible study. All right, I got to go. I got to go. Let's do a big giveaway. You want to do a big one? Of course we do. Oh, we got another fish. We got another fish. What did I tell you? That one kind of slipped out on you. We're going to measure him. We're going to measure him because he's a little bit small. Yeah, that's 16 inches, but you can measure it. <laughs> oh, okay, 182. What? 18. 18. Awesome. Congratulations. There you go. That's 26 fish. All right, y'all. We're going to give away a rod. We're going to give away a Bill Dance Catfish Special Rod, courtesy of Painting Services by Steve. A big giveaway. Biggest one of the day. Uh Make sure you enter in hashtag Steve U.S. only. Unfortunately, uh, will only he'll only be shipping it to the U.S. But if you're not in the U.S. and you want to um, donate it to somebody, if you win just to play, please feel free to enter the hashtag Steve. Make sure you enter it exactly as it is on the screen. I already see some people typed it in wrong. Make sure you enter it exactly as you see it on the screen. Thanks to. Uncle Steve, uh, painting services by Steve. 
I think he said he's retired now, but uh, I still have his Amazon link in the description. I don't know if that helps him or not. <laughs> but uh, yeah, um, you can still enter to win Pete Pete's whiskers, and you can just donate it to somebody uh, either on screen or somebody you think is worthy or needs it. So if you still want to play, still play. It's fun to play. Yeah, I see a backyard carp. You need to make sure to re-enter yours. <laughs> Freddie said, I never went on any shows. <laughs> well, you come in enough of them, you will. Hashtag Steve. Thank you, Steve. Also, he did uh, a couple of $100 donations, I believe, and, and a bunch of smaller ones. So thank you so much. Um for doing that and who doesn't want to win a rod i mean <laughs> i know right <laughs> uh brian marinar um you need to re-enter yours as well there we go he did okay. yeah all right Nine minutes left. Nine minutes left, ladies. You can do it. Final countdown. I can't believe there's only 91 entries. We got 168 people in here. I know, right? I guess I mean, people if y'all want to remove, run. if y'all want to remove like all y'all's entries, that took me just fine. <laughs> they're, they're going up now. 96. Tim Molina said, come on, team. Let's go, Team Jody. I want to see all, all of them going to round three. We're one takedown away. I know. I like to have Miss Jody's hair. That's some beautiful hair. Boom. Super sticker again. Thank you, Wayne. She does have a lot of it for sure. Yeah, I mean, it's it's actually gorgeous. I mean, I know most people don't look at that, but I do. <laughs> Thank you. All right, I still see him coming in. We got 100 inches. You only have to enter it once, guys. Enter it once correctly, and you'll be entered. All right, looks like they've slowed down. So far, no, Brian B, it's mine. No, no, it's mine. <laughs> All right, we got 102 entries. Thanks again for painting services by Steve for donating this rod. He said he's also donating one tomorrow, I think. So that's awesome. Come on, come on, come on, come on, come on. Draw. Here we go. Here we go. Here we go. Here it comes. My tramp. My tramp. <laughs> Don't mind me have to come over there. Avery, Avery Honeycutt. Congratulations. That's my brother-in-law. Oh. Is it? Yep. Yeah. That's pretty sweet. Yeah. <laughs> Did you get Avery my nine for Christmas? I hope you got my nine for Christmas. <laughs> <laughs> so you can get a bill dancer on. <laughs> I was thinking to say, nice to meet you, Mr. Avery. <laughs> Um, so Avery, you got to do a couple things. You got to send me an email with what you won and the emails and scrolling across the bottom. You got to tell me your address and you got to tell me, I think spinning or casting. Let me know which one you prefer. I believe he has both. Um, if not, I'm sure he'll tell me, but definitely do all that. Email me. Thank you, Steve, again for doing that. All right, guys, I got less than five minutes to do all these giveaways. I got a bunch of them. Boom, Lee Evans, thank you so much for the super sticker. All right, guys, we got to do this quickly. All right, we're going to do um, the same hashtag for the rest of them. So if you want to win anything else today, hashtag all them prizes. No, that's too hard. <laughs> Hashtag A-L-L. -L. There we go. I'm going to make it super simple. Hashtag all. We're going to just draw back to back to back because we need to get going. 
So we're going to do, we still have some Dobson stickers, a Catfish America trip, Hooks and Hammond stickers, Snake River sticker, some scissors, and some more hooks. So we got to do them quick. Come on, enter it in. Get your stuff in quick. Hashtag ALL. Couldn't be simpler. Couldn't be simpler. This is when you play the um, the Jeopardy music, you know? Is that another doo, fish? Doo. I got another fish. I see it in the net. <laughs> I told her she threw them out. She would get them. That's number 27. Look at Vonnie. She is over it. <laughs> you said you look over it. You got the hands on the hips. Like, I'm ready. I'm done. <laughs> now I'm ready to like go back down in and get some. Oh, okay. All right. <laughs> Hashtag ALL. Hurry up and enter quickly, y'all. We have four minutes to do six giveaways. I see um, Duke City Anglers has made it in here. What's up, Duke? All right, as soon as we see that fish, they're going to bring up that fish, and we're going to start these giveaways, regardless if you're in or not. We got Snapper King in the house. Alan Pashala. I'm not sure. I probably just butchered yeah, that. Yeah, Pashala. Pashala, yep. <laughs> it's biting there. <laughs> <laughs> really bit me, like right in the top part of my finger. Awesome. Well, you kind of do have them on a set of grippers. <laughs> well, then he awesome. wanted to open his mouth to get them in. So then I was like, here, you put my finger in. And he put it down right on my cuticle. All right, y'all. We're going to do quick giveaways here. So if you entered in, entered in hashtag all, we're going to go. So you got to remember what you got. This is for a sick pack of oops. Let me take this off. Pack of six uh, team catfish octopus circle hooks. This is for circle hooks. And Ogie seventy three wants to know the count so far. So no real loss is now up to twenty seven catfish. Um, Missy has one. Chrissy has one. Jody has four. Which is a total of 33 so far for the day. Awesome. Snapper King, you won the circle hooks. Email me with your address and what you won. All right, the next giveaway. Next giveaway is going to be for these CUDA, CUDA scissors. All you have to do to enter is put hashtag all. You can still get in them. Hashtag all. We're going to draw again. We get 102 inches this time. Jeff Howell, congratulations. Somebody needs to tell um, whoever just entered Steve in there. They're the way behind. <laughs> Stay. I, I gotta back up. Oh, Jamie Lett. You might wanna um. Somebody let Jamie Lett know that they might be behind. Or don't. I mean, it's one less person in the giveaway. <laughs> <laughs> hey, I thought that while ago with a rod. <laughs> I was like, oh no, y'all don't have dinner. <laughs> All right, these next couple I don't have because they're being sent from the people who are giving them away. So this next one is for a Snake River sticker. Snake River sticker. Say that fast ten times. Fish on! <laughs> All right, go ahead. She might break the record. Oh, one minute left. Maybe not. No. Steve Mosley. All right, Chrissy and, and Jody, it's 2 o'clock, but I'm going to give until 
Uh, I finished these giveaways for you to catch a fish. <laughs> Steve Mosley, email me. Um, tell me that you won the Snake River sticker and give me your address and I'll send it to him. Or Snake River can tell you how to get in touch with him, either one. All right, the next one is for Hooks and Hammock sticker. Hooks and Hammock sticker. Redraw. Hi there, Mr. Dagger. How you doing? Cowboy catfishing. Donald Ford, congratulations. You won a hooks and hammock sticker. Send me your address and the email scrolling across below. There you go. So um, Steve Mosley, email Snake River Catfish 208 at gmail.com. Thank you, Mike Turner. Hooks and hammocks. Uh, Donald Ford won the hooks and hammock sticker. We got two more. This next one's a big one. It's a um, free fishing trip with Catfishing America. Get on that. Catfishing America. Oh. Here it goes. I think Sharina is going out with Catfishing America tomorrow. Duke City, congratulations! Where is Catfish in America? Where Where are they at? That's a good you question. Know? Maybe he Maybe he's still here. Hey, Mister Duggar. And the last one, but definitely not least, is a a pack, a set of three um, Dobson's stickers. So Willie Dobson is giving away a set of three stickers. Um, to his channel, and that's what this giveaway is for. And Bex is running for fish. <laughs> Leisha's mom. Congratulations. All right, that means the tournament is officially. Over Alicia's mom, send me an email, palmettacats at gmail.com. Bex is reeling in her 28th fish. Is that what it is? Yep. She's got she's up to 27 right now. So that's awesome. This is always a sad part. Yeah, I mean, it's a tournament. I mean, people I do the best they can. Listen, everybody on screen here caught a fish except for me and you, Becca. I know, but I mean, it's sad that it has to end. Yeah, yeah. You know? But I am proud. I'm going to bring Chrissy Brown up full screen. Can you see? Can you? Chrissy, we can Hello. see you and hear you. Okay. And I'm so proud of you. You caught a fish. You moved on to the second round. I hate that you couldn't. we couldn't move on to the third round, but you did a great job. Anything you'd like to say to everybody? I'm thankful to have uh, been able to have been in this tournament. It was fun. Miss Chrissy, you are awesome. So supportive to everybody. And we've been praying for you. you we know you had a tough week. And uh, we've been praying for you and your family. And uh, I'm so happy that you were able to get up here and 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 do this. So. Thank you so much for being able to pushing through and doing coming out here and doing what you love. Thank you. All right. Well, thank you, Chrissy. I uh, hope you and Ernie have a great day, and I hope you get to enter in another tournament here soon. Hopefully. All right. Have a good one. Thank you. Obviously emotional. She's had a tough week. I'm not going to put her personal business out there, but uh, if you're a praying person, pray for her and her family, please. All right, let's put this fish up here real quick. Let's see it. Boom, 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 boom. <laughs> and not one fish talked the whole tournament. No. No. Somebody, er, 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 er. somebody said you missed a few super chats, but I didn't see any. No, I, I didn't oh, see any. 18. And she awesome. said he's going to put him back. Awesome. We'll come That's back to you in just a work. second. Right now, we're going to visit with Miss Pontoon Jody. 
Great job today. What an awesome fish you got. That 29-pound flathead, I I would be blessed to catch one that like that. I had a good time. I want to thank you for putting the tournament on. I met a lot of new people, made some friends, and everyone's been so welcoming. And uh, I just love watching the shows. I've been watching them a long time. I just never spoke up in chat or anything. But uh, I just love the catfishing community. I love to catfish and get out here and have a good time. And congratulations to Bex. You showed up and you showed out. She sure did. It's on that personal best two times. Yeah. Yeah. And you, uh, I mean, I hope you picked up some new subscribers from this because I've seen, you know, you started to, to catch some big fish and, uh, you know, a lot of people can relate to, to your fishing style, you know, being in a pontoon, people love your shirt. They keep saying, I love your shirt. <laughs> you might have to put those up for sale. <laughs> I'm going to give one away on Avid show. Oh, okay. So y'all make sure you go check out Avid show. When is that going to be? I'm not sure if it's, uh, I think it's the next weekend. Okay, cool. Make sure you check that out if you like that meow kitty cat shirt right there. <laughs> and I have to tell you, Miss Jody, there's somebody in there that says, proud of you, Pontoon Jody. Hashtag, you go, Mom. <laughs> oh, that's one of my girls. Ashley or Laura. <laughs> <laughs> well, thank you. And uh, we know this won't be your last one, so... Uh, Thank you for participating and thank you for coming on my show. I appreciate you. Thank you. All right. Bye-bye. Y'all be safe. Appreciate it. All right. And last but certainly not least, we have day one champions. I'm going to say champions because it was definitely a team effort today. <laughs> yeah. yeah. And when you said ladies, I was like, well, all right, Stevan, you got to take a break for a bit. I'll take a break, Stevan. You gotta take a break. I love you, but I'm gonna bring a lady with me. <laughs> Bex, queen of the Iron Cat, she can officially claim that now because she has two Iron Cat champions championships. She has the biggest uh, catfish caught in an Iron Cat, and I almost got the most. You almost did it. Two more fish, and you would have beat the 29 fish record. <laughs> I'm happy. I'm happy with what happened today. I was yeah. Uh, you have, you have nothing was, to not be happy about. <laughs> yeah, I'm pretty happy. Um, sorry, DC plane. No, um, gotta leave something. Gotta leave something for next time. Yeah, and that's right. So whoever wins tomorrow, Bex will challenge in a fish off to claim the grand championship best female iron cat angler officially. But today, officially. officially, you are the best iron cat female angler. Well, the best iron cat angler. I mean, you've got the biggest fish and you've won twice more than anybody else. So you are the best iron cat angler. Oh, <laughs> I don't do well with that much, uh, Attention, but I will say that you guys taught me how to fish. Um, I'm overwhelmed with the support of this community. Um, this community gives me hope. Like It's just a, an amazing uh, group of people who look after each other. So thank you for letting me be a part of it. Mm -hmm. Pete's Whisker says, I am a Bex groupie officially. Mike Yay. Murillo said, reigning, defeated, undefeated, and undisputed Iron Cat champion. <laughs> did you get a chance to um put a uh, do the download or whatever of their 60 pound like you could like put a, a the screenshot up there were you able to get one i mean um yeah i, th I thought i did i not do it I, I remember seeing the 56 but i'm not sure if you i saw the, the, the double up picture the two of them oh John yeah I, that's right mike turner sent it to me yeah if you don't have it yeah, it's okay yeah. but i thought maybe it'd be a neat thing to show them that 60 pounder I'm gonna have to start doing like go, lifting weights. Those fish are heavy. You, you started today. What are you talking about? Yeah. That's right. <laughs> yes, I did it. get it. Mike Turner sent it to me. I just never uh, put it on the computer, but I got it right here. Hang on, hang oh. on. There it is. We gotta see that sucker one more time. 
So here, here's the 56 that she caught today. There's the 56, and here's the 60 pounder. Look at that. What? <laughs> I can't believe it. I can't believe it either. That's a giant fish in any water. I don't care who you are. Oh my gosh. Come on, Kevin. Get there. We go. <laughs> chunky wiggle wiggle rod. Both of them are on chunky wiggle wiggle. Yeah, absolutely. Well, I mean, you you are definitely a um a feat, uh what do you call it? An ultimate challenge. You have drawn a lot of attention. And so <laughs> I hate to say it, but people are gonna be coming after you now. All right. You've won well, you've won two Iron Cats, you've won the Glizzy Challenge. What else have you won? I like hugs and high fives. <laughs> 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 well, you Ms. definitely Becca? picked up people that said that that they are on uh they're on your bandwagon now, you know. So I appreciate y'all. Yeah, a hundred pound over a hundred pounds of fish with two fish. You're yeah. fine. Go ahead, say it again. Oh, I was gonna say something special for me is that when the, on the last Iron Cat, Seven was in um in the hospital. So I've actually gotten fish with bets on both of her iron cats, and it's been so much fun. Really, like super, just like the memories from both of them now are just amazing. And thank you for giving us that, Kevin. No, I mean you could do it any time, but I'm glad that you did it on Palmetto Cats. Yeah. <laughs> and eventually, eventually, when I get moved and everything, and they're able to start fishing the river and stuff, I want to have a Becca versus Becca. Done. Let's do it. I'm ready. I think that'd be kind of cool. I'm ready. <laughs> I mean, you're probably, you know, you're going to win it like hands down, but the name sounds great. The, the Battle of the Beccas. <laughs> exactly. <laughs> With an X in there somewhere. <laughs> <laughs> so for everybody who's watching, we still have 142 people watching. So we lost about 40 prize hunters. That's okay. <laughs> but uh, I always love it. That's actually one of my favorite parts is to see how many people leave and then see how many this core group that just loves and supports everybody that stays. I think see, this awesome. is where you pull out the boat. You know, yeah, the that's one that's where I go. The <laughs> yes, we're giving away a hundred thousand. <laughs> Hey, Becca, remind me of that tomorrow to hold one, hold a prize. To hold one game. really good one. Yeah. I mean, they're all great, I, but yeah. Well, we have we have a couple big ones for tomorrow. So, uh, so those of you who are here, remember that. Remember to stay for after the interview. <laughs> but um, so just for everybody who's watching, so this is this is the way we're not giving away my boat, Brian. <laughs> Calm down. Uh, so just remember. That to the tournament's not over, so uh, no real loss is the tournament champion for Saturday. Uh, Bonnie and Bex will be getting the first place medal. Um, Pontoon Jody will be his second place because she caught more fish and a bigger fish, and then Chrissy Brown is third place today. So all these ladies will be getting the medal. Um, and then uh, tomorrow we have four more anglers. Miss um, Be Rebecca from Carolina Real Screamers. We have Miss Lisa the Fishing Chick, Miss Catfish and Katie Collins, and we have Miss Lizabella Kirkpatrick from Angler Holics, who will be fighting for the opportunity to challenge Bex for the grand champion. I might even I like the medals, but that might be a trophy. I don't know. We'll see. We'll let the winner decide. Ooh. We'll let the winner decide. Stakes just went up here. So Bex wants the trophy. I can see that oh already. <laughs> Boom! DC Metro Angler said Team Bex. Thanks, DC. You're awesome, man. All right. So that'll be it. Uh Miss Becca, anything, any last words before we go for today? Just always be thankful for what you know what God put on this earth. And if he hadn't done that, there wouldn't be nobody fishing. You know, and just never take anything for granted, you know, enjoy the beauty of, of the fishing and the, you know, the camaraderie of all these great people. And cause it really is a truly special thing. Awesome. Awesome. 
So, uh, and then the last thing, uh, I mean, I should have just ended it right there, but I forgot something. <laughs> uh, okay. I think, I think um, Catfish and Crappy is having a tournament in the morning, if I'm not mistaken. It'll be Lyle Stokes versus Creole Catfishing. Is that right, everybody? Nobody? Bueller? Anybody? <laughs> I, figured, I figured Mud Tramp would know that. <laughs> you know, oh, I've, been, you. I've been really swamped here lately, so I'm kind of, um, I I'm kind of a little bit behind. Well, I think, I think Mark, yes, thank you. Mark from Catfish and Crappy. Check him out tomorrow morning. Um, there he's having a 1v1 Lyle Stokes versus Creole Catfishing tomorrow morning. Yeah. And after that's over, you come check us out here and watch these the other ladies uh, tear it up on the on the rivers and lakes. And then um, September 18th, since Bob is in here, remember, he does another tournament coming up, the Fish a Wish tournament. All right, y'all, I'm going to pray us out, and we're going for the evening. I'm going to go get order some pizza. Heavenly Father, thank you for an awesome day. Thank you for blessing us with these women who set the standard for other ladies um, in the catfishing community to step out and, and show them that they can do it. They can go out here and fish, and, and you know they don't really need anybody else. They can do it themselves, and especially Bex, who's learned from the beginning, Lord, that uh, you know you can do it, and it's fun, and it's a way to celebrate the natural resources that you've given us. Well, I pray for everyone in chat. I pray for Miss uh, for Missy that she would heal up. I pray pray for Christy and her family, and uh, I just pray for everyone, Lord. I pray that everyone would uh, get along and be happy, and come back tomorrow. And uh, pray this all in your name, Amen. Amen. Right. I tend to get long winded with those, so I had to cut them off there. <laughs> All right, y'all. Uh, everybody in chat, thank you for showing up. Until until tomorrow, happy fishing. Pops, my heart.